is this song? <laughs> okay, I didn't realize that there was a lyric version to the opening music. But, um, hello. Hello, everyone. <laughs> Wow. Well, I'll show it off. I'll show it off. Um, once we get past our like talking bit. But hello, everyone. Welcome. Welcome to my playthrough of Resetier. I think that's how you pronounce it, anyway. <laughs> Reset Resetier. Something like that. Anyway, if you've never heard of this game before, uh, we're in for a good time today. <laughs> Um, so how I heard about this, uh, game was that I actually saw someone else play it, and when I was watching it, I was like, oh my god, this feels like a game that I would love. <laughs> it's about earning money, you know? And I, I love money, so... <laughs> I thought that we would spend today trying to see if we can win. <laughs> But hello! Hi everyone! Look at all this money! <laughs> Look, our stocks are going up today. <laughs> Hopefully. Um, but yeah, hi everyone! Welcome to the stream. Uh, we're probably gonna have a great time today, or we're gonna just suffer. <laughs> Either way, uh, I hope you guys look forward to this, because I'm gonna be playing it for hours, probably. <laughs> um, but yeah! Uh, so, let me just get started and be like, okay, um, so hi, is the internet working well right now? I don't want to, like, start before we get, like, you know, interruptions and whatever, but hello, hello everyone. <laughs> I'm very excited. Reseteer is actually quite an old game. I think it came out in, like, I, I guess it was 2007 or something like that. It's, it's not a recent game. But uh, with the recent Steam sale, it actually went on discount, and I was like, Oh my god! I gotta get it now! I gotta get it now! <laughs> so, yeah. Gotta do that. Andrew Tate, don't even mention that horrible person here. <laughs> ah! Okay, so before you get really into this, um, I want to just ask how the uh, volume is and everything. Uh, you guys just heard the, the incredible singing that was going on before, um, but I want to make sure that everything is good first before we truly get started. <laughs> um, like, would you want the music to be louder or softer? Obviously, th there is some voice acting in this, I think, uh, but I think most of it isn't voice acted, so I'll do my best. I'll do my best today for you guys. <laughs> um, as for sound... Uh, I think that's fine. Is the music too loud? I just want to know. <laughs> but, um, yeah, we're in for a good time. And if you know absolutely nothing about this game, I think that's the best way to go into it. <laughs> um, but before... Before that happens, I think we should wait until the loading screen plays the opening cutscene again. Cause I think I think you wanna watch. <laughs> I think you'll wanna watch what it's like. But um yeah, I'm really excited to play Reseteer. Um this won't be like completely blind because I did Oh, here we go. Let's watch this opening cutscene first. <laughs> Yes, money. A terry, uh, a tale. Whoops, a tale of a fairy and a girl. Reseteer, let's go. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I've been listening to this so many times while waiting for the stream to start. I don't know, when I saw this game, I was like, Oh my god, the art style is so cute! Lately, I've been really into the, uh, I guess, 
90s slash 2000s anime art aesthetic. <laughs> I don't know. Let's return to nostalgic art. <laughs> so, um, as you can see, there are like dungeon elements and also just like shopkeeping elements to this game. So, yeah, we'll, we'll try our best. We'll try our best and uh, actually beat this game today if we can. <laughs> but if not, I'm, I'm sure. I'm sure the path to victory will be very tough. <laughs> yeah, but I, I really like the art. Also, you like the avatar? Yeah! So, uh, I put the link in the description of the, the VOD, but this avatar was made by Avi. Uh, go check them out. <laughs> I really love the model. Ah, oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Alright, well, I guess it's time to get started. <laughs> I'm very excited for this game, and I hope you guys enjoy it too. Um, I will say, like, I did test out the game a little bit, so I'm not going into it completely blind. I just wanted to know how the mechanics and everything would work, and if it, um, the controls and everything on my controller was going to work very well. So, it's all good. I think I figured it out. Um, I'm not going to be using a guide or anything. In fact, I haven't really looked at any guides on how to, like, play this game. So we're just gonna go for it and uh, try our best. <laughs> oh, there's no voice acting. <laughs> there was only a little line. Okay. Oh, for the love of... <sighs> She's still asleep. Look at the little mushroom thing in the back. It's so cute. Um, so this is... Tear. <laughs> tear? Tear? I don't know. But do you think it should be tear or tear? <laughs> Does she really not understand how important today is? Mur- Murple- What? <laughs> Murple? Murple. Ah, Connie, another bite. I can always find room for yummy candy. Nimble Wurble. <laughs> what the girl? What the is the girl saying? Okay, and this girl's called Reset. Res reset. Reset. <laughs> Wake up, please. This girl, look, we're matching. We're matching with our little side ponytail. Isn't that cute? <laughs> she, she was meant to be me. <laughs> we do not have time for good morning, Reset. You planning on spending the rest of your life dreaming of sweets? Today is the day we set for opening the store. Uh, we did? Oh yeah, we did. Murde. Wait, what? what is that language? Mur Murde? Murde? Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. <laughs> Murde. Of all the... Listen, go wash your face and make yourself presentable. And then join me downstairs in the storefront. Okay, I'll be right down. Look at my cute bedroom. We're like floating in the sky. <laughs> hey! Sorry I kept you waiting. Oh, how's the, how's the volume? I feel like... Oh, no, 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 do not skip the event. I feel like her voice is, like, really soft compared to the music, but I don't know if that's just me. Okay, Tear, let's open the shop right now. Capitalism Ho! Everyone, please write Capitalism Ho in the chat. <laughs> we gotta get into the mindset, right? We gotta get into the grind. <laughs> we got money to make. Patience reset. It is a virtue you will need. We need to take care of a few matters before we open officially. Huh? Huh? Like what? Well, I somehow doubt that a store without anything to sell is going to attract all that much business. Uh... Well, how about I sell you? <laughs> oh yeah, we don't have anything to sell. Uh... 
So, uh, what do we do? To start with, we need to establish the stock of items for the store. If we get nothing to sell, we can't claim to be much of a shop. That's true. Hmm. So, where should we go to get stocked up? The best way, I think, would be to visit either the town market or the merchant's guild. We need to give our regards to the head of the guild regardless, so that should probably be our first stop. Oh, that's the place run by that old guy, right? The guild operates as a wholesaler for local merchants. So if we stop by, we can purchase the initial stock. It would prove... Oh, it would not hurt to grow... Grow up? Grow up? What did she just say? <laughs> it would... I... I... I'm sorry, once the, once the word leaves the screen, I don't remember what she said. <laughs> uh, give out polite regards to the guild chief, either. Especially since the guild is the organization that allows us to operate here in the first place. Okay, got it. Then let's go right now! When you want to leave the shop, head to the front door, currently located in the upper right hand corner of the store. Leave through the window like an action hero. Reset is insane. <laughs> She's like, yeah, property damage. <laughs> Let's go to eternity and reset. Do not say a copyrighted line, <laughs> even as a parody. Oh, okay. Okay, so what I saw of this game, I'm like, Reset, you are insane. <laughs> and that's really fun. Look at me go! Whee! Alright, so this is our, uh, our shop. And, uh, we gotta leave now. So, there's like a couple of areas in here. Um, but we can only go to the Merchant's Guild right now. A girl and a fairy. You two are... Yes, you're Reset and that loan shark. Uh, well, that is not... Well, an incorrect assessment. Could you... Uh, could I ask you for a refrain from calling me a loan shark? That's right, mister. She and I are partners. Don't be mean. She may be <laughs> extorting me out of a huge amount of money. But, that doesn't mean we're not partners. <laughs> forgive me, forgive me. Partners it is. So, how are the preparations for running that shop coming along? Quite well, thank you. In fact, we plan on opening today. So, we stopped by in order to show our gratitude for your help. Ha, ah, very good. You two know what's what. If you have any problems, let me know. I'll be glad to help. We appreciate your kindness. Thank you. Maybe I should give Tyr like a more uh, sexy voice. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, we appreciate your kindness. Thank you very much. Not a problem at all. So you came straight here to pick up some merchandise, right? Well, up to the counter then. Let's get you two sorted. This is our first time stocking up. Our funds are limited. So do not go completely overboard. I recommend purchasing no more than 10 items. Kayo! Partners in debt. So true. <laughs> oh god. Uh, time to stock up a bit. A eh? Step on up. Okay, so... There's a bunch of, like, tutorial stuff in here. So... I think for now... Let's just do the relevant stuff. <laughs> uh, what is the guild? If there's anything you don't know, just ask. Guildmaster. Right, so, a guild is essentially a group of people in the same kind of business who cooperate with one another. Since the prices on items can vary from store to store, it's hard to do business if there isn't a base price between them, right? That's what the Merchant's Guild is for. We manage wholesaling and keep prices stable throughout the city. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> That's why we require that everyone who wants to do business around here register with the guild. Don't worry, your store, Reseteer... <gasps> oh my god, I just put to that... I just... What the heck am I stupid? <laughs> I just put that to 
together. It's both of our names. Oh my god, it's like a ship name. <laughs> Can you imagine writing a story and being like, Oh my god, wait, that, that, that's me! Wait a second, I'm like, oh, can you imagine having a ship name as your store? That's literally what I did. My my merch store is Komahina.com. I'm, I'm, you know what? This game really was made for me. <laughs> the store is the ship and my store is Komahina.com. It's so perfect. <laughs> wow. If this game wasn't, wasn't just like created for me to experience. Anyway, whatever. Reseteer is already in the books. It ain't all just paperwork and red tape though. Now that you're a member, you can pick up stock for your shop here and you get access to a few other benefits too. We're here to help, so feel free to make use of us, okay? What can I do here? Here at the guild, you'll always be able to get goods for a set price. Most of what we can get our uh, most of what we get our hands off is practical stuff though. Weapons, armor, clothes, adventuring necessities, and the like. The town's main market, uh, who we work with, is where you can get things like foodstuffs, books, and other assorted knickknacks. The really flashy and rare stuff is a bit out of our league. If you've uh, if you've a mind to get your mitts on that kind of stuff, you'll have to go to the dungeon stomping yourself, or buy it off a customer. Oh, we'll also buy off any extra stuff you have. Mine, we buy low as a rule, so if you want to make actual profit, you're better off selling up to your customers. Nice. Alright, so basically we buy stuff here and then sell it for more. <laughs> About merchant levels. Your merchant level is, well, your ability as a merchant. As it goes up, you'll figure out how to redecorate or even expand your store. Heck, you might even be able to convince me to let you have some, uh, have a look at some of our more, uh, premium items. <laughs> so, how do you raise your level? Simple. Buy, sell, trade. This is an art, and you learn by doing. Alright, about the town. This city's getting a bit famous for the old ruins, and the like that litter the surrounding countryside. So, we've been getting, uh, seeing a steady stream of adventuring types coming in for a while now. They're all here to strike it uh, rich of undiscovered treasures in the wild, hunting for fat loot, <laughs> they call it. <laughs> fat! Ah, <Aw>, damn. <laughs> Wait, when was this localized? Did, <laughs> I feel like that's more of a recent term, fat. Fat loot. <laughs> you want that fat loot? Well, I don't know what they see in chasing after oversized loots, but their presence has also brought a lot of new merchants to the city. I sure won't complain, business has never been better. If you're looking for one, a few might be resting in the plaza. I bet most of them will take to the city's biggest pub though. It's never too hard to sell those wandering types a little bit of liquid. Pleasure. Even I go in there for a little nip every now and then. The more faithful will probably hang out about the city's chapel. <laughs> we do get a few like that now and again on a pil uh, pilgrimage or quest to find old holy relics. Er, praise be to the seekers and all that, of course. He's like, I'm atheist. <laughs> you might check the Adventurers Guild proper too. They're in charge of making sure exploration efforts aren't total bedlam. They even succeed, sometimes. Now keep in mind that these places are only open at certain times. For example, the pub only opens in the evening. We're pretty much open all the time though. Wait, if you're always open, how do you find time to visit that pub? For that matter, when do you go home? Little Missy, if you have the kind of wife I do. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh no. You'd be at work. Or in the souls at all hours too. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> He's like, girl, <laughs> I don't love my wife. <laughs> she scares me. Oh my god, that's so funny. This is a tutorial text, isn't it? Murdy, forget I asked. If there's anything you don't know, just ask. How about your wife? <laughs> Can we ask about your wife? <laughs> Um, we'll, we'll do these two later. <laughs> He's like, girl, if you found, if you saw my wife, you, you'd want to work forever too. 
<laughs> All right, so we're gonna buy some stuff now. Um, there's a bunch of like different kinds of things here. Um, but I'm gonna I'm just gonna buy like one of each of the cheapest thing for now, just to start if I can. Um. Oh, I don't have enough money! No! Ah, uh, I can't buy a hat! <laughs> okay, well... I'll buy the, um... I'll buy the armband. Then. How much stuff did I buy? Okay, well... That's it for now. <laughs> right then, will that be all? We shall return when our stocks run low again. Ha, <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. Here, a little something extra as a startup gift. <gasps> bread! Yes! Let's get that bread, guys! <laughs> Yay, want that bread! Thanks a bunch! Alright, Lily, give him your all! Capitalism! Ho! Yeah, ho like my wife! <laughs> Well, uh, who the heck is Adam Smith? <laughs> well, Adam Smith would be proud of us at any rate. Who's Adam Smith? <laughs> that sounds like a real person. Um, so yeah, we'll be able to visit these other areas later. Um, but for now, let's go back to our shop. Very well. It's time to give you a crash course on the basics of running an item shop. Okay, what did I do first? First, we need to put some items on display. If we do not have goods out for people to see, we can hardly expect the customers to buy them, after all. So, I just need to get neither of these counters? Just so. Once you know where you wish to place something, choose what you wish to place in that spot by pressing the primary button. P p p primary button? Wait, what the hell are you talking about? You will understand when you try it, trust me. This is for the player to know. <laughs> now remember, what you place will affect how store, oh, how people perceive the store. So think carefully before you place something. Ooh, right. Now then, to start off, why not line up what we purchased on one of the counters? Hi. Okay. By the way, Reset is like, I don't know, what is she like, ten or something? <laughs> Bye, my sword. My dagger! Reset, may I speak with you a moment? Sure, what is it? Those windows by the count- Oh, the count is by the window. The items you place there are visible to anyone passing by on the street. As such, putting eye-catching items, the sort of thing that makes you think, I want to buy this more than anything on those counters, is a core principle of running a shop like this. Everyone loves window shopping, Reset. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta learn about the c economy today. <laughs> In a very real way, those counters are the face of the shop, and what is placed there greatly affects interest in our business. So choose what to place there very, very carefully. Wow, I never thought about it like that. Okay, Ho okay, okay. <laughs> what the? Heck? Okay, I'll be careful. I'll be careful, me. So, our shop, we want to show off danger. That's why we got a sword there. Oh, but you know what? A dagger is very dangerous, so you gotta have a glove, you know, to protect your hands. Uh, you also gotta have some clothes, you know? No one wants to walk outside naked. Or <laughs> and uh, here, bread, you know, food essential for life. And then we'll put all this stuff here. Do I have anything else? All right, that should do for displaying our wares. Are you sure it doesn't look dumb? I... Do not worry. Everything looks good enough for a first attempt. It sucks, but uh, it's okay, I guess. <laughs> now, I need to teach you how to actually sell things. Please go sit at the counter. right on. Well then, the items are in place, and now you need to learn how to actually sell things 
to people without embarrassing yourself, Reset. That's very important, okay? <laughs> Don't be cringe, Reset. But, but cringe is all I know. <laughs> okay, all. See, see right there. We see right there, Reset. That's cringe. Oh. So to start with, I will lecture on the actual process of selling an item we have displayed. Yes, Professor. If the students do not listen, they do not get any credit. Uh, uh, right. Now then, when a customer enters, be sure to greet them with a nice big welcome. Uh, um, welcome! Greeting the customer helps them to feel comfortable and relaxed. Oh my god. Do you guys... Is that true? <laughs> when when I enter a shop, right, and someone goes like, Oh, welcome! Welcome to our shop! I feel like immediately on edge. I'm like, oh, 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 Hi, oh, oh, I'm just browsing. They're like, do you need any help with anything? I'm like, oh, 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 I'm just looking. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, I'll, I'll call you if I need help. And I'm like, okay, have a good time. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> do you like it when a person says hi to you in a shop or do you prefer to be left alone until you need somebody? <laughs> While in the store, their comfort, uh, their comfort is fundamental to our business. Remember that as we continue. Now, a typical customer will find any item, uh, an item they want on our displays, and then they will come over to the counter to pay for it. Let me demonstrate. Uh, um, uh, uh. What they want will be in the target window. Long sword, base price, 1,200. You will also be able to see the name and base price. Pay close attention to that base price. Also, if you press button 3, you can view the expanded information. So I think that's uh, the X button on the Xbox controller. On the item in question. Consult the... <laughs> Peter, what are you talking about? <laughs> it's like, never mind that. Consult the custom.exe program included with Resetier if you wish to check or alter your button configuration. Wait, wait! But button 3? Custom.exe? What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> Focus reset! Never mind that! That's not for you to understand! <laughs> your life is hard enough <laughs> to control as it is! Girl, your life is spiraling! Uh, okay. Now then, next, you must decide what price you wish to offer. In general, you want to try and name a price prior than the base. Try naming a price, if you will. Uh, Lessie. What the heck is Lessie? <laughs> Oops! You likely noticed that the base price serves as your default. To raise your offer, press up. Press up? Okay. So. <laughs> Give me all your money, Tear! Give me all your money! <laughs> I want. I want it all! Give me the millions! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Give me all your money! That's tutorial! I'm gonna make as much money as I can. <laughs> yes, very good. That is how you adjust your offer. As might be obvious, if a customer is satisfied with your offer, it is a sale, and you get a little bit of experience along with the money. If your price is too high, however, a customer can simply walk out. Ah! Learning how to determine the proper price, there lies the challenge. Now, if a customer disagrees with the price, but not so much that they want to storm out, then you can negotiate. Remember what I said about comfort earlier? That is the key here. Offer a price, but do not make it so outrageous that a customer feels you are not acting in good faith. So, if they disagree, but stay, offer a new price. Ideally, you will lower your offer a little, and they will take it and give you a sale. Some customers may just be trying to sniff out a better price, when they are really willing to pay your initial price. However, whether or not you risk testing that possibility is up to you. How long can you keep haggling? Well, that depends on how regular a customer the person in question is. As we are starting out, you will, be uh, you will not be able to haggle for very long. But after customers begin to trust you a little, you can haggle for a longer period of time. <laughs> it's like, I want it for 500. No! A thousand. No! 600. No! 900. No! 
We're haggling today, guys! We're gonna show off our business skills. <laughs> well, time to put that theory into practice. Um, okay. Uh, welcome! Can I get this, please? Okay. I pick a price, right? Needs to be higher than the base price. Um, that button, uh... Okay. Uh, give it to me for 200%. I want 200%. Oh dear, if you try to charge this much, the customer is likely to throw the item in your face and storm out. Okay, that's too much. <laughs> How about 150? At this level, you will likely end up haggling a little. Alright then, now for the fine art of haggling. Theoretically, what you wish to do is lower your price slowly. But as I mentioned, there is a limit to how long you can haggle. The idea is to deduce a customer's desired price and go from there. Uh, you say deduce a desired price, but how do I... A large number of stores sell at about 30% over base price. Damn. We're learning the truth, <laughs> truth behind the stores. It's not a hard and fast rule, but people will usually accept that price level. You Usually. If you can manage to go over that, you will make a lot of money, but... You do not want to risk driving away a customer. Right then, so as a customer, I am haggling. Could you make it a little bit cheaper? Okay, gotta make it cheaper, but not too cheap. Um... How about... How about... How about 140? Oh my god, they have 69! <laughs> yeah, perfect price, perfect price. This is technically cheaper, but still high. It would have it would be up to the temperament of the customer as to whether or not you make a sale. Well, that just about covers everything. Now, let us put the entire lecture into practice all at once. If you can sell me an item, you'll be ready for what lies ahead. Let us begin. Okay, I I don't think I can sell that high right now. Hello, welcome to Reseteer! I would like this, please. Alright. Well, she said 130. So let's go with 130. Yes, an excellent price. Thank you so much! I could have charged higher. <laughs> Yay! I sold, I sold Steel Sword for the blah 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 blah. <laughs> excellent. Let us do that one more time, just to be sure. Okay, good. I would like this, please. Alright, let's try 40 on her. I don't think I could charge this to a real customer. That seems kind of expensive, but we can try. Hmm, could you go a little lower, perhaps? How about this much? Hmm, could you go a little lower, perhaps? How about this much? Yes, an excellent price. <laughs> so basically, the game is all about this. It's all about trying to get the best price. And we're gonna do our best. <laughs> we're gonna do our best! Add 69 to the end of everything. <laughs> Expertly done. If you ever wish to practice again, simply ask me. Anytime we are in the shop. Alright. Here we go. And that is essentially how it goes. You are quite good for someone who has never done this before. Oh, thank you. You know... <laughs> Uh, I've never worked, like, a, a job like this before, where I'm selling stuff, but I have worked in, like, um, hospitality in the sense that I worked at a fast food chain once. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, you can't really haggle at a fast food chain. <laughs> <laughs> really? Then again, I think most shops wouldn't allow you to haggle, so... We still have a little bit of time left today, so let us go ahead and open the store proper. If anyone comes in, simply handle them in the same way that we just practiced. Well, are you sure I'll be okay? Do not worry. As the saying goes, salesmanship is more of an art than it is a science. You'll learn as you go. Now then, I will open up. Go on and sit at the counter. Okie day! Oh my god, a mother. <laughs> a mother right off the bat. Welcome! 
this, please? I I need bread. <laughs> well, how about how about this for bread? As the housewife in charge of the family finances, I can't back down here. How about this much? That's just fine, thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much! I sold it! Yeah, buddy! Our first sale. This is the start. The start of our money making journey. <laughs> Congratulations, you did well! I. I sold stuff! I. Me! Reset! I sold stuff! Like. To people! <laughs> Oh, what what is this rush? <laughs> it's like money. <laughs> wow, kind of kind of love the feeling of money. <laughs> hey, Tear, I I'm so happy. I I did it, Tear. I did it, Papa. I did it. Is her dad dead? Oh, and that's how we started running an item shop. Oh! You're wondering why we started an item shop at all? Well, to explain that, you need to understand how Tyr and I first met. We're gonna be Byakuya rich, so true. <laughs> Easy Game Station presents... Oh, wait, this is just the opening again. Well, never mind. We don't have to watch the opening again, do we? And how to run an item shop. Oh, never mind. It's not the opening. Look at it. Oh my god. Look at us. We're so cute. I mean, Tyr might be trying to, like, take all my money, but, like, that's okay, right? <laughs> been three months since Papa left. <laughs> Papa went to get some milk and I guess he just never came back. I didn't get why he suddenly said, I'm gonna be a hero. And then he took off without saying he'd even, uh, when he'd even be back. I really hope he's okay. I'm getting lonely. What the hell, Dad? <laughs> well, I shouldn't worry too much about him. The best thing about him is how tough he is. He'll be okay. Yeah, it's not like he's a terrible dad for leaving me alone at home without anyone. <laughs> Do I have a mom? What? Papa wouldn't knock. Who is that? Hi. Yes, who is it? What? Uh huh? Nobody's here. Wait, what? At my feet? Good evening. Um... Are you Mademoiselle Reset Lemongrass? Lemongrass? Okay, is this game French? <laughs> Mademoiselle? Are we in France? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Everything's connected to school days. <laughs> we went to France, everybody! Lemongrass? Um, Miss Fairy? Pardon me, but I'm the one asking the questions here, alright, Ken? Again, are you Reset Lemongrass? Uh, um, yes, I'm Reset. My name is Tyr. I'm an agent from the Term Finance Company. Term A? I, I don't know how to pronounce French words! Finance? here to collect payment on a loan paid out to your father. Here's the contract and my identification. Uh... Loan? Repayment? I... Uh... In plain terms, I'm here to get our money back. If you are incapable of facilitating repayment, this house will be seized as collateral in order to repay the loan. F facilitate Collateral? S I, Papa, I, I, Papa, Papa isn't. 
he's not here. Yes, I see that now. <laughs> it's like, uh, sorry kid, but I have no mercy. <laughs> Whoa, what the hell? Is that my dad? Monsieur Lemongrass disappeared following a... Uh, oh my god, French? <laughs> Fr fracas? <laughs> fracas? I don't know. Atop a lo local volcano. So we assumed he might have returned here. File photo? <laughs> Why was that a label? Even though he has not. Uh, even if he has not, however, the contract covers the eventuality. Uh, covers this? Quite. As the sole remaining member of this household, we shall require that you pay his debts in his stead. In his steed? In his stead? Oh, 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 ah! But oh, that, how am I supposed to? I barely have enough money to live by, by myself. I do not care. <laughs> I do not care that you were abandoned. I need money now. Naturally, we are not demanding it. We, uh, it will be repaid at once. There is still a small amount of time before any payment is due. Therefore, am, am I gonna get sold off in parts to distant foreign lands to repay Papa's debts? <laughs> Child trafficking? Human trafficking? I mean, oh my god. This girl's insane. <laughs> How did she like jump to this conclusion? She's like, I'm gonna die! <gasps> Maybe if I eat a lot of spinach, that can replace my blood and... Oh, but I don't want to be a sailor. I don't want to be Popeye. <laughs> what am I gonna do? What the hell are you talking about, girl? <laughs> um, please listen to me for a moment. I have no clue where you're getting these ludicrous ideas from. But I would never do such a thing. Quite the opposite, in fact. I was sent here to ensure that you wouldn't have to resort to such... Well, absurd methods to pay us back. Although, if you can't, well, then maybe I'll take an organ or two. <laughs> uh, but what? I've been sent to support you to the fullest of my ability, so that you may be repaid the debt via labor. What? Child labor? <laughs> what? what? But I never worked a single day in my life! Experience has no bearing in this case. All that matters is whether or not you are willing to work. Oh. If you do not wish to work, then that's it. The house is Termes. Terme, Terme, whatever. That company's. And I will have to ask you to leave the premises. As the saying goes, those who do not work do not eat. <laughs> it's like, girl, get your life together. <laughs> so, Miss Lemongrass, which will it be? Work or the house? Aww. I'll work then. Blended. But, but, but I don't even know what I could do. Actually, I already have an idea of that front. You're aware, of course, that this city is an adventuring hub. In addition, this house faces out onto one of the main city lanes. Therefore... I propose converting the house into an item store. A item store? Oh, what? Really? Are you expecting this to be more silly? It's just capitalism! <laughs> We're in debt! You're like, oh, Resitude, that's cute. They're like, partners? No, she's literally asking me for money back. Resitude? Uh, Reset? Reset? <laughs> Why did you name the shop after a ship name? <laughs> uh, Mademoiselle Lemongrass? What the hell? I was only gone for a little while to do market research. Where could she have gone? <sighs> I'm nearly silly. Of course she fled. Why would she not? All I did was threaten to take away everything she ever knew and loved. Asking her to turn the house into an item shop was foolish. Even if it was to repay the debt. The poor girl must be terribly confused. And on top of that, her father is probably... Well, he probably died, but that's not our problem. <laughs> Wait. Outside? <laughs> bonk, bonk, bonk. <laughs> Yatus! 
Yadis? Yadis, it's done! Tia! Hey, Tia! Look, it's done! What is that? It's our shop sign, of course. Doesn't it look cool? You can't be a shop without one of these, you know? Yes, well, it is quite well made, however. <laughs> I've always been good at making stuff. Be that as it may, while the sign is nice, I... Hmm. Why the heck is it a ship name? <laughs> huh? Is there a problem? Well, the name. You are quite sure you have thought that through. Well, we're partners, right? You said so. So I put reset and tear together and... Reset tear! Isn't it me? Well... That is to say, the sentiment is commendable, but... It's the two of us opening the store. The new name should reflect that, right? You don't like it? Really, it's not that, but, well, that is... <laughs> then it's decided! Recipe your ho! Did you call me a ho? No. <laughs> Recipe Mispronounce it and even slight oh mispronounce it even slightly and re Reketeer Reket Reket Reketeer Racket I I'm I'm gonna assume that the it made more sense in Japanese. <laughs> this job is going to be even more absurdly difficult than I originally suspected, I fear. Okay, I can I think I can figure oh never mind. And so, a fairy suddenly entered my life. One thing for sure, this wasn't gonna be dull. This sure wasn't gonna be dull. I was gonna say, well now I think I figured out how they decided the names of these two characters. They wanted a pun to work. <laughs> no day. How is it possible to sleep this much each day? How? Oh, racketeering. It's like scamming people with fraud. Oh, <laughs> really? Well, that's great. <laughs> yes! That is our business motto. Fraud. Scam people out of money. not have a good morning hand. Reset, you're the proprietor of an item shop now. You must learn to be responsible and not sleep the day away. <laughs> right. Why in the name of heaven are you smiling so much? You're in debt, girl. That smile you had while sleeping just is just getting bigger. Oh, no reason. I just think I saw something nice in my dreams. Here, let's give it all. Well, if you really are dedicated to making this work, watch yourself and meet me downstairs. Hi. Uh, will do. All right. Now the game begins. <laughs> so I have an item shop and stuff, and it's all cool and awesome. So uh, what do I do now? That is up to your judgment. If you sit at the counter, we can open it immediately, or we can reorganize the shop. Or we could even search for new stock. Around town or somewhere. Or elsewhere. Yikes, that's a ton of options. How do I choose? It is as I said earlier, running a place like this is more an art than it is something you can simply follow a map through. They're saying, like, don't follow a walkthrough. <laughs> simply pick something. We will deal with what comes. Well, okay. Alright, so... Look at that! Isn't that neat? I can change which way I want the, the camera to be. But I'm gonna probably do this top down. Um, so, the lady bought out only food. <laughs> I'm gonna go hungry. So, I'm gonna just replace this uh, thing. And we'll just start! The real game begins here. <laughs> I'm so excited. I hope that intro was fun for you guys. Because, uh, it's, it's just gonna get wild from here. So, for for now, um, I'm just gonna do a save. 
Um, so you can tell here we have basically we have a week. We have a week to get ten thousand money. <laughs> ten thousand money, or we lose. Um, I'm gonna try. So this is the loudest the voice can go. It's not really loud at all, is it? Maybe I should make this softer. Okay. Um, and the encyclopedia just like shows off every item that you have encountered in the game. So that's not too, too important. Alright. Let's go! It's time to make money! <laughs> oh, hi! Welcome, old man! Ah, oh, little lady, how much for this? So as we continue on and we see these characters over and over again, I'm gonna stop voicing it. <laughs> Um, alright, so... Just to start, I want to see if 230, I mean like 130 is actually a good price to go for, or if I should actually go lower. Oh, well, you know what? This is our first day. This is our first day selling stuff. You know, you can have a little bit of a discount. Hmm, well, it is reasonable enough. Thank you so much! You made it, buddy! Yes, money. Ha ha ha. Hi there, what can I get to you? Oh, little lady, how much will this? So they say basically the same thing, so I'm just not gonna, you know, read it out too much. Alright, give it to me for that much. It's not expensive, caught you go a little lower. Okay. A little bit of a discount. <laughs> well, that is reasonable enough. Yeah! Money. <laughs> 269. Unfortunately, I don't think I can sell them that high. I think they'll just walk away. Okay, so basically, you get to sell a little bit of stuff and then you will um, have like breaks in between where you can decide if you want to keep selling or go out and like buy some stuff. But for now, um, I think I'll keep. Uh, well, we could go to the market, I guess. But I don't have that much money to buy stuff anyway, so let's earn a bit more money first. <laughs> so right now, I think my strategy is we'll just keep it around like... 25% <laughs> over. And uh, see how we go with that for now. Okay, never mind. This guy's like, I don't have enough money. <laughs> How's that? Ah, oh, I see. That's a fine price. Okay, so um, while I was practicing this game a little bit earlier, I realized that the way that they like respond to you will give you like hints as to whether it's a good price or not. So he's like, ah, oh, that's a fine price. So I think 120 is like what they would like to pay. So. I think I'll have to keep it around 120 for now. But in the future, I think as the store gets better, you'll be able to charge way more. <laughs> oh wow, only one thing. Okay, well... Uh, should I go buy something? I don't have a lot of money though. I have like 800 coins. Let's just keep going for now. <laughs> Buy my stuff! <laughs> Damn. Okay. Okay, I think 120 is probably the good price to sell it for. We'll just spend the entire first day uh, in the shop, I think. Okay, um, one thing that I did figure out during practice though is that this guy... This guy... <laughs> will pay a lot more for stuff because he's like, whatever. That's That sounds alright. <laughs> so every time we see this guy, we're gonna charge him more. Oh, goddammit! But sometimes this guy will just pay a bit more than other people. 
とうございます。やびー<笑>売れたよ。こんにちは。Yes! Once more! <笑> Once more! Yes, it, it is. <laughs> you know, sometimes I feel like if you go down one, maybe they'll buy it. Buy it! <laughs> money hack! Alright, now we have enough money. Yay! Day one! <laughs> yes, we're gonna, like, try to get as much money out of these people as possible. Reset. May I have a moment, please? Sure, what's up? We have nothing in our shop. <laughs> concerning the debt, I have a suggestion concerning its repayment. You do? Paying it all back at once is wholly beyond your means. So I recommend smaller weekly payments to slowly chip away at it. Wholly beyond? Uh, you know... You never told me how big Papa's debt is exactly. That is because if you found out... Oh, that's because you would faint if you found out. For now, it is a secret. <laughs> it's like, oh, don't, don't you worry your little head. You can't even comprehend how much money you owe. Uh, I'd faint? As the store begins to build up steam, we'll increase payment size. The repayment date nearest to the current date, along with the amount due, will be displayed on the calendar in the main menu. Please be sure to check it regularly. Hey, yeah, uh, I'll keep an eye on it. Yep, so that was uh, basically the 10,000 that we owe. Oh! I have nothing in here, so I gotta go buy stuff. Um. So, we'll be going to the market and the Merchant's Guild and all of these places, but. For now, let's go check out these uh, other places instead of buying stuff. We're going to church because we gotta repent for our capitalism sins. <laughs> hey, Tyr, you came from a finance company, right? What on earth are. <sighs> yes, that's right. I work for Terame ter 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 Finance. I. Sorry. Sorry to any French people watching. I'm probably pronouncing them very wrong. So, you're employed by them, right? What... what's it like? Um, no. That is not quite accurate. I was contracted to Terme through another organization. Thus, I'm not really an employee, per se. So, you're just contracted? I'm surprised. You seem so... It's not all that surprising. Almost all fairies in human society belong to a very specific contract agency. There are, of course, few free agent fairies out there as well, and... So that's how it works. Uh, yes. To tell the truth, it can be difficult for fairies to find employment in human society, so the agencies were founded an age ago in order to help facilitate fairy livelihoods. <laughs> oh no, is she poor too? Everyone's just poor in this this entire game. It's like we're just trying to try to make a living <laughs> and racism. Well, oh no, fairy racism. That's amazing. What? Wow. <laughs> Lore. All right, loud town square. Mm, I love being able to relax in the plaza like this. You never seem to have trouble relaxing, even when we're not in the plaza. Look how charming the buildings look. They're so wacky. They're not straight. They're like... curvy and everything. They're so cute. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's healthy, right? Alright, let's go to the Adventurer's Guild. Hey, what's this place? This is the Adventurer's Guild. The guild manages expeditions to various untamed wilderness. Areas or abandoned ruins near the city. The area is commonly referred to as dungeons. Without approval, adventurers cannot visit the dungeons. So ah, nuts! <laughs> Damn, nuts! So we can't just go into a dungeon and pick up everything we see? If we could do that, we could sell everything we get at 100% profit. It is still a very good idea. A great many people have made fortunes that way. If you wish to do so, however, we must hire an adventurer. Hire? 
Can I just pick anybody? The truth of the matter is a bit more complicated. Even if you pay them, few adventurers are willing to risk their lives simply for the benefit of a complete stranger. Oh, so they turn away people they don't know very well? Indeed, you should first get to know a few adventurers and build up a certain level of trust with them. If all goes well, they will give you a symbol of their guild membership. This usually takes form, uh, the form of a card. With that in hand, we can bring an adventure with us. So, it's like they're inviting us to a dinner party! Uh, well, dinner parties usually do not include mad, uh, blood, blood mad beasts attempting to rip you limb from limb. But the analogy does work somewhat. Right, so first we need to meet an adventurer. Hmm. Which for us should not be that difficult, yes? After all, we run an item shop, so we should get a few coming in as clients as on, uh, on a fairly basis. I I was gonna say fairy basis <laughs> on a fairly irregular basis. Oh yeah! Well then, I'll do my best to get a dinner invitation. Indeed, just be careful that reset is not on the menu. Do not die. Uh-huh. Is something wrong? Well, that guy over there. A new character! Listen to me! If I can't work, I can't get the money! And if I can't get the money, I can't get the items! And if I can't get the items, apparently, well, I can't work! Gah! Too relatable. This is like, you need experience to get a job. But if you don't get a job, how are you gonna get experience? Ah... <sighs> Employment is hard. Twink! <laughs> Is that the first thing you say when you see this guy? <laughs> I'm like, oh man, employment is hard. And you're like, ah, Twink! <laughs> Twink spotted. Obliterate him. Heaven, if I had a few things, I could at least visit the Hall of Trials. I wonder what's going on. He seems to be a rookie adventurer complaining about his inability to complete the required guild test. Test? Well, the guild hardly allows anyone in off the street. Oh god, I missed a- uh, Oh no, there's no log! <laughs> there's no log! I don't think there's a log, I can't read back. Something, like, damn it! Anyway, an item shop owner is hardly the only job with challenges. Hmm. I have an idea. What? I do believe we found our first adventure. Wait, what do you mean? By a, a tear? Wait! Son of a... No, why, why does it keep like skipping lines? Anyway, if I can't get into the guild, I don't know what I'll even do for dinner money. Now I'm hungry. Great. Pardon me a moment. You there. Adventure with the seedy look. Uh, who are you calling seedy? He kind of looks like Nike. <laughs> like, I'm looking at this character design, he kind of looks like Nike to me. <laughs> Reminds you of Naito? Really? He looks more like a Nike to me. <laughs> doesn't doesn't Nike's name even mean like seedling? <laughs> or uh, well, you two would be. We're a pair of merchants who happen to be ha uh, passing by. Merchants? Oh, you heard me talking. Sorry, but I'm way too broke and seedy to buy anything. Believe me, I could tell by your seedy nature that attempting to sell the- what, the what is Tear's problem? Anything would be a colossal waste of time. Come on, Tear, stop with the seedy already. He isn't a plant. So, are you two gonna prune me or what here? Would you like it if we came with you to the Hole of Trials? If you require equipment or items, we can provide them. I call you a pair of angels, but then... Why? Business, naturally. We'll help you pass the trial, if you provide us with your card. Oh, I get it. We help Mr. Swordsman clear the dungeon, and then he gives us his card. A sign of our eternal friendship. Eternal friendship? Is rather irrelevant in this case. But it does work out neatly for us all. 
What do you say? I see. You guys are pretty new at all of this too, huh? I'll offer, Mr. Swordsman. Yes or no? Yeah. Yes. <sighs> Alright then. Heck, I got nothing to lose. <laughs> We're all poor here. <laughs> well, aside from my precious life, anyway. <laughs> Yay for vacations! Yay for vacations! Uh, what the heck did you just say? <laughs> uh, glad to meet you two. Um, I'm Reset. Nice to meet you. Oh my god, I remember talking to my sister yesterday. I was like, I've never heard someone say like awesome sauce before in real life. I feel like Reset is the type of person who would say awesome sauce. She'd be like. Awesome sauce! <laughs> and we'd be like, oh, <laughs> is awesome sauce like a, a a common phrase? I've like never heard it before. <sighs> I remember the first time I heard it, I think it was in the Love Live dub, and I'm like, what the heck is Hanukkah saying? Awesome sauce? <laughs> it's like, what is that? Anyway, I'm Reset, nice to meet you. And I'm Tear. Uh, Call me Louie. Louie the Swordsman. Good to meet ya. Yes, yes. Now then, we will begin all the preparations for a dungeon visit, including a visit to the central market to pick up our food and other restorative items. We will then return here for when you are ready. Right, I'll be waiting here. <laughs> Your friend said that all the time? Awesome sauce? Really? Oh man, I, I feel like I just never heard it before. Uh... Okay, wait, let, let me just make a tweet, and then I will get started. Alright. So, um, I think, since we're like early in the week, we should probably go to the dungeon. So that after we go to the dungeon and get items, we can sell them in our shop. Um, but... Uh, basically, so I figured this out a little bit, um, as I was doing my practice. Basically, you want to, like, buy some items, um, so that the adventurer can equip them. Um, and it'll explain in a tutorial later. The adventurer later can, like, come to your shop and buy stuff, which will then become, like, their permanent items. So, yeah. Uh, for now, I'm just gonna buy him, like, the best sword. <laughs> Um, and then maybe get him a, a shield. I'll get him a cheap shield. <laughs> uh, but I need to buy some stuff for myself, too. So... Let's buy, a, like, two mufflers. Uh, I don't have a lot of money. Oh. <laughs> the cheapest food <laughs> so you can buy food to sell but also to um, bring to the dungeon with you in case you need more HP so for now let's buy an... let's buy some food anyway <laughs> I, I'm really poor <laughs> um Let's buy another apple and another thing. For now. So... The thing about this game, which I figured out, is if you go to the dungeon... Oh, wait a second! He already had equipment! I didn't even... Wait, is that my equipment or is it his equipment? <laughs> he already had a shield! God damn it! I didn't have to buy another shield. Uh... Well, as you can see, I didn't know... I didn't learn this game that well. <laughs> Um, but we're gonna- we're gonna go to the dungeon right now. Um, but what you can do, you can save your game. I'll save it here. You can save your game, and if you die in the dungeon, if you reload, it goes back to the start of the dungeon. Like, it does not- you cannot save inside the dungeon. So, that's kind of annoying if you're going really well and then die. But it's also, like, good to know in case you- Grew up really bad. <laughs> um, okay, take this bread and 
take an apple too. Okay. We're gonna go dungeoning! You guys are like, <laughs> we're gonna just like run a shop? No, we're gonna have an adventure now. <laughs> So this is the dungeon? So like, again, if you've never played Reset, I would totally recommend you buying it. Um, maybe when it's on sale or something, because it's actually really, really in-depth. <laughs> even like, even this, we're just touching the surface of the game. So this is the dungeon? Just so. Welcome to the jungle, as they say. You know, are we just gonna hold Louie back here? I mean, I'm not a monster slayer. I'm scared. The two of us are perfectly safe. There is a protective field around the two of us. To the monsters, we may as well be invisible. Really? That's amazing! So, Louie is perfectly safe too then? Er, uh, not quite. Uh, why not? Well, in the field, we do not need to worry about monsters. But this is accomplished by making us virtually intangible to everything inside the place. Uh, inside the place. We can directly manipulate nothing. Wait, we can't collect things? Why are we here then? That is why our adventurer remains outside the field. Oh, I see. He'll pick stuff up for us. Should our adventurer be injured, we can place him in the field and retreat. Since we must carry him back, however, we can take very little with us. Oh, uh, very little else with us. One item at most. So basically, if you die, you can only bring one thing back. <laughs> So, even if we run into trouble, we won't lose everything? But wait! I thought you said we can't... Yes, I will elaborate further if we needed, uh, be later. Naturally, we can get out safely, we can bring as much as our bags will allow us to carry. Cool. Wait, but as much as our bags will allow? Well, our bags are not bottomless. If we run out of space, it'll be up to us to decide what to keep or discard. So the adventurer focuses on adventure, while we keep track of what loot he should keep. I guess that makes sense. Katie, let's get to it! Alright, uh, yes. Give me the items. So, uh, when I tested this out, I was like, alright, so how do I... Sometimes, like, sometimes you'll be able to do a crit attack, but I don't know if that's, like, completely random or whatever. But all of these dungeons are like randomly generated. But yeah, we're gonna be here for a while. <laughs> ah, <frick. laughs> yeah, we gotta die for free. <laughs> So, um, as you can see, the the map on the dungeon level floor is not visible until you, like, uh, go through it. But, um, yeah, I think it's... I think it's pretty fun, even if, like, the controls maybe aren't the best. Oh, and another thing to note is once, once he, um, levels up, your health completely restores. So it's good to, like, um, I guess, time it in a way before you, like, fight a boss or something. Maybe try to level up. Oh, well, that's... <laughs> so the jewels that are, like, falling out of the enemies are the things that he uses to level up, basically. They're not money. And that's basically kind of all I know about the dungeon. So... Let's just go for it. <laughs> anyway, since this is like, I would say a calmer area, unless like it gets really, uh, really crazy with the enemies here, uh, we can now do- Oh! Okay, so I have to explain this. So if you find this symbol, you can go to the next floor. Um... And I think it's like... Is it every 10 levels or every 5 levels there'll be a boss battle? I can't remember right now. Uh, because I only did it once. <laughs> um, but 
Uh, my my goal, I think, will be just to like grind a little bit and uh, get Louis as high level as possible, and also try to get all the treasure from every floor. Because like when you're in here, you might as well you might as well uh, try to get everything. Egg toast, yippee! So yeah, um, since this is like a oh yeah, random random things will happen too. I re <laughs> you can't always avoid them. That was kind of lucky that I didn't get hit just now. But um, <laughs> uh, there will be just random things that happen as well. But yeah, since we are in the, like a uh, we're gonna be grinding for a little bit. I was wondering if anyone uh wants to like uh. Ask me a question and we can chat for a little bit while this is going on. <laughs> also, I will be trying to kill like every single <laughs> every single enemy. So uh don't mind me. <laughs> and that's why like you don't wanna die. Because if you're like me and wanna like clear out the entire dungeon. Um, it would suck to die and lose all of that progress because again, the save file, you can't save in the dungeon. Like, if I... So you saving here will save your data as it was prior to entering. So, um, you can't... Uh, what's that called? <laughs> what's that called when you just save a file and go back, reload it? Save scumming, I think that's what it's called. You can't save scum in this game. <laughs> Tuning in now, it's, it seems interesting. Yeah, this game is actually really fun. I think the dialogue in this game is actually funny too. So... I hope you guys are enjoying it. And um... We won't do too many dungeons. I think I'll try to only do a dungeon when I feel like... Um... We have a higher level or anything just because like eventually um they'll say that going to the dungeon can take up like a lot of time in a day so it's not advised to go like every day because you still have to make money in your shop but like the combat here is simple enough that even me a non-gamer <laughs> can play it, so I appreciate it. I don't know when he decides to do a critical attack. Or if it's like just random. <laughs> it's Stardew-esque. Yeah! So like I never played Stardew Valley, but like um I was watching Caroline play it uh, from H Ultra Hope Girls these couple of days, last couple of days, because she's been really into it. I heard um that uh Stardew Valley got a was it an update or something? An update the other day. So like a lot of people have gone uh, gone back to playing Stardew Valley. Um, and like watching it, I'm like, oh, um, yeah, you also go into dungeons or caves and stuff and fight monsters in Stardew Valley, don't you? So like, I guess it is Stardew Valley-esque, but like, the, uh, it's more capitalism. I don't know, it's like a different, different type of capitali capitalism. <laughs> like, does the Stardew Valley, uh, Stardew Valley involve you trying to pay off a debt? Or are you just trying to make as much money as possible? <laughs> I don't know that. Stardew Valley was the game I would play for hours a year back. Yeah! I can totally tell how um, people would find it very fun. Oh, well I guess in this game you don't do any farming. So that's like a different aspect. Sorry, I just want to kill all the enemies before I leave. <laughs> Kill them all! This is a reverse Undertale. We're gonna like kill everything in here. And not feel bad. <laughs> 
So as we keep going, uh, Louie will get stronger and we'll be able to give him better equipment. Ah, frick! Oh my god! Louie, don't die! <laughs> So with every level, I think there's like a new enemy that appears. And like the uh, range that they can attack from will be different. Which is good. <laughs> but as long as they don't make it too hard. Oh! Okay, I don't have enough uh, bag space already. That's not good. Get rid of something. Eat it. <laughs> I don't know what you use a chestnut for. So I'm gonna get rid of that for now. <laughs> oh yeah, I guess it is kind of like Animal Crossing too. We are repaying debts. Animal Crossing, because I've also never played Animal Crossing. <laughs> like, if you can't repay a debt, or like, is there a deadline to debts, or no? I don't know. Just make money, but they... Yeah. I don't know, can you go into debt? Like, actual debt and have consequences in Animal Crossing? Like, will, will villagers leave your island if you're in debt? <laughs> They're like, damn! This place kinda... Kinda sucks. <laughs> So I think those uh, tentacle looking things can poison you. So that's that's awesome. <laughs> oh, one thing that I uh, noticed about this is like if you hit a wall, it actually like has a unique like it will actually show you. Like, it'll be different from slashing nothing. I'm like, oh, that's cool. It's like you're actually banging the wall. I, I don't know, I just think that's neat. <laughs> oh, frick! Oh, god! Oh, my god. <laughs> Ooh, cherries. <laughs> okay, can't carry anymore. Um, I'll just eat another bread. Ooh. Damn it. Okay, you know what? I think I should just like, um, Discard some items that are maybe not as good to pick up other stuff. <laughs> I don't know right now how I can make my bag bigger. Um, because like when I was doing my practice, um, I did not get up to a point where I could make my inventory bigger. Oh my god, oh my god! Stop! Calm down! <laughs> Holy moly! Stop! Oh god! Ah! Why? <laughs> yeah. 
Anyway, it's fine, it's fine. We're, we're still alive, it's fine. Let me go eat some food. <laughs> It's all good. So I'm hoping that before we reach the boss, I'll uh, level Louie up a little bit more. Oh, by the way, while I was doing my practice, I did not, uh, I, I chose to skip all the cutscenes. So, or most of the cutscenes. So like a lot of the dialogue that I'm reading right now, I haven't seen before. <laughs> yes, another knife. I'm gonna make so much money at my shop! Okay, what floor are we on? Floor 4. I think the boss is either on floor 5 or floor 10. I can't remember. So, for now, I'm gonna try and level up. Just so I can get to full health before I tackle the boss. <laughs> Oh, I should have checked the map. There's no enemies here. And then we'll go fight the the boss or either go to level 5. Oh! oh there was a sword here. Uh... Eat it. Nice. <laughs> Good thing I went back there, huh? Alright, fight. Okay, I have now leveled up. Let's go fight the boss or go to level 5. I can't remember. <laughs> Don't touch me! Okay, if this is the boss, hopefully I don't lose, because that would be a, a huge waste of time. <gasps> okay, it's the boss, it's the boss. <laughs> Let's go! This is... Did I do it? I did, didn't I? Yeah, I did it, I cleared the whole of trials. How sweet mystery of life. Now you'll give me money! Yay, money! <laughs> Everyone just wants money. Way to go, Louie! Reset, cheer! This is all thanks to you guys! Well, this is all well and good, but there is a treasure chest just ahead. It behooves us to investigate it thoroughly. It behooves? <laughs> Tyr, you really do like going for the money, don't you? <laughs> exactly! Exactly, Reset! That's the mindset we need! <laughs> What? Ah, I do not spout such foolishness. There's no need to treat me like a flying bull of greed. Hey, hey now. I love me some treasure too. Don't worry, Tear. I feel you on this. Really? You two completely misunderstand me. It's like, I'm not desperate for money. You two are desperate for money. It's okay, Tear. We're all desperate for money. <laughs> So, the contents of the chest? Ha! <laughs> Give me just a second here. Hey! Wow! Cards! <laughs> so, this is an adventurous guild card. Uh, uh, here, Reset. Take one, like we promised. Huh? Oh yeah! Okay! Well, you did promise to give us your card eventually. We are not so crass as to demand, uh, demand your very first card. You really should think about who you want to give your first... No. I want this. Reset. I beg you. Please. Take my very first card. <laughs> Is this an innuendo? <laughs> Let's not think about it. I'd love to. Thanks, Louie. Oh, awesome. I can't wait to adventure with you two some more. No day. Really now. Young people... Take my card! My very first card. Oh, is there no boss? Yeah. Or is there a boss? Are they just faking me out right now? Hey, Tear, what's that thing that just showed up? 
Ah, yes, that. That is commonly referred to as a goho. We cannot copyright this word. Um, what I mean is a door of return, I mean. If you can enter that door, you can return to town in an instant. This one has appeared because we've cleared the dungeon. But they are often encountered, uh, they are often encountered during normal exploration too. I believe they usually appear around every five levels or so. Okay, so it is every five levels. Oh wait, if we take this back to town when we're halfway in, don't we have to start all the way from the beginning again? Not at all. You can always head back to the floor that had a door on it. In fact, you do not, uh, if you do not use a door, you do have to restart. Wait, if you do not use a door, you do have to restart. So if we find a door, we should always use it? Almost always. If we need to rest or unload, then we should use the door. Remember though, returning home takes time. Furthermore, leaving ends the current contract with our companion. And we would have to rehire him or choose a new one. If there is something specific in a dungeon that you desire, you'd simply ignore the doors and press on forward. Alrighty then. I think we have to go home now though. Quite so. Oh, just to be sure, in the future. Please try to avoid referring to this as the going home, okay? Uh, okay? Is that like, uh, because it's like a... Is it Dragon Quest or something? <laughs> going home, go home. Is that like a reference? I think it's like an item in another game that's kind of famous. Because like, the same thing happened in like, Rain Code, I think. Where they like use the teleportation spell and it was like censored because it's like a it's like a big thing in a double game. <laughs> okay. Oh, is there no boss level this time? Sweet! Ah, okay, no boss! Whoopee! No boss fight. Alright, so we got a bunch of stuff we can sell now. Let's go to the pub! Aw, oh, nobody's here. Damn. <laughs> so at night time, the market is closed, but you can still go to the merchant's guild. Oh, we gotta go to the square first. Nobody's here. Ah, oh, fine. It's SMT? Ah! Oh, I thought it was Dragon Quest. Okay. <laughs> can we talk about anything new? Okay, let's let's do this because there were some unknown items that we saw in that dungeon. Now, if you go into a dungeon diving, you'll find a lot of stuff which you uh, won't be able to identify at first. In particular, I'll bet my hat you'll find a lot of what are commonly called mystery ingredients by the adventurers. At first, you'll probably be tearing your hair out over all the junk you keep finding in those places, but as your merchant level goes up, you'll be able to sort out the stuff you find and pick out the best materials and whatnot from the lot. Oh, and if you manage to get out of those death traps safely, you'll have time to identify everything safely. That means you won't know uh, you won't know what you're carrying till you leave though. If there's anything you don't know, just ask. Okay, uh oops. Um uh, about fusion. Once a few merchant levels are under your belt, you'll be able to fuse items here at the guild hall. There's quite a few items uh, that you can only get by fusion, so I'd get real familiar with that furnace if I were you. Remember, what you put in affects what you get out of fusion. If you put in some materials of, say, plus two quality, then you'll get an item of similar quality as a result. Keep an eye on what you're fusing too. You don't want to waste good materials on some mediocre thing you can just buy somewhere. Another thing to keep in mind, it can get real tempting to keep your best quality items to yourself for personal use, but your customers know quality items when they see them, so you'll earn a lot of respect if you sell top shelf merchandise. There's a couple of stages to what you can pull off with fusion as you pick up some merchant levels, so be sure to experiment and come back here to see what you can make. Okay, so we can't do that right now, I think we're still like merchant level 1 or something, um, and I, I didn't get to experiment with this. So we'll just have to figure it out later. <laughs> okay, well, we have like no money, but is there anything I can buy? Hmm. I have 160. 
Oh, I cannot afford any any good quality items. You know what? I'll just get another glove. Yippee! Alright, we, we did a lot in the dungeon today. And now, we have a lot of items to sell. <laughs> okay, um... But before we do that, let me just do a save. Put my good swords up. <laughs> I'm gonna like put everything that's expensive in the window. <laughs> Whoa, cherry's pretty expensive. Okay, um, and then put the. Oh, what the heck was that? Store atmosphere. Well, I guess we're kind of plain. Plain, plain old Tsugi. <laughs> I guess the fairy kind of has a Tsugi vibe with the glasses. <laughs> That's all you need, right? Alright, let's put some food out. Because everyone needs to eat some food. This will be my, my food aisle. And then let's put a a worse sword. <laughs> All right, money, give me money. Welcome. Looking for something special? Oh my god, an even littler girl. <laughs> On an errand today, isn't that cool? Um, let's try twenty for now. Mm, could I pay a little less? How about fifteen percent for you? I'm going home. No! Oh damn! <laughs> she didn't like that. Oh no! We had our first rejection. I feel terrible. <laughs> okay, um, he wants a showcase. So, uh, something that I learned is if you put an item in the window, um, and the, the customer wants something in the window, they're willing to pay a little bit more for it. So, let's try... Let's try this. Okay, maybe I can make it. Maybe I can sell for a little bit more. <laughs> Extorting a child out of uh, money out of a small child. Yes. Uh, listen, we're running a business here. Okay. I don't care what age you are. <laughs> if I if I give discounts to little little kids, don't you think their parents would just ask kids to buy things for them all the time? <laughs> Dang, he wants the cherries. All right. Um, let's go for. Let's also try 130 here. Nope. How about... No! No! I don't feel good about this. You have to buy my items? Um... <laughs> <gasps> it's Louie! Okay, so I think Tears is gonna explain. Oh, Tear doesn't explain. So basically, um, if you uh, sell an item to an adventurer, that will become their equipped items in the end. So we want to make sure that we don't sell it to them for too high so that they can't afford it. So... <gasps> yes, Louie! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Louie. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, hello, hello. In case anyone's wondering. Transition, now I'm not part. Ooh! Your new name is Z. Welcome, Z! Congratulations on discovering yourself. I'm happy for you. I'm glad that you can be uh, open about it. Hey, Z. <laughs> Alright, well, we still have a lot of, uh, items. Well then, you seem to have developed a basic understanding of how to sell things and not drive them out. To burn the shop in anger. Um, actually, two customers didn't want to buy my stuff. I feel really bad, here. <laughs> yeah, Peroni! <laughs> Easy as pie! Girl! We are so close to getting an awesome source out of this, girl. Being a truly great store owner involves more than selling things, however. There are times people will want to sell items to you as well. Uh, really? I suspect we will begin to get such offers soon. But I already buy stuff from the guild in the market. So why would I worry about buying stuff from the customers? There is one major difference between a guild or market purchase and a purchase from an individual. Individuals do not have set prices. In other words, you can haggle as, uh, as you do when selling. Haggle down, that is. Oh, so I can get stuff really cheap? But that seems like it could get pretty hard. Fundamentally, buying and selling are not that different. The customer shows you an item they wish to sell, and then you set a price and perhaps negotiate. Obviously, you wish to pay less than the base price of the item. Okay, so buy low, sell dear, right? Just so. That is the very core of the successful business. Now then, shall we practice? The fundamental procedure is the same as when selling. Kyo! 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 Welcome to Versateer! Would you buy this from me? Um, okay. I need to name a price lower than the base. So, uh, think press down. Come on, me. You can do this. So, what should I set it to? Um, how about... <laughs> how about... How about 20, 25%? Excellent. This is a good price. It, it is? Now then, let us practice haggling over the price a little. The concept is essentially the same as selling something. Now that you've offered a price you believe to be fair, adjust your offer until they, they agree to sell it to you. Okay! Let's begin then. Could you offer me a little more? I think it's worth a lot. Uh, okay, so I need to set a price, uh, a higher offering price. <laughs> how about this? No, okay, um... How about 30%? Yes, between 50% and 70% of the base is a good target. What? I was offering 30. Okay, I, I guess we'll have to test it out. You'll gain an item to sell without giving up too much money. And that is essentially how it goes. You seem to have a decent enough grasp of it. Well, let us put theory into practice again. I will sell you several items. If you buy them from me successfully, I believe you'll be ready to proceed. Let us begin. One dollar, yeah. How much would you be willing to pay for this? Um, I would be willing to pay... Like... <laughs> you know... Oh, zero! <laughs> okay, one percent. One percent for your very thankful statue. You are going far too low. You will only succeed at making the customers furious that way. Come, let us try again. Aww. <laughs> well, good thing they gave us a practice. Alright, let's try, uh... Let's try the 30%. Hmm, could you go a little higher, perhaps? How about 33%? Yes, an excellent price. Yippee! Okay, so I think they said... When they said 70 and 50, I think they mean, like, 30 to 50% is a good uh, price for it. Rather than, like, 70 being the top. Whatever, we'll figure it out. How much is about debt is paid off? Um, we have 1,700 money 
picks, I guess. And we need 10,000. We need 10,000 by the end of the week. Oh, welcome to Reseteer. Uh, let's try... Let's try 20... 28. And then we'll go to 30. Ah, oh, damn. Okay. Expensive chocolate bar. Okay. <laughs> You're ready. If you ever wish to practice again, simply ask. I think we'll be good. Okay, um... I think I have another sword in here. Oh, and I have shoes. Alright. Let's try this. <laughs> Hello, welcome to rest here. Alright, so you want something in the window, so let's try... Let's try 30. <gasps> yes! I sold it. <laughs> I love money. <gasps> it's this guy. Oh, you want something so cheap. What the? Is that much? Are you serious? Okay, sorry. Sorry, my guy. Alright, I take that price. <laughs> Thanks, please come again. Give me all your money. <gasps> Louis! What the heck, Louis? You don't want a you don't want a weapon? <laughs> Louis's like, I am so hungry right now. All right, we're set. Well, I feel like I should always sell stuff to him for lower, so that he doesn't like not buy stuff from me. Let's try twenty. Is that a little too much? Okay. Don't worry, Louie. Uh, I'll be good for- You know what? <laughs> there you go. A nice 1,000. Look at all those ones. Yippee! There's no beating you, Reset. Yeah, I'll take that price. You know what you should do? Is you should ask them for a lot of money. And then when you ask them for the price that you actually want, they'll be like, Hey, well, that's reasonable. <laughs> Ah, marketing tactics. Oh no, the little girl. Can I buy this, please? Okay, I feel like the little girl doesn't have a lot of money, so we'll try 110. Oh, she bought it this time. Okay, we'll charge her more next time. <laughs> Every time we're like, yes, success. All right, charge her more next time. <laughs> Oh, I gotta buy something. Are you interested in buying this unthankful statue? Your unthankful statue is worth 25%. Sorry, I can't sell at that price. Oh! Oops. <laughs> it's okay, I don't want your unthankful statue anyway. Who wants an unthankful statue? You're selling me one too? You're selling what you want to? Goddamn. Alright, how about 28%? Bah, I'm going home. No! Alright, I guess I have to offer them more money. <laughs> Holy cow! It's late! Time to uh, time seemed to uh, fly by today. Speaking of time, I plan on doing some mild schedule management for you from now on to ensure that you are working in an effective manner to pay back the debt. Schedule management? Quite. First, I have broken up the day into four period, uh, four time periods. Morning, afternoon, evening, and night. What you can do and how much you can do depends on the time of day. Oh, hey, yeah! The clock's been broken up into four areas. That's a weird clock we have. <laughs> Think of each part as a slice of time. A slice? Mmm, like a pie. Indeed. Wow, you really only think about food, don't you? <laughs> I thought you would be able to keep your attention if I made it. Rather similar to some sort of sweet food. 
so there's a morning slice, the afternoon. I'm getting hungry. Um, anyway. Now to explain in detail, generally you can only act between morning and night. When night ends, you need to go to bed. Trying to run a shop while sleep deprived is unpleasant, so... I'll say. I'll close up when it gets late. So, you essentially have two options for each slice. You can either open the store for a time, or go about town on business. You cannot do both at once, so decide in advance what you need to do. To be clear, opening the shop will consume a slice, and returning to the store after going out, regardless of what you actually do, will also consume a slice. But, what if I go to, like, the plaza and then the chapel? I can get around town. Oh, you can get around town easily enough without, uh, wait. You can get around town easily enough to avoid consuming the slice with each move. Only when you return to the store will the clock advance. So in that case, I should do a lot when I leave the shop. Yes, that is a good attitude to take. Now, there is another vital element, leaving town altogether. Visiting a dungeon will consume two slices no matter what. It will? It takes that long? So, if I go in the morning, it'll... Uh, I'll get back in the evening? That's just precisely how it works. Plus, you can only leave for a dungeon at early uh, at an early point in the day. If it is night, or you have done something that uh, something else that evening, you cannot go. Because if I go, I'd get back real late, right? Exactly. Not only would you annoy your adventure companions with staying out so late, you would also be dead. <laughs> Let's just leave it there. <laughs> You'd also be dead on your feet the next day after returning. Man, this is a lot to wrap my head around. You will get used to it, I'm sure. Before you know it, you will be thinking about it naturally. You think so? Well, it helps that you will always be able to see how much time a particular action will consume. Simply pay attention to the clock. That is everything. If you ever want to go over this again, simply ask me when we are in the shop. I'll be glad to go over it as often as you need. Hi, Kay! <laughs> I feel like, is Rosette eating enough food? All of her brain is just thinking about food. Oh my god! This could be delicious in Dungeon! <laughs> we go to the dungeon, we kill the, we kill the monsters, we we get food from them. Oh my god, it really is dungeon meshy. <laughs> Pike! Okay, you know what? This is this is a lot better now. <laughs> Alright, let me let me put some more stuff on the shop. I don't think we'll go to the Let's go to the dungeon tomorrow, I think. Go to the dungeon tomorrow. No, Louis. Louis, stop buying food. I know, I know, we're both hungry, but you need weapons. Now about fifteen percent for chocolate. Yeah, <gasps> He liked it! He, okay, it's a great deal. Maybe I can charge more. <laughs> okay, he's selling me a chocolate bar. Okay, I think I have to start with like 30% then. How about 32%? Do you like that? Um... How about 30... How about 38% then? Do you like that? Okay. <laughs> His name is just Old Man. It's okay. <laughs> like, it's, they're like too many NPCs, man. We, we can't name them all. <laughs> just add like 5 more percent every time they come back. So true, so true. My uh, my wife asked me to pick this up. What's your wife need? A <laughs> She's like, I need this. I need this to to fight off fight off my husband. <laughs> Every time he makes a bad financial decision, I'm gonna whack him on the head. <laughs> All right. Uh, how about 
133% for a beautiful sword. Too expensive, please make it cheaper. How about... 29%? Oh, I can't ask you to go any lower. Right, I'll take it. Yeah! You're naming this guy Derek? <laughs> yeah, Derek, take this to your wife. <laughs> hey, Derek. <laughs> Welcome back. Oh, I was looking for this. <laughs> I'm gonna get myself the cheaper sword. Um, alright. Let's go... 129 as well. Does he like that? Oh, he does! Alright. We're gonna charge him 130 next time. <laughs> well, do you guys want to give a name to the old man? She kind of looks like Madoka. Yeah, it's that art style, right? It's cute! I like it. Oh, he wants a robe. Uh, sell it for... 130. Let's see. Does he want that? How do you go down just a hair more? 129, baby! Mad! No! Every time- every time someone doesn't buy something, I cry. Percy? <laughs> Can we be spelled Percy, but like a wallet purse? <laughs> Percy. <laughs> Hello, welcome to Recitair. I want the egg toast. Alright, um... Oh wait. She wants to buy it. Alright. One... One, 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 girl. <gasps> Look at that! Look at that! That's so perfect. Five, 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 one, one, one. You, you have to buy it, right, girl? <gasps> yes! <laughs> I like how we're naming all of these characters. Percy, Tina, Derek. <laughs> Why are you suggesting your own names? Don't you want to be the customer? <laughs> okay, um... Here, buy my chocolate bar. We'll go to the dungeon tomorrow. Hey, Derek. <laughs> yeah, you want that chocolate, don't you? For your wife. <laughs> well, you're gonna pay. You're gonna pay a pretty penny. Penny for your wife. No! Can't compromise on your wife. Okay, we gotta go 30. There you go. The lowest 30%, alright? Yes! <laughs> Every time Derek buys something, we're just gonna be like, it's for his wife. <laughs> Louis, yes, buy a weapon! Buy some shoes. <laughs> Alright, how about... How about... How about 15 for you, Louie? It's a deal, I swear. Yippee! Oh my god, look, we're at 9,000 monies! Oh my god, we're so rich. <laughs> we're so rich! I didn't even realize how much money we were making. Oh, Derek's back for his wife. <laughs> He's like, I need a shield for my wife. <laughs> She's an adventurer. So true, Derek, so true. Alright, how about this? 133. 133 for your wife. You do that, right? Damn it. Guess you don't love your wife enough, Derek. It really is just go down 1% and they'll take it. Thanks, Derek. <laughs> Derek as Daisy. Is Daisy his wife's name? <laughs> oh my god, Derek loves weapons. His wife is such an enthusiast of weapons. <laughs> Alright, uh, this is in the window, so you should pay a little bit more, actually, Derek. Um, yes, it does cost that much, Derek. Yeah! 
<laughs> Derek, you're my favorite customer. <laughs> Oh my god, we have so much money. Thank you, Derek. Look at it. Look at all the money we have. We have eleven thousand dollars. <laughs> well, you seem more or less used to the basics of running an item shop. <laughs> you think so? There are some other matter. Uh, there is one other matter, however. You cannot always be certain that a customer will know what they want when they come in. Well, what do you mean? They may come in thinking. What should I make for dinner? What would be a good weapon? And so forth. They will not be quite sure what exactly they wish to purchase when they come through the door. In such a case, we must provide them with advice to help them decide. Wait, how could I do... Many customers will simply give up if they do not find something suitable for their needs on our counters. However, others will realize that we may have reserved stock and will inquire as to whether we have something they seek. That is when you may suggest an item you think they would like. In a sense, it is the ultimate chance to show your skill as an item shopkeeper. If you know what someone desires, you will very likely impress them and cause them to return. Eek! No pressure. Then not at all. Well, let us give us a little practice, shall we? There is no different than a normal sale, really, beyond the fact that you must choose the item you sell yourself. Well, let's begin. Take A! Alright, so my plan today is I'll go to the shops, buy at least one of every item I can, and then go to the dungeon. Just in case, like, somebody wants an item that I don't have. Since we have so much money, I think it's okay- Oh, no, 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 no. I, since we have so much money, I think it's okay if we, um, like, actually just spend a bit of money as well. As long as we have 10,000 before the end of the week. I'd like to- uh, I would like a sword, please. So, anything's okay as long as it's a sword? Ultimately, you must pick something the person would like. By the way, if I may give you a little advice. If you sell weapons and armor to your adventurer friends, they will quit the items you sell them. Okay, so this is where that info comes in. Meaning, of course, that if you sell items to them, then we do not need to lend them any items at the start of the dungeon excursion, and we'll be able to bring back more items for our own use. Even if an adventurer must retreat while in a dungeon, the equipment is not lost, since it is their position. So selling equipment to our adventuring friends is a good idea, even if you must undersell to them a little. Accessories work the same way, so think carefully about who you sell what to, and what effect it may have on their performance. Well, I hope I can keep, treat, uh, can keep track of all this. That's a lot of information. <laughs> If you look at the details of an item when selling to one of our adventuring friends, you could also check what uh, that person currently has. Now then, we should continue. Affirmativification. Affirmative. Affirmativification. God damn. Affirmativification. I would like a sword, please. Buy my sword. Excellent. The rest is like a normal sale. Once again, let us put the whole thing into practice. I will ask for an item, sell me what I ask for, and you will pass. Let us begin. I would like a weapon, however... However... Well, take my sword. How about something like this? Oh, this is lovely. How much is it? Give uh, me... Give me 130. Could you lower? Lower the price of fine. Um, every chance we get. <laughs> Yippee! Okay, once more then. No, I don't. I don't think we need to practice that anymore. Oh, I can't skip the practice. Okay, whatever. All right. What would she say if I sold it to her for, like, less money? Would she be like, um, reset? <laughs> no, no, that is wrong, reset. Once more. Okay, at least she's like, well, do not do that. Okay. We're all good now. 
I keep thinking Rosette has a Christmas, uh, Christmas ornaments in her. Yeah, she kind of does. She kind of looks like a, a Santa's elf. <laughs> she got that vibe. Okay, let me do a save. Save us. So we're gonna go to the shops and buy some stuff and then go to the dungeon as well. Anyone here? Nope. <laughs> Anyone here? <gasps> it's Louie! Hmm. Yes! No. Huh? That's Louie! What in the name of heaven is he searching for over there? Hey, let's go ask! Why do I get the feeling that I would much rather not get involved? Oh, I just noticed that Louie's wearing like the, the 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 scarf, the little muffler. That's all cute. Louie, you're so cute. <laughs> Look at that outfit. It's a mess. <laughs> Louie, hello. You know, like, as much as you can laugh on like the fashion of this game, it's still so like I don't know. It's so unique in a way. Like, fashion from these kinds of games. <laughs> it's it's fun. You don't, you don't see people, like, really um, designing characters to look like this. Unless you're, like, Kingdom Hearts or something. <laughs> oh, Reset, Tear, what's up? What are you doing wandering around here? Uh, well, I got hungry, so I decided to take a look if I could, uh, and see if I could find some edible grasses or herbs or something, is he? Louis, Louis, are you so poor you can't afford food? He's he's like, I'm taking touch and grass to the next level. I'm eating them too. <laughs> Louis, no! Why does that not surprise me in the slightest? But uh, I'm not sure which of these are edible, you see. Louie, if you eat that, you blow up your stomach. You can eat those, but they taste best if you can clean them. Oh no, Reset, have you eaten grass too? Now, the plants with the soft leaves at the east end of the plaza? Those taste the best. You should try them. Tears like, what the hell is going on here? Why are these children eating grass? How is it that you know so much about edible plants? Especially ones located here of all places. I'm poor! <laughs> Thanks a ton, Reset. I owe you again. We're both poor. We just have to eat grass. No problem. Remember to watch what you find. Why do I feel as though that this is the least of his concerns? He's like, I just want to eat. I just want to eat food. <laughs> Alright, let's go buy some stuff. Um, a charm? Nah. Cape? Oh, it's expensive though. Um, you know what? Let's get an unthankful statue. Why not? <laughs> and let's get a book. Sure, let's buy a book. Um, I don't think we need to buy more food at the moment, but I guess it wouldn't hurt. Let's buy an apple. This. Uh, sure. I think for now, just having at least one of each thing to be safe in case like someone asks for stuff is like a good idea. Oh god, where we? <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm just looking at my money. It, it'll be fine. We'll ha we'll have enough money. We'll have enough money. We'll have enough, I think. <laughs> oh, how much is this? I can buy that. Um, ooh, armor. Okay, you know what? Give me armor. <laughs> Iron armband. Do I have any of these? No. Okay, give me the wooden one. Shield. A good shield. Uh, I don't- I feel like I don't need a better shield at the moment. A uh, wool hat. Give me a hat. Give me two hats. 
Um, armor. Eh, you know what? I think that that's pretty good. Just cause like after we go to the dungeon, we can't come back to the shop. I think. So I wanna make sure I have like enough stuff to sell to people. Buy some cheap stuff. <laughs> I'm just gonna be like, purchase everything that's cheap, right? Cause why not? Buy two of these. <laughs> okay, look how, look how much money I spent. That's not very good. Anyway, it's fine. It's fine. We'll do a save. <laughs> Okay, time to go to the dungeon again. Do we have a better sword? Oh, he can't use this. Oh. Okay, you know what? Let's go back. Let's buy- No, we can't buy him a better sword! No! No! Oh, no! I have to use a crappy sword. Let me use this. <laughs> Sorry, Louie, I didn't realize I had I didn't have a good sword for you. Oh he can Isn't that what he already has? Damn. Oh he can't use any of these things. <laughs> Damn it, Louie! Damn it! What what does he have? Okay, he doesn't have like a uh, armor or good armor at least. <laughs> let's give him let's give him some good armor and that's it. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Dungeon time. Oh, what's this? Oh, so I can use my magic a bit more. Let's go! So now there are insects flying at me. <laughs> Great. I got a statue! Oh my god, dumb, dumb mushroom! That was so cute. Sorry, it had to die though. <laughs> the dungeon pots? Yeah, like, the dungeon part is cute because I guess at least you're not stressed about, like, trying to sell things to people. You're, you're just stressed about, like, surviving. <laughs> oh, bunny! Snow bunny! That's cute. Oh, there's the level. Damn it. <laughs> An apple. <laughs> Every time that like random things come, I'm like, oh god, please no, don't kill me. <laughs> oh, what's that, a bomb? <laughs> but yeah, I hope that, uh, I hope that these levels are enjoyable, even though it's not capitalism. We're still risking our lives for the, the sake of money. <laughs> Alright, let's go to the next level. Ooh, it's still hard. Nice. Oh god, the, the boss! <laughs> Oh my god. 
the bunny. The bunny is so good at dodging. Goddamn, goddamn wasps. Has anybody ever been stung by a wasp? Oh, there's the next level. Or like a bee. I don't know if I've ever been stung by a wasp or a bee, but I think my mom was stung by a wasp once and it sucked. Why do wasps exist? Like, you know bees and stuff? They don't want to, like, fight you. But a wasp... A wasp will fight you. I think you would know if you got stung. Yeah. <laughs> well, if I got stung as a child, I think I might have forgotten. Oh. Ooh, it's... Slippery. Slip... Slippery! Really? I don't- you know what? I did not know that. I just thought bees did it. I thought wasps were just like assholes. That like contribute nothing. <laughs> I got stung by two bees in my life, both on my foot- Oh no! Fizzy, no! That sounds like it sucked! I hope it's not at the same time. <laughs> oh, the <laughs> wait! When you when you slice when you slice the mushroom, it goes the little like X eyes. <sighs> the mushroom's cute. <laughs> Section, you can grind a little bit, but once you start like um, having your bag full, there's no point to like going off to items anymore unless you want to like just swap the items that you currently have. But um, I think it's always good to, to fight as many monsters as possible because you'll always level up. So I want to try like kill everything. <laughs> I don't know if like Louis's appearance would have changed depending on like what outfits you give him or like what armor you give him, but I don't think so. He's still wearing the muffler right now, unless that's what he's equipped with. Oh, he is equipped with this. Wait, can I change it to stuff that I have right now in the dungeon? Hmm, I'll test it out if I find a weapon. <gasps> There's still one enemy left. <laughs> we have to kill them all. Kill them all, Louis. Kill them all. <laughs> 
Leave none alive. <laughs> Leave none alive, Louis. We're poor, you know? <laughs> it's all we gotta do. One was on the trampoline when I was like eight, and the other was this year. This year! <laughs> oh my god, that's very recent. Thirsty for money and blood, you know? I feel like... <laughs> Come to enough of these streams and you you realize this is a not a, just a one time thing. <laughs> I think if people play Stardew Valley, um, they should also play this game. It just seems like it would be fun. <laughs> And vice versa, maybe if I, if like, um, there's another Steam sale, I could consider purchasing, um, Stardew Valley. I just feel like Stardew Valley would, um, overwhelm me in a way, because like, there's so much choice. I feel like, it's kind of like, why I, I don't think I would play Animal Crossing. Like, I think it's cute and stuff, but like, I would have such a hard time. Um, trying to decorate my island because I would not be able to make a decision. There's like too many options. Is there anything I can throw away? Uh, well, might, not, might as well eat bread. Oh god! <laughs> The wasps ganged up on me. <laughs> well, I want I want candy. Um, 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 um what can I get rid of? <laughs> I'll get rid of the slime fluid. I don't know what that does. Again. <laughs> it's so hard to move around. Valley is very calming. Yeah. I imagine it's like a game that you can just like, um, pick up at any time. But I feel like I would be stressed, right? Like, because I feel like some people play, uh, those kinds of games trying to, like, maximize every kind of profit. But, like, I don't know, how do you approach it? Do you also try to, like, maximize the money you can make? Or do you just, like, go into it and be like, hee hee, I'm having fun. Because I imagine even if you go into the game without, like, trying to make as much money as possible, it can still be stressful. <gasps> Get rid of this chestnut. Yeah. Alright, we'll fight some more monsters and then we'll go to level 5, which I think, I think should be a boss battle. Fun is good. <laughs> you can be super casual about it. Yeah. I don't... Like, I know in Stardew Valley you can romance the other characters, but I'm not sure there's any, like, romance in this game. Yeah, I don't think you can... I don't think you can romance Louis. Alright, 
Alright, two more monsters and then... Uh, I don't think we can level up. So, let's just eat something. Um... Damn, it's all good. Okay, give me an apple. Oh, more monsters appeared. <laughs> So if you're if you're looking at the little mini map, if you see a red spot on the map, that means it's a it's a monster. Oh my god, honey! Wait, can wasps make honey? Cause I'm not sure if they can. Do they make honey? I don't think so. I I don't think I've ever heard of wasp honey. I think we're done here. It's time. I think it's time to fight a boss. So hopefully I don't lose. <laughs> the crown slime. Yeah, Oh god. Oh my god, Frick! Just die! Holy crap! Okay, you know what? Let me eat something. Um, let me eat a apple. <laughs> Holy moly! Wait, I just saw its health bar. Oh, no wonder why. I ran out of SP. Uh... <laughs> I will die. I will die if I don't eat some food. Okay. Um... Let me eat orange. Whoa, that was a lot of health. Thing. I think I have to kill the little thing. Oh my god, Louie, no! Oh! Wait! Why is it so tiny? Kill, kill the little thing! Kill the little thing! Cherry, thank you. Help! <laughs> Eat an apple, Louie. Eat an apple. Oh my god, that was stressful. <laughs> Thank goodness I had so many food items. I kept getting stomped. We we did it, Reset! We did it! Yeah! Alright, I think we should- No, 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 <laughs> I think we should leave. Wait. Maybe! <laughs> Wow, came back alive. I'm glad that that's the, that's the thing we get to see. Ah, oh, look at all this stuff we got. Awesome. Oh, we're still in the town. Well, we might as well visit stuff then. Hmm. What is it? Hey, Tear, is alcohol yummy? No, <laughs> it's not yummy. I've only tried it once before myself. Wow, really? You're so grown up, Tear. I hated it. It stank of barrels. Barrels? Typically, most alcoholic beverages are uh, left to age in barrels. So the drink had a strong wooden smell. 
was not dissimilar to attempting to drink a tree. Okay, that doesn't sound yummy at all. To be honest, the popularity of the substance baffles me. It always sells well, so stocking it is always a good way to make some money, but... But barrels! Barrels. Barrel trauma. <laughs> I don't really like the taste of alcohol either. Anyone in town square? Urgh. At night, the plaza is so quiet. It's almost scary. Indeed, it would be best to return home quickly. It's this, uh, this is a dangerous time for a girl to be wandering about. Oh, right. A cute girl like me could end up in all kinds of peril. I'm not recalling saying anything about you being cute. <gasps> oh my god. She just, she just roasted us. <laughs> Well, don't sweat the small stuff. Come on! Homeward, ho! Don't call me a ho. <laughs> hey, what are you kids doing out this late? <gasps> oh, heaven! A hoodlum! A hoodlum's gonna steal my cuteness! <laughs> Res reset, you are so... <laughs> you know what? <laughs> cringe, girl. Cringe. Just like me, girl. Who's there? Show yourself! Calm down, you two. It's me. No need for alarm. Oh, thank goodness. I was about to call a... a Gen... Gendar... Gendarim... Gendarim... Gendarmi... Gendarmi... <laughs> oh god, is this French again? <laughs> Can someone Google what that means? Gen... Gendar... Gendarmi... <laughs> what does that mean? <gasps> Police? Is that what it means? Police? <laughs> With an appearance like his, that's not unreasonable. What the hell, guys? <laughs> yeah, that's just cruel. What? what? He's like, what the hell? I just came to say hi. You guys are insulting me. <laughs> I was like, oh, oh, now you come into my shop, huh? <laughs> Alright, is there anything else I want to buy? Probably not. I, I got a lot of stuff. You know what? Could buy a nice helmet. Oh god, I have like no money left. Never mind. Maybe that was a bad idea. <laughs> How many days do we now have left? Oh, thank you! Thank you for bringing me some food! <laughs> thank you, baby! Yippee! <laughs> Alright, we have like three days, I think. Three days to get our, our $10,000 back because I used all of it. And because of that, you know what? I should have saved before I spent my money, but that's fine. Oh, I did save! Wait, no. I think that was before, before we went to the dungeon. Just in case. <laughs> okay, put all my most expensive items out on the front. Mm. Oh, wait, no. Yes, put my expensive stuff out at the front so that people will buy them. <laughs> buy my stuff. <laughs> buy my expensive stuff. Oh, hey, Louie. <laughs> Um, for you, Louie, for you, I'm, I, you know, we're, we're buds. We're, we're both in this together. We're both poor people. You know what? I, I'm gonna give you a discount, Louie. We're such good friends. I'm giving you such a good discount. <laughs> There's no being you, Rosette. Yeah, I'll take that price. Thanks, Louie. <laughs> You're my best friend. <laughs> oh, that's the only thing that was sold? What the hell? Did no one want anything? Buy my stuff! Buy my stuff, I need money! <laughs> Buy my stuff! Oh my god, Louie again, my bestie. I suppose- I, I don't suppose you have some food? Yes, I do have food, Louie. I know it. We're, 
us us grass eaters have to stick together, <laughs> Louis. <laughs> oh. Mm. You know what? Have this egg toast, Louis. I won't I won't sell you my most expensive item. So you know what? Have have some food. For you, Louis. One ten. <gasps> he gave me a heart! He loved it! <laughs> Thanks, that's a great deal. Thanks, Rosette. No worries, Louis. You're my bestie. <laughs> I'm gonna have to charge you more in the future though. Oh my god, Fizzy, ask and you shall receive. Derek has come back for his wife. Alright, Derek. Are you willing to pay... Oh, oh, no, that's too much. <laughs> Are you willing to pay... this much? Sweet heaven, that's too expensive. Please make it cheaper. How about... this much? Yeah, that'll do. Thanks, Derek! <laughs> we can only sell it to 130 for you, Derek. <laughs> Did we give this guy a name? I don't think so. He's just like the guild master. Hey, could I purchase this? Alright, how about... 128? Yippee! Alright, I'm gonna charge him 130 next, too. <laughs> Give me all your money. <laughs> How much for this? Um, one twenty-five. No, yeah, no, yes, one twenty-five. No, you know what? One twenty-six. <laughs> Make it cheaper. <laughs> all right, fine. Um, how about how about one twenty-one? That's a pretty good number. Hmm. Well, it's reasonable enough. Yes. Oh my god, we're already at $8,000! We're gonna be so rich! <laughs> we're gonna be so rich! Yeah! <laughs> Alright, you know what? Um, Do we have any more expensive stuff up here? <laughs> Put my expensive stuff... What's my store atmosphere? Oh no, we're back to- I think we went down! I think we were more plain than before! I guess I need some more bougie things in the future. <laughs> oh, a statue. That might be good. Put a book up. Why not? See if anyone wants a book. <gasps> no, wait, 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 wait. The honey was very expensive. Someone better buy my honey. Pretty good. Alright, over the store. I need to make my money. Hey, Louis. Um. Standard charm. Makes his defense go long. Low. What's M death? What's M death? Does anyone know what that means? M. M death. Max defense? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what that means. <laughs> Alright, Louis. For you. For you. You know what? For you. <laughs> How about 15? How about 15 this time, Louis? Yes! Alright, I'll charge you more next time, Louis. <laughs> hey, Derek, welcome back. You want some shoes for your wife? No problem. You know, shoes can be pretty expensive. <laughs> How about this? How about this? One, one, one. <laughs> oh, come on. Come on, buddy. You can afford it. <laughs> oh, that's right. That's right. That's right. Come on, buddy. You can afford this, right? <gasps> yeah! <laughs> for his wife, you know? He's got to do everything for his wife. <laughs> Alright, little girl, I know you don't have that much money, though. Oh, you're selling it! 
Okay, give it to me for... 30... 30... 35% maybe? 30... 36... 36%! Alright, uh, 40%. Mommy, you'd get mad at me if I said yes to that. No! How much do you want for chocolate, kid? <laughs> Damn! Oh, uh, back again, I see. Oh, now you want some food, huh? Huh? <laughs> How about I sell you a chocolate? <laughs> Alright. You're gonna buy it off me. Yes! That's right, I don't need your chocolate. I'm gonna sell you my chocolate. <laughs> okay, this guy's- you guys are calling this guy Dave? <laughs> what's- what's with all the names starting with D? I guess Tina's not a D though. Dino. <laughs> Looking for a weapon. What's my most expensive weapon? Okay, apparently this is... Is this a weapon? It's a spear! Yeah, he likes it. Alright, um... How about 130? Are you okay with that? Yeah! <laughs> Dina is her her mom. <laughs> Dina, Dave, Derek, <laughs> Doofus. <laughs> hey, Derek. Selling me some candy. How about for thirty percent? How about for thirty-six <laughs> percent? Yes, Derek. Thanks. <laughs> Derek's my bestie. He's my best customer. Louis's my bestie. Derek's my best customer. <laughs> okay. What else do people want? Clothes? That's good enough. Hey, we made back all our money. That's great. We're doing so well right now, actually. <laughs> Louis, <laughs> Louis, I wasn't gonna sell you this because it was more expensive. So this is the legendary <gasps> honey. <sighs> Reset. Sell me this, please. All right, Louis. I'm sorry. This is my honey. You know, honey. I gotta charge you a little bit more. <laughs> but. Mmm, well... <laughs> bestie. You pay one dollar more. <laughs> ah, damn it. Come on, bestie. I do want him to buy my honey, though. Okay, you know what? There we go. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yes! Buy my honey! Buy my honey, Louie! <laughs> Oh my god, hey! <laughs> Louis, if you're so desperate. <laughs> Money for honey. Yeah! Don't have a weapon. I do have weapons. What's my most expensive thing right now? Uh, here, take my bow. Give me... Give me 130. 130 for my... No, you want... 133. 133 for my bow. Damn it. 130. <laughs> Yippee! Oh, I'm so glad. I'm so glad I'm selling it to these people. I hope the girl never comes back. I don't want to sell to customers who can't pay me enough money. <laughs> oh, damn. I should really buy some more weapons. I don't have anything expensive. <laughs> um... There you go. Yeah! Why does he need to buy weapons? He sells me the weapons. Oh my god, we have 1500- uh, 15,000 money! 
I love, I love money. We're so rich. Okay, so... Hmm... I think, like, since we have enough money again... Should we just go to the uh, the dungeon again? Should we just go to the dungeon again? Maybe. Because I don't think we have enough, like... Valuable items in our shop right now, so I do need to go to the shop and buy some more expensive stuff And then we'll also just go to the dungeon <laughs> Anyone in the square? Oh, who's this? Oh. This is new Big sis, wait! Or wait, I don't, I don't know how old you are <laughs> You walk so fast, wait up! That girl. Fear, is something wrong? Uh, no. It is nothing. Oh, you're looking at those sisters! Hey, dear! How do you think people see us? H how do you... Do you think we look like sisters? Given that I'm a fairy, I rather doubt it. Oh, <laughs> right. Still, if we did, I'd be kinda happy. Really? Why is that? Well, since I'm bigger, I'd be the bigger sister, right? Your logic, as always. It's breathtaking in its faultiness. Yeah, I guess you would be the big sister. But that'd be really nice, too. Right, sis? Keep up this nonsense and I will leave you behind. Damn. <laughs> Rejected. Hey, wait up for me! Tear is like, this is my job? I don't know if you understand what having a job means. <laughs> we are not family. <laughs> Anyone at church? Nope. <laughs> We're all sitting here. He has the best voice acting. <laughs> Thank you. I'm trying. Yeah, I love the I love the art. It's so cute. All right, let's let's buy some expensive stuff because we can afford to. Give me an expensive book. <laughs> Give me that Taiyaki. Um. Eh, yeah, I'm gonna want to buy another one of these. Okay, it doesn't- They're still out of stock! All the expensive stuff. Alright, you know what? Give me- give me this. Give me this as well. <laughs> um... Buy some more of these. I also have to take care of my money and not, like, spend too much. I say as I keep buying everything. <laughs> uh, no, I do not need more clothes. <laughs> I'm using so much money. Oh no. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We get. We we still. enough money, right? Um... <laughs> uh, maybe I shouldn't have bought so many items. Mm, let me think, let me think. Should I just... Hmm. Okay, you know what? I think I decided. I will run my shop today. I will run my shop today. And then tomorrow we'll go into the dungeon. Did you do something stupid? No, I think I just... <laughs> I think I, uh... Might have bought too many things. But hopefully we, we have enough stuff to, like, sell. Sell anyway. We'll probably be fine. But okay, you know what? Let's go, let's go, let's go run our shop today and then we'll go to the dungeon tomorrow. And if we don't have enough money... By the end of today, we'll run our shop again tomorrow. 
ことな。えー、何をこかな。Why am I most expensive stuff? <laughs> Oh, no, you know what? Okay. I gotta make my money back. <laughs> You've been live for nearly three hours and I haven't eaten. Yeah, go, go eat some food. Don't worry, don't worry. I, I'm, I'm eating while we stream. My daughter in law asked me to pick this up. Dang. You know what? That's pretty cool. All the women in this town wanna wanna go to the dungeons. <laughs> We crave the dungeons. Okay, um how's how's one how's 133? You know what? How's 133? Is that okay? Damn, alright. How about one How about 128? You know that that that, that seems alright. 129 maybe? <laughs> Oh my god! Yes, money! Look at all that money! <laughs> I just realized that Tear is flying around the store and like dusting it. That's cute. Also, she is way more smaller in the pixels compared to her like portrait, <laughs> her sprite. <gasps> Louie, you want more stuff? <laughs> Ooh, this month is tight, but I really want that, Louie. Louie is an impulse purchaser. That's okay, Louie. It's okay. I, I, won't, I, won't, I won't charge you too, too much. Yes! Okay, we can charge Louie 120%. Yes. Thank you, Louie. Thank you. <laughs> Louie. Demon child. Beef bowl. Okay, we're buying this. We're buying this. So this girl, she does not accept like 30% when it comes to price. So how about 43%? Will you accept 43%? Mm -hmm. Damn! This <laughs> this girl knows how to like get more money. <sighs> Fine. How about how about how about how about 51%? How about 51? You'll you'll sell it to me, right? Damn, girl, you drive a hard bargain. <laughs> Tina, Tina, you don't like Tina. You know what? Tina is learning. She also has great business sense. She's like, nah, -uh. you can sell that for way more. I'm not selling you this for that little. All right, you can't trick me. <laughs> I may be young, but I am very smart. <laughs> Louis is an irresponsible spender, like a certain mouse who bought so much stuff from Dave. Uh, and Dave, 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 you know what? Dave had a good deal, so... <laughs> I needed more stuff for my shop. Can't help it. <laughs> Can't help it, see? So I get you to buy this. Um, how, how about 35%, you know? You know? Not, not, not too bad. Damn. Alright. How about, how about 40, 42%? 42% for your cherries. Okay, good. Okay, I think I have to buy things at around 40%, otherwise they will not sell it to me. Are you gonna sell me something too? <gasps> no. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Derek, you're my best customer. <laughs> that's right, Derek. You, you can pay this much, right? You know what? Just for you, let's make it even spicier. There, 111. <laughs> 111. Come on, Derek, you can buy it. No, oh, damn it, Derek. Alright, just for you, just for you. One, one, <laughs> 1080. 1080 for you, Derek. Yeah! <laughs> yes, Derek, yes! <laughs> My favorite customer. <laughs> Anything for his life? <laughs> oh, you're back again. Oh uh, yeah, a weapon? A weapon for you? <laughs> How about my most expensive weapon? <laughs> huh? That'll do it. Alright, Derek. Now I know I know I know you won't go like that much higher, but like how about another how about a uh, how about we reach the very edge of the 
just under 140. How about, how about that? Okay, just under 140. You can do that, right, Derek? <laughs> Damn it! <sighs> Alright, he's like too expensive, too expensive. Alright, um... You know what? You're my you're my best customer. For this, for this, because I suggested you would expect some eyes in, uh, you can get over 130. What do you think? No! No, Derek! What happened? Derek, no! I guess he didn't want it. I guess when he said, like, uh, that'll do, I guess he wasn't that, you know, into the item. I'm sorry, Derek. I'm sorry. I, I'll never do that to you again. <laughs> it's okay, Derek. <laughs> it's okay you don't know if you don't like arrows or bows. Um, <laughs> I, won't, I won't sell it to you ever again. Damn, Derek, damn. No, we broke our bond with Derek. He didn't want a bow. How could I be so stupid and I not realize that that was not what was he was after? Oh my god, the beef ball is so expensive. <laughs> damn, Derek. Damn, sorry. I'll never sell you a bow again. His wife has a very specific tape. You know what? That's true. Oh, Derek, you're back. You wanna you you know what? Your wife your wife always likes swords, right? When when she died, my grandmother told me to sell this off if I ever got into trouble. Well, you're, this is your grandma's people, Derek. I'm sorry, Derek. Your grandmother is only worth 40, 43% to me. <laughs> what kind of trouble did you get into, Derek? Is it because you didn't bring home a weapon? You didn't bring home a weapon because you didn't want to buy my bow? So you got in trouble? <laughs> you should buy my bow next time, Derek. <laughs> I thought he meant his wife died for a sec, now his grandma. <laughs> Alright, 43%. Alright, it may not be much, but here. Thanks. <laughs> I got Derek's grandmother's beef bowl. <laughs> not just grandmother, his dead grandmother's beef bowl. Any chance I could- Oh no, they keep selling stuff to me! I need to- I need to sell stuff to you! I can't keep buying stuff! I need to sell! I need a cell. 37. 40. <sighs> buy my stuff. Don't sell me stuff. Buy my stuff. <laughs> Please buy something. Oh, thank god. She wants to buy something for her mom. That's cute. Okay, 15%. <laughs> 15%. How's that? 15%. Damn it. Alright, uh, 10%. 10%, okay? 10%. There you go. <laughs> Tina vying for Dina again. Yes, that's right. See, you know what? This is Dina's strategy. Dina is like, alright kid, I know how you can get that shopkeeper to sell it to you for a cheaper price, so you go buy the stuff for mommy, okay? And Tina's like, alright mommy, I'll do my best. <laughs> And I come in here and I'm like, damn it, Dina. Damn it. <laughs> you know I can't sell it for more expensive to your daughter. <laughs> Ooh, takoyaki. Uh, not takoyaki. Taiyaki. Alright, buy it for... Buy it for... Is that okay? Is that okay? <laughs> yes. Yes. I need more money. I need, um, like $2,000 more. Oh my god, Louie, Louie, let me tell you, this is- this beef ball came from Derek's dead grandmother. Do you understand the value of this beef ball? <laughs> Do you understand the value of this beef ball, Derek? I mean, uh, the Louis frick. <laughs> but for you, for you, Louie, it's okay, it wasn't that valuable. You know what? <laughs> Haha, good one, that was a joke, right? Alright, yeah, <laughs> we're just kidding. We're just kidding, Louie. You know what? I know that you're hungry. I'll, I'll sell it to you for less. <laughs> Even though it, it was like a, you know, a dead grandma's beef bowl. You know? It's fine. It's fine. For you? 
For you, Louis? Because we're besties. <laughs> Louis is saving. <laughs> Louis is saving money. And I, it's okay, I'll sell him stuff for cheaper. Because he's my bestie. Derek was buying swords. <laughs> Selling beef balls. Oh, hey, Derek. You want a glove, right? <laughs> is it for your grandma? Oh, sorry. Oh, my bad. Your grandma's dead. Sorry. <laughs> Don't need a trauma dump on me, Derek, you know? Yippee! <laughs> Derek, Derek just coming in here being like, Hey, so my grandma died. It's like, oh, oh, I'm so sorry for you, Derek. <laughs> Uh, so anyway, will you buy this? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, so many customers! I have enough money. We're going to the dungeon tomorrow. My daughter-in-law asked me to pick this up. Yes. Yes, queen. Only the best quality for her. And for the best quality items, you gotta pay w at least 130. Yeah, well... 130. Damn! Guess you don't really love your uh, daughter-in-law <laughs> or whatever it was. <laughs> it's like I know the worth of my valuable items. Okay. You think you can uh, not pay for something that's so valuable? Nah. -uh. It will not happen. <laughs> oh, how, how, how's my store atmosphere right now, huh? Ooh, we're a little bit less plain. A little bit less plain. How long has the grandma been dead? How long has Derek still had that beef bowl? It's like she died that morning. <laughs> she just made the beef bowl and then died. And Derek's like, well, she didn't say. <laughs> you know what? The trouble was that the grandma died. The trouble was food poisoning from the beef bowl. Oh, we're terrible. <laughs> oh my god, Derek. Back again. My favorite customer. A shield? He's like, wow, swords, now a shield? My wife is gonna be so happy. Can I sell it to him for 140 yet? Ah, 139. Nope, okay. 134? Thanks, Derek. <laughs> You're the best. Yippee, look how much money we have. Ooh, Louie, good, good choice. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to need uh, 120 for that. Yes! Thanks, Louie. <laughs> Key, will you ever do tours? Tours? You mean like in this game? <laughs> Louie, you're alive! <laughs> the grandma died from her own beef bowl and then Derek sold it. Now Louie may just die. <laughs> no! <laughs> Louie, no! Oh, you want my bow. Okay, well, I'll sell you my bow. You know, Derek didn't want the bow, so... There is a bit of a uh, demand for this bow. Yippee! <laughs> no, I mean in real life. Maybe go on cons. Oh, you know, I would really love to go to conventions uh, outside of Australia. It's just that, like, it would cost a lot of money. Um, like I, I, at some point, I think it would be really cool to at least once attend like a, an American convention to sell there. But like, thinking about how much money it would cost is a little bit scary and also like um what kind of visa would i need or like if i don't require like a working visa or something like that like how much money am i allowed to make and then also like what are the logistics of like bringing all the merch there because like how much luggage am i paying for so it's a bit scary <laughs> it's a bit scary to think about Yay, look, we have so much money again! <laughs> Our money keeps going up and down, up and down, up and down. 
おはようございます。Good morning, Rosette. おはよう。Good morning. Incidentally, you are aware that today is the first day of collections, yes? That I can check when I'm on break, don't I? Or in the main menu? I bet you'd say. Indeed, this is only the first week of collection, so the amount to be paid is not severe yet. However, the amount is scheduled to increase weekly, so keep that in mind and do not get lazy. The bill is due at the end of the day, so work as hard as you can today, yes? Hi! Affirmations! We have 16,000 and they want 10,000. <laughs> Alright, so my plan for today is we will go to the dungeon. Wait, let's go buy some stuff and then go to the dungeon. It is quite expensive, yeah. Might come to Australia for uni. Oh! I'm scared of spiders. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Australia does have spiders, but, um,. No, don't be okay. It's not like I encounter a spider every day of my life. And like a lot of spiders are harmless. But the only ones you'd have to be aware of is probably like maybe if you go like bushwalking or something. Then maybe it's a little bit uh more common to find like, you know, more deadly stuff. <laughs> but hey, you know, I'm I'm living. I'm living in Australia. It won't be that bad. <laughs> But I don't know, like, um, you know, going to any other country to study can be pretty expensive. So I hope、uh, if you do come to Australia,、um, it will be within your financial means too. Because I know, like, how unis work is like they will charge international students way more than they do, like, a local student. Which kind of sucks, but I understand why they do it. Okay, well, we're gonna do a save right here. Save us. And, uh, let's do the town square. <gasps> Tina. <laughs> we're already in a different country alone for high school, so it's fine. Oh, okay then. Well, then you have a, then you at least have like, some experience and understanding of what you need to tackle for something like that. That's pretty cool though. Wow! Hey now! What's wrong? My dolly! Oh, the shoulder's been ripped! This is my favorite! Hey, wait! Can you give it to me for a second?、Oh, okay! Let's see. I have a little thread and a needle in my apron pocket here. And loop, loop, don't poke myself. And done! How does that look? <laughs> you, you fixed her! Oh my god, Tina loves us now. Yes, Tina! Now that you love us, we can charge you more, right? <laughs> you, you fixed her! Yay! Thank you so much, lady! You're welcome! I need to go now. Bye bye. Hmm. Not only are you good at sign crafting, we have a fairly deft hand at needlework, too. No, needlework. <laughs> What about you, Tear? I bet you sew a lot of stuff. Uh. Huh? There's no time for doodling. Where'd you next? She's really bad at it. Aw,、oh, never mind. You're not Sumuki. <laughs> Tear, you're not Sumuki. Oh, I think we're back. <laughs> I think we're back. I saw you guys in the chat being like, No! What? What's happening? And I thought, I thought you guys were screaming because I was spending money. And then later I noticed, Oh, wait, you guys are screaming because the connection died. <laughs> so, um, 
if, if it just like cut out that whole section, you might notice that my money went down. Because I... I bought some stuff. <laughs> <laughs> but, but I have enough to repay my debt, so that's... <laughs> it's all good, right? <laughs> it's all good. I'm gonna be so... I'm gonna be so poor. <laughs> Once I pay off my debt. But I'll be okay. It's for a good cause. I just bought more stuff for my shop. Anyway, we're gonna go back to the dungeon now. <laughs> I can never give Louie a better, um, sword. Do I have anything better than these items? Is that better than what he has? <laughs> I don't even know. You know what? Yeah. Let's just go. <laughs> Let's just go, Louis. Did I save yet? Um, yes, I did save. Alright. Let's just go. <laughs> Level 6 to 10. Uh, I don't have any items in my bag, so... I really wish I had a better sword to give Louie. <gasps> Ooh! Wait, can I give him- can I give him the helmet? Oh! <gasps> can I give him the helmet? Wait, was that better or worse? No, it was better! Okay, good. Nice. Give me a- give me a good sword, please. Oh! Oh, the, <laughs> they keep bouncing out from the floor. Statue. Damn it. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Every time the bunny like dodges. Please. <laughs> Save. Yeah, don't worry, I have enough money. I have enough! Oh! Wait. I just re <laughs> I just saw my money is not enough. Wait, wait, is it because I hired Louie? <laughs> um... Now, do I have? Do I still have time to sell at the end of the day, or not? Wait, can I sell something? Sixty. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! That is. Only a little bit of money. Oh no, <laughs> Mamma Mia! <laughs> Just do a shop day. All right. Well, you know what? I'll know for next time. I did not realize that I had to pay Louis money to to hire him. So that does make sense now. That does make sense. Okay, you know what? Well, we'll go to the dungeon tomorrow. <laughs> Oh, wait a second! Wait a second, if we're not- Oh, wait. If we're- if we're not going to the dungeon today... That means I can just buy some more stuff to sell. <laughs> that 
means I can just buy some more stuff, right? <laughs> How many food things do I have? Oh, I have enough food for today. Okay. Could I buy a sword? Do I have enough money if I buy a sword? I should have enough money if I buy a sword. <laughs> Okay, we're not gonna risk anything else. Let's go. <laughs> Buy my sword. <laughs> Buy my expensive sword. Buy my robe. It's more expensive. <gasps> Buy this. It's expensive. <laughs> we'll go to the dungeon tomorrow. Spoken like a true capitalist. Why do I have to pay him? Ooh. No, wait, Louis. I don't want to buy anything right now. I want to sell, Louis. I want to sell. Louis. I want to sell, not buy. How's that? Ooh. I have an authority that it's worth more. No, that authority is not my mom. Don't give me that look. I didn't think I'd get it at a good price. No! Damn it, Louis! <laughs> Don't fuck me, Louis. <laughs> Don't screw me, Louis. Don't screw me over. Please, people buy my stuff. Buy my stuff. Oh, I do have a book. I do have a book. <laughs> buy my book. Buy my book. Buy my expensive book. Alright, uh... How about... 13? How about 13? Huh? Oh, no. How about 14? How about 14? Damn it. Alright, uh, how about 10? How about 10? No! No! Girl! I fixed your doll! I thought we were on good terms. Girl! Okay, buy my, buy my hat, buy my hat, buy my, <laughs> buy my hat! No, 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 buy my hat, buy my hat! Buy my hat! $4,000 more, please! Buy my stuff. Buy my stuff. Buy it. Buy it, girl. Buy it this time. Oh. Okay, I guess she just didn't like the book. <laughs> yes. Yes, girl. Buy my stuff. Yes. <laughs> Buy my food. Buy my beef bowl. <laughs> no, not even my beef bowl. Buy Derek's grandma's beef bowl. <laughs> Uh, there you go. Buy it. Yes! 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 Oh my god, we're so close! Give me the $10,000! Buy my- Derek, please! You won't let me down. You won't let me down, Derek. Damn it. Your haggling skin, uh, your haggling skills will win, miss. I'll take it. Thanks, Derek. <laughs> Thanks, Derek. I, I knew I could rely. Oh, I, I still have a hundred bucks. One hundred, one hundred. No! No! Oh, okay, it's okay. <laughs> still not the end of the day. <laughs> Buy my stuff. <laughs> Buy my stuff, people. <laughs> what's, what's the most expensive? Oh, that's pretty expensive. <laughs> Buy my stuff, buy my stuff, buy my- Oh, wait, that's 5,000. Buy my stuff, buy my stuff, buy my stuff. I need money to pay off my debt. To buy it. <laughs> no. Stop selling me stuff. I need money. I need money. Yes, whatever. I don't need your apple. Little girl. Get out of here. Buy stuff. Yes, Louie, I do have food. Okay, I'm gonna sell Louie something that's not too expensive. Yeah, take my candy. Hey, that's a good one. That's right. That's right, Louie. For you. 
I only, I only need a hundred dollars, but that's alright. Yes! Yes! Yes, Louie! <laughs> I knew I could always count on you, Louie! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> this, this game is so fun. <laughs> I'm having such a good time. <laughs> Louis is so bestie gold. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Look at that money we have. Oh my god, Derek. Derek, you came out at a great time. I'm in a great mood right now. You never thought you'd find one of these? Oh. Well, you know what that means, Derek. You never thought you'd find it? Well, I have it, so what does that mean? I think you have to pay more. <laughs> yeah, you know what? That was unreasonable. How about this much? Yes! <laughs> <I'm scared. laughs> Why is this game so fun? Uh, just having the best time. You want one hat? <laughs> All right, tomorrow we go to the dungeon. <gasps> yes, Louis. Yes, that's what I wanted to hear. Yes, Louis. All right, for you, my friend, only ten. Only ten. Take it, Louis. Yes, Louis! Yes! Yes! <laughs> he finally has a good sword! Yeah! Ah, <sighs> oh, Derek, you're my favorite. <laughs> how, how much will you buy for? Three, 35. Yeah, no, no worries, Derek. Money we have. Oh my god, 69. <laughs> got some food? Don't worry, Derek. I got so much food. Here, have my most expensive food. <laughs> That's it, how much? Okay, so when they ask you to suggest something for them, I think you do have to like price it according to how they react to it. Because he likes this. He's like, wow, yeah, that's it. So that means I can charge him higher. <laughs> Would you pay 130 for cherries? <laughs> yeah! You okay, at, at the point where like we can start selling stuff to Derek for like 140, we're gonna be like, yes, Derek, all in, all the way. <laughs> yeah, I can pay off my debt. We did it. <laughs> Yes! Oh, confetti too! I feel so powerful. Ah, oh, capitalism. <laughs> so this is the payment for this week. Let me see. Congratulations! Well done! I've officially received your payment for this week. Let us continue to work hard next week as well. Yeah! <laughs> I did it! I... I'd like to thank Derek and uh, Louis for being my besties. <laughs> Shout out to Derek's grandmother who died. <laughs> I'm counting on you next week too, dear. You know, my dad might be dead too. <laughs> what happened to Reset's dad? Will we ever find out? Oh, hello. Mm hmm So, this is it. That insolent little plebe- Oh my god, is this a rich girl? That insolent little plebeian- Plebeian? 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 Shop, which is the focus of so much rumor. <gasps> oh no, you a Ara girl? Ara Ara girl? <laughs> my my, it's so common. So dirty, so dull. How does that little pearl get people to come in, I wonder? <laughs> or her hair flip! 
Well, no matter. That, uh, this is the perfect opportunity to show that little shrew and this whole city what a truly elegant shop is like. <laughs> oh no! She is... She's the Ojo-sama! <laughs> oh, she's got a fairy too! Uh, you know, you don't have a store yet. It belongs to your parents? So, 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 silence, you insolent fairy! It will be mine eventually. That's practically the same thing! Oh, little shop reciter. <laughs> your days are numbered! <laughs> yeah, do it again! <laughs> and I told you to address me as young mistress! Is that... Is that an Amazon box? <laughs> Are you under that box, girl? Oh! My genius astounds even me sometimes! The best way to learn about your foe is direct infiltration, after all. And with strategic espionage ability such as this, I can't fail. Ano? Uh... Hmm. Metal Gear. You know what? I haven't played the Metal Gear games. But the box is iconic. <laughs> and the three sound. <laughs> The interior decoration is as seedy and plebeian as the outside. Is she Togami? Is she the Byakuya of the game? <laughs> My Byakuya Togami. Which means their selection of items must be astounding. What could it be? What sort of thing could that filthy little pearl sell? Perhaps some kind of black and white animal. A panda? A zebra? Monokuma? The ownership of which violates international treaties? Okay, I think she is talking about panda. Perhaps the most delicious apples this side of the Mer de Blanc. Perhaps one of those books father says I'm too young to read. Like Dorjins? <laughs> hey, yo, hey, hey, excuse me, the, the Dorjins are in, a, in the RET section of the store, girl. I don't think either of us are old enough <laughs> to be buying doujins, alright, girl? <laughs> She's like, ah, the world of doujin. <laughs> doujin she. I should be allowed to peruse <laughs> such fiction. <laughs> like doujins? <laughs> um. Oh, be quiet, whoever you are. You are interrupting my train of thought. Uh, could you come out of the box, maybe? At least? <laughs> it kind of looks weird on the floor here. <gasps> but that means... Uh... <laughs> well, then. Honestly, I shouldn't be surprised by this. I should have expected a foe as canny as you to break through my otherwise impenetrable stealth techniques. Oh, okay. Damn. <laughs> it looks like okay. All all three of these people right now. It's like that meme where it's like, "Thank God I'm the only normal person here right now." <laughs> all three of them are thinking that. Thank God I'm the only normal person here. <laughs> You are indeed worthy of being my rival. <laughs> rival? Ah, oh, no. oh, I really failed to introduce myself, of course. Oh my god! <gasps> Super chat! Thank you so much! <laughs> oh my god, real money! That's right, real money! <laughs> <laughs> Thank 
here. Thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. Why to Dunger? Hopefully I pronounced that right. That's right, guys. Not only are we earning fake money, we are also earning real money. <laughs> thank you for the super chat. You don't have to, but thank you so much. <laughs> ah, I failed to introduce myself, of course. I am the owner of the monolithic item store chain, Big Bash. Is that a parody of something? Big Bash? I can't think of anything. But she did have like an Amazon box on herself. Well, uh, to be specific, I am the owner's only child and inheritor. Alouette? <laughs> oh my god, I just think of... And an alouette. <laughs> Maybe I should give her, like... <laughs> no, it's fine. It's fine. Give her a posh voice. <laughs> alouette is my name. Remember it. Should I give her the uh, a, a accent? <laughs> alouette. Everyone around here calls me young mistress Alouette. <laughs> we'll figure out the voices. But you, oh my rival, shall have the privilege of calling me Lady Alouette. Uh, Big Bash? It's a massive ch store chain with a capital stock value of 15 billion pi BILLION! And a yearly gross profit of 500 billion BILLION! <laughs> oh, dear. I heard the commotion and came to see what was happening, but... Why are the two of you discussing Big Bash? I, am um, not really sure. <laughs> ada, ada. <laughs> Interesting. You also have a fairy. Uh-huh. Prime? Prime? Like... Hey, hey. That's your name, Prime? Like, Amazon Prime? Is that why her name's Prime? Yeah, yeah, what's up? How old are these girls supposed to be? I don't know, I think they're like 10. <laughs> but the oh, fairies no. are probably older. Oh, uh, mistress. I see, your attempt at infiltration failed. What? what are you talking about? Their superior detection abilities simply caught me off guard and overwhelmed my cardboard, that's all. A fairy! Dang, this one sure is sharp. You got a problem with that kid? I mean, you ain't here with a one too, so what's the big deal? <laughs> <laughs> Call me Prime. You could say I'm Aller, uh, the mistress's guardian. Oh, well, I'm Reset, and this is Tear. It's nice to meet you. Hmm. Yeah, real pleasure to meet you too, Bookworm. Uh, are you by chance referring to me? Shh. Like there's anyone else here I'd call that. Oh well, the pleasure is all mine then, bitch. <laughs> oh, no. Alright, mistress, we've introduced ourselves. How about we head on home now? Uh, what are you talking about? I'm just introducing half of the fact. The fantabulastic, amazing, incredibleness that is Alouette, inheritor of Big Bash. Uh. Shh. We stick around for that. We'll be in here all week. Come on now, we're going home. But I wanna okay. talk. I wanna. I wanna. Oh, uh, I wanna. What, what? What's that? Show off my ego. Gloat. <laughs> Check out my clout. <laughs> Reset, listen, and listen well. Enjoy your happy, carefree days as long as you can. For when I am through with you... Hey, hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See you guys around. Ah! <laughs> so, uh... What do you think that was all about? That was not dissimilar to meeting a hurricane in human form. She's still in my shop right now, by the way. <laughs> Laughing. <laughs> Wow, 
now. Do you think she'll be my friend and then I can borrow money off her? <laughs> okay, do I have anything expensive? Oh, that's pretty expensive. Oh, wait, the boots. Alright, uh, we're gonna save. <laughs> Look how much money we have. Um, I'm going to... We're finally actually gonna go to the dungeon. And it's a good thing I saved here. Let me just save one more time. <laughs> just in case we fail the dungeon, or if there's nothing really that interesting in the dungeon, we can at least come back here and start selling stuff. So, is there anything I can buy? Oh, wait, how much do we owe? 30,000?! I'm gonna have to not buy so much. <laughs> Um, I'll I say that, but I'm I'm still gonna buy stuff. <laughs> mm, I have some books, right? So I don't need any. Mm, 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 mm. And let's buy let's buy another beef ball. <laughs> And, uh, is there any weapon I can buy? That's pretty good. <laughs> Use all my money again. <laughs> okay. Do I have enough money for Louis? <gasps> Wait a sec. Louis. Louis. You'll take any amount of money, won't you, Louie? Wait, Louie. <laughs> Is there anything I can buy for less than 113? I can't. <laughs> Will Louie go for $8? <laughs> Okay, Louie, I'll, I'll, I'll give you a cheaper price. <laughs> uh, wow, we really we really got to go to the dungeon for eight dollars. <laughs> this game is great. Scamming Louie? No, 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 it's not a scam. I bet he would accept one dollar. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Okay, I think we develop a new strategy. Every time we want to go to the dungeon, we'll use all our money. <laughs> We use all our money so we don't have to pay Louie anything. <laughs> That's so funny. I thought I thought I would have to pay him like a certain amount of money so that he would even come with me, but he 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 just really he's just really accepting any amount of money, huh? He's like, hey, if you have more money, you might as well spend it. Oh, you only have eight dollars? Well <sighs> Alright. Alright, for you reset. <laughs> Ooh, what the heck is this? Red oil? Oh my gosh. <laughs> but that's so funny. Alright, let's do let's do like another two loops around this place and then go to the next level. Louie. Louie's my favorite character now. 
<laughs> the fact we could pay him eight dollars. Oh. Who, who are your favorite characters in this game so far? Is it Derek? Is it Alouette? Is it the little girl? Is it Louie? Is it Tear? Is it Reset? <laughs> who could it be? I like Derek and Alouette, and I hate, hate, hate Tina. <laughs> We're like, you can't pay me enough? Damn, you're going on the, the top of my hit list. <laughs> Ooh, what the heck is this? Oh, furball. <laughs> I thought it looked like a shell. Oh, this game is so much fun. I I'm glad you guys are, like, seemingly enjoying it, too. Like, I think, um, there's a good balance of, like, activities to do. And also, like, the writing in this game. Just, like, I don't know, it's so funny. And I like the art, the character designs are charming. This capitalism. <laughs> what more could you ask for? What is this way? Oh, here's the exit. I wonder if there's a way I can walk faster. That would be nice. <laughs> I like the new girl because of her resemblance to <laughs> Byakuya. Except for the case that like Byakuya would actually be rich and like... Um... Not be such a child. <laughs> At least when it comes to, like, presenting himself. <laughs> you know, I feel like Alouette has not seen, uh, has not dealt with trauma in her life yet, so... Oh my god, Louis is in double digits. Louis is gonna be so strong and also so cheap. <laughs> because I think um I think later on you can find new companions to take you into the dungeon, but I'm like, why would I why would I want someone else? What are the benefits of taking someone else when Louis Louis, you know, I can- I can hire him for eight dollars. <laughs> oh. Alright, let's go kill that last monster and then go to the next floor. It's a great game. I haven't heard about it before, but it's- it's a good find. Oh, the reason it's entertaining is because of Yuki, thank you! Yeah! Our money-grubbing ways! <laughs> Alright, let's, let's get out of here. To the next level! I wonder if, like, the, the next boss will be, like, um... A bigger version of one of these monsters. Like, the last one we saw was the big slime. So maybe it'll be like a... A big bunny? Or 
big tentacle thingy. We'll have, we'll have to wait and see, huh? Ooh, a stick. <laughs> oh my god, Louis. Louis seems so powerful right now. All I need is like one whack and they're dead. Oh, I can't carry anymore. Um, how's Louis' health? Do I have anything better than what I have? Probably not. <laughs> Let's get rid of this. I have no idea what the slime fluid's for. Or water shroom. That's enough. I want the chocolate. <laughs> Do you have a streaming timetable plan? Uh, no. I stream when I'm like, you know what, I have time today. <laughs> but I, I try to stream on weekends if I can. Ooh, what the heck is this? Charred lizard. Um, I don't think I'll be streaming next weekend. Because next weekend is Easter break, so I don't know if I'll have time. Like, I will have time, but I don't know if I'm going out, is what I mean. Like, to spend time with family and stuff over the Easter break. Uh... Get rid of something that's not that useful. Get rid of this. Oh, I didn't even grab the ingredient. <laughs> but yeah, like, um, for like drawing streams and stuff, that's very like spontaneous. If I'm like, yeah, I, I have time tonight, I feel like drawing. I'll do a drawing stream. But when it comes to games, um, I like to do them on the weekend, when I can, like, have a longer session to play. Like, for this stream, we've gone, like, four hours now. But, like, I'm having so much fun. <laughs> okay, let's get rid of some stuff. You know what? Use this. Ah, oh, damn. I'll have to figure out a way if there's a... If I can, like, increase the items I take back. That would be good. And very helpful. Ooh, nice. Okay, let's kill one more monster and then go to the next level. Yeah. <laughs> Ellie, every time you stream, it's midnight for me. I can watch now because I'm doing an all-nighter. Oh, I'm really sorry. I think that's that's just because like Australian time zone wise. But I mean, if we really enjoy this game, I could find some more times where we do like shorter sessions. At night time, so my night time. Because like at least this game, it feels like you don't have to follow the plot. Like you can watch the full stream to get the full story, but you don't need to. So that might be good. Okay, you don't want to throw away some of these. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Oh, it's okay, I leveled up. What? 
to you. You can stream anytime you want. If I did like the game, then that's a good idea. Yeah! Because, like, um... At least this game, it's not, like, too plot-heavy, in a sense. And it's like, for example, if you want to watch a VOD and you're like, you're like, eh, I don't feel like watching the full dungeon section. You can just skip the entire d dungeon <laughs> gameplay. And even then, you could probably even skip the uh, selling segment if you don't care about it. But I think, like, uh, why would you do that? <laughs> okay, I'm throwing this away. I think it's best to, like, keep some of the food items, just in case, uh, for the boss battle. Probably need it. Oh, there's the exit. I'm like taking all the food. <laughs> I want all the food. And the good thing is like if I have like excess food, I'll just go. <gasps> Did those rocks kill it? That's pretty cool. <laughs> I did not realize the the dangerous things could even attack the other monsters. That's pretty cool. But yeah, once we once we beat the next boss, we'll go back to town and uh, start selling stuff again. <laughs> the good thing about this game, I guess, is like, you don't have to give it your full concentration while watching it. So it's just like, nice background noise. Whereas like, um, the last games that I played, like, school days... <laughs> I feel like a lot of school days you did not need to like, pay full attention to. But at the same time, like, because it's so visual and it's all in Japanese, like, you would have to read the subtitles to understand what's going on. Unless you're just listening to my reactions of screaming and crying. <laughs> What's your time zone? Uh, I think it's like plus 10. I think that's what Sydney is. Plus 10, if that makes any sense. <laughs> like right now it's 3 p.m. Where I am. I think this will be a long stream. Uh, like, I don't feel tired. <laughs> I think I'm, I'm just having like such a fun time that I'm just like, you know what? I feel great. I don't have to like do too much talking, which is good. <sighs> mm. Oh, you know what? I'll, I'll use some food before I go into the battle. Alright, let's kill the last few monsters and then go fight the boss. <laughs> Ooh, candy. What can I throw away? <laughs> you know what? Get rid of the fur bowl. Alright. Well, I think that's good enough. Let's go... Let's go fight the boss. Ow. 
Yeah. Uh, it's a rat! What the? Yeah. Ah! Wait a second! <laughs> no, not the rat! Oh god! Ah! <laughs> no! Don't hit me! <laughs> it's got such a long range. Oh, get it! The rat's like, I'm the only rat king here! <laughs> and I'm like, no! No! I will be rat king! <laughs> okay, I think I think if it eats the mushrooms, it, like, dies a little. Oh god! Oh! Uh, mm. Give me a candy, give me a candy. Right. Only a rat king could kill a rat king. <laughs> I can't believe it. It didn't even hit me. I'm so powerful. <laughs> I can't believe it. I can't believe it. The boss was a rat. It's like they knew they knew I were coming. <laughs> Alright, what do I want to get rid of? If anything. Yeah, it's fine. I don't need an orange, I guess. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I can't believe it! Oh my god, giant rat monster. Does that mean there's gonna be like mini rat monsters in this dungeon? <laughs> That's so funny. Alright, let's go to the pub. <laughs> I can't believe it. It didn't even hurt me. That's so funny. Hey, hey, dear. Hmm? What is it? Why are the adventurers in the pub so often? Do they like alcohol that much? Well, adventurers certainly do enjoy their liquid pleasure. But a pub like this also handles quests for adventurers. Therefore, many of the people here are looking for work. Isn't that kind of stuff handled by the adventurers guild? The guild does also handle some quests, but remember, you can only hire a guild adventurer officially if you possess the guild card of that person, assuming they have one at all. Therefore, places like this tend to offer a different kind of quest. More daily, run-of-the-mill business, if you will. Clients do not pay as much as the guild-sponsored ones, but this sort of place is also far friendlier to rookies. However, if the request is too simple or moronic, it is likely that no one will even attempt to do it. Look, the request is posted up on the wall. Let's have a look, shall we? Um, let's see. Please find my lost kitty. Can I hire someone to stand in the chicken line for me? Please kill ten crows around the lo uh, the garbage dump. Green item offered. Can you... Can one of you hot studs be my... <laughs> Okay, I like that one of the quests, it's like, uh, can you stand in line for me? <laughs> and then this one, it's like, um, can a hot guy, like, be my... <laughs> pretend boyfriend or something? <laughs> like, what is this? Um, well, there's quite a variety. <laughs> While it is true that they are often used as glorified handymen, in a way, this sort of thing is a sign of just how much adventure is... Uh, wait of how much adventurers have blended into a daily life in this city. That's true. Hey, actually, we should do this quest. I mean, I'd love to help someone find their kitty. Uh, no. 
I'm afraid we cannot. Well, anyone can post a request. Only those registered with the Adventurer's Guild can legally take on such quests. So, I'm afraid that we cannot do anything listed here. You're just scared of cats, aren't you? Aww, that's a bummer. Tear in, in Tear's brain. Thank God! <laughs> I'm not! I am not looking for a cat, alright? A cat would eat me. Oh, no one's here. Wow, we have zero money right now. I can't even go buy anything. <laughs> How much do you need this week? I need $30,000. We're starting from the bottom. Okay, I think I will have to go buy some stuff, but we can wait. The price of candy has increased. Hey, hey, dear! What was that just now? Ah, that. That was a news flash. Important events are reported on, uh, are reported on for everyone in the city. That one was just a sudden jump in candy prices. So, if you're buying or selling candy, pay close attention to that. Sudden jump? In other words, sudden scarcity has driven the price of candy up. In general, that means that prices will roughly double. Double? I can sell it for 200? Inflation, isn't it? So a candy that sold for 300 may now sell for 600. Oh my god, Derek, come in here, buddy. What? Wait a minute. So candy is gonna cost a ton of money for the rest of time? That's terrible. How am I gonna survive? Wait, I'll buy all the candy in the city and keep it for myself. Well, maybe I'll share or sell a little, but it is candy. No, prices will stabilize after some time passes. Precisely how long, however, nobody can say for sure. For once, however, you have hit upon a good point. While it can be hard to predict price fluctuation, if you keep a fairly wide variety of stock candy, it is possible to take advantage of the situation like this and make money hand over fist. You can also try to take advantage of the situation after news comes in, of course, but it's hard to really make a profit that way. Whoa, this is complicated. Now I'm hungry. Well, it is quite a bit to take in all at once. So let's just see it in action, shall we? Ah, the news again! Watch carefully. This information could be vital. Oh, right! Louis the Swordsman bounced check at local cafe! Now the... Now the lamb? Uh, Louie. <laughs> Louie went to a cafe. He's like, oh, I'm, I'm just gonna give myself a little treat. A little coffee, maybe? <laughs> oh, I gotta pay for it now? Here. What do you mean? What do you mean I don't have money? <laughs> Did he get arrested? Did he get arrested? His check bounced. No, Louie. <laughs> And sometimes the news is like that. <laughs> well, for some people, it sure is vital. Run, Louie, run! <laughs> Louie! <laughs> Louie's a wanted man now. On the lamb is like on the run. Okay. <laughs> Louie couldn't afford a coffee. <laughs> this is so sad. I'm so sorry, Louie. Alright, let's put out expensive items. Do we have candy, though? Do we have candy to sell? Ha 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 ha. <gasps> we do. <laughs> Buy my candy. <laughs> Buy my double-priced candy. <laughs> it's because he didn't pay up the 
question. Oh my god, you're right. I only gave him $8. He didn't have enough for coffee. Oops. <laughs> so, oh, so it's my fault now, huh? Maybe Louis shouldn't have been so irresponsible, you know? <laughs> the story, it actually has progression. Louis's like, wow, eight, eight dollars. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go turn on the light in my room and come back. Chew, come back. Chew, chew, chew. Chew, chew, come back. Chew. Well, um, <laughs> Chew might be gone for a little while. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Let's, let's restart the, <laughs> the camera. Come on, Jew. Calibrate. <laughs> um, I think Chew's just gonna be <laughs> a little bit, uh, you know, she, she took a holiday. <laughs> <laughs> She'll come back when she feels like it, I guess. <laughs> wait, wait, maybe I have to stand up. There I go. Oh! Oh! <laughs> She's back! <laughs> Chew's on the run, too. <laughs> She's like, Louie's not the only one <laughs> who can't afford something. Alright, Chew. Are you... Oh! Chew! <laughs> Chill! Chill, back! Chill! Okay, wait, 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 I got, I gotta calibrate. Calibrate, calibrate. Stay here. Stay here, Chew. Don't fly away again. Chew saw you scam Louie and took off. Yeah, she's like, I don't want to be part of this. Yes! Yes, man. Buy my- buy my 600- 600 yen. Okay, um, so... How much can I raise it up to? Let's try 220 for now. Oh my god... Chu- Chu is frozen right now, but I assure you, it's out of shock. Why is- Come on, reset, reset. Not reset. Not reset here. Come on, camera. Pick up my face. <laughs> come on, camera. God damn it. Oh, well, whatever. It'll come back eventually. Anyway, yes. Oh my god. We're gonna make so much money with this. <laughs> I just wanted to turn on a light and now choose all messed up. <laughs> Okay, whatever, it's fine. It's fine. Chu will Chu will eventually come back to me. Use a weapon. Uh, how expensive? Take this one. Oh, <gasps> perfect, you need just what I wanted, alright. If it's just what you wanted, well then can you pay maybe 40? Damn! Alright. How about how about how about, how about 29? <gasps> Heartbreaking. This Hagley doesn't have a point anymore. I'm headed home. What do you mean? You came in here for a weapon! You came in here for a weapon! Dang. Oh my god, Chu was so shocked that she came back alive. She's like, I can't believe it. I can't believe Dave didn't want to buy my thing. <laughs> All right, keep buying my candy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Derek, I knew you would be here for candy. Alright, this is for your wife, right? You gotta get you gotta get your wife a little sweet treat. Have a 250. Oh! Yes! Yes, Derek, yes! <laughs> Derek, you're my favorite! <laughs> you're my favorite for a reason! Uh, <laughs> Alright, do you think he'll take he'll take um a high 30? No, nope, okay. How about 34? Yes! Alright, alright, we know, we know the old man, the old man can take a 34. <laughs> he can take a 35. <laughs> If Derek wasn't married and I liked men, I would marry him <laughs> just based on his shopping. I think you I think you shouldn't marry Derek actually. I think he he doesn't get a good deal. <laughs> but maybe his job pays well, so you know what? He's like, you know what? We're, we're set. I see you. I see you. You're in debt right now. I gotta help you, girl. You know, so maybe he's really, you know, like into helping the community. <laughs> Sell this. Alright. I know you like your 40%, so how about this? 90... Yeah, how about 41% for you, girly? Ooh, okay, how about a... How about a 49% for you, girly? Yes! Alright, 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 alright. Now, someone buy my statue. <laughs> buy my statue. Hey, could I purchase this? Oh, my cheap sword? Yeah, you can buy it. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I think so too, don't worry. Yeah, don't worry, Guild Master. <laughs> cheap sword? <laughs> no, don't worry, just 25. 25 buy. <laughs> Oh, uh, this game is making me so happy. <laughs> Louis! Oh my god! Yes. Yes, Louis. For you, for you, again, you're my bro. You're my bro. You know what? Let's let's get that Miku number. Miku number. Now, now this knife will be Miku blessed. Yes! Yes! Yes, Louis! You're so good, Louis! <laughs> Now, now keep running, Louis. They're after you. <laughs> Louis couldn't afford a coffee, but he can afford a a, a dagger, a knife. I mean, sup, <laughs> so, Louis? How you going? <laughs> Louis's like, you know, I may be on the run, but I still gotta. I guess I still gotta visit my favorite shop. Ooh, he wants a book. All right. How about how about 30 for the book? How about 28 for the book? Yeah! <laughs> Louis couldn't buy a coffee, but he'll always invest in Reseteer. So true, so true. It's a good investment too. <laughs> Alright, let's see what else I have. I think. Hmm. Should we go to the shops again tomorrow? Should we go to the dungeon again tomorrow? <laughs> 6,000. We should be fine. Because I think like going to the dungeon later is maybe not as good. I think you should go to the dungeon earlier in the weeks, so that you have items to sell. Alright. Dungeon tomorrow. <laughs> A bow. 35, 35. <sighs> 33, 33. Damn it. <laughs> Oh my god, Louie, welcome back. 
have Louis. Louis. How about. How about. 18. Thanks, Louis. <laughs> you should go to the dungeon just so Louis can have money for once. Uh, who said we're gonna pay Louis? <laughs> Hey, I've been looking for one of these. How about a 28? Mm. How about a 23? Thank you. <laughs> okay, keep buying stuff, people. Would you sell me this? Yeah, sure. I guess if it's like cheaper, you can sell it for higher, but if it's like more expensive, don't make it that high. Who knows? <laughs> oh, of course you can, Derek. Of course you can. You know what? Just for you, buddy. Would you pay this much? <laughs> Alright. Uh, sorry, sorry. You, you know, business is business, you know, my man? Um, so how about, uh, 36? <laughs> uh, every time, every time. I don't know. This game is like every time, it's like a hit of dopamine. You're like, yes! Ha ha ha, yes! Love it. <laughs> Love it when I get money. Ah, my spoon! <laughs> I'm okay. There's three identical men walking around in here. Well, you know, they don't have that many NPCs. <laughs> I'm glad the little girl isn't coming in, though. Is she like, eh, this place is too expensive for me. Oh no, we're still so plain! How can we be less plain? <laughs> Ooh, put a statue on. Anyone want to buy a statue? <laughs> okay, we'll go to the shops and um, also the dungeon the next day. Also, we're already at like 17,000, so I'm sure I can buy some more stuff. Ooh, hello, it's Prime. Hey, you mind selling this to me? So, you come from a rich family, right? You're like the servant or caretaker of the, the rich girl. So like, how much, how much would you pay for this? Is that too much? Okay, well, would you pay... Okay, let's just see if she would pay tw 20, 26 for now. Well, maybe, maybe, maybe the fairy, maybe the fairy isn't paid as much as. Oh. But you work for the rich family. Don't you have higher pay? Uh, well, never mind. I'll know for next time. She, she, she doesn't have that much money. The fairy doesn't have that much money. Derek, you have money though. Oh, uh, you know what? <laughs> the same item. Derek, you'll buy it though, right? You'll buy it. You'll buy it for 40. <laughs> you're, you're, you're right. You're right. You're right, Derek. Uh, that was a, that was me being a little rude. Have a 30, 38. Ooh, okay. You know what? He still likes me enough to haggle. So, you know what? I, you've, you've impressed me, Derek. You've impressed me. 31. <laughs> <laughs> The, the fairy is poor like Louis. Uh, uh, okay, if the fairy buys anything again, I'll know not to charge her as much. Got a scarf. No, Louis, I just sold my scarf. Why is everyone wanting a scarf? Oh, wait, I have this. You already have this, but you know what? Here, take it. Were you, Louis? 
for you, Louie. Give you a discount. <laughs> Louie's like, wow! I can't believe it! I got it cheaper than I would anywhere else! Yeah, that's right, Louie. That's because they're buddies. <laughs> Don't worry, I may have made a loss on that, but what I gained in friendship, right? Am I right, guys? See, now it's now it's justified that I pay Louis only eight dollars. It's all it's all balanced out. <laughs> the price of shields has decreased. Several incidents with fake high-class restaurants have left diners uncertain. Okay, so shields are. Shields are cheaper now? Oh! <gasps> I can't go to the dungeon. Well, that's not good. Uh, why can't I go to the dungeon? <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me, guild master. Was your name Dave? <laughs> Excuse me, why can't I go to the dungeon today? <laughs> Anyone at church? Nobody's ever at church. <gasps> I haven't seen you in a while. Hey, what's wrong? I dropped my hairpin. It's real important too. Oh, don't cry. I'll help you find it. You will? Hmm. Yeah, just leave it to me. And next time you're at Reseteer, why don't you pay me more money, huh, girl? Huh, girl? <laughs> Despite how she may look, Tear's a monster at finding things. Uh -huh. uh, pardon? Me? She can get into every nook and cranny and find anything. Really? I see how it is. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> it's like, well... <laughs> Her. I'm really glad we could find it for you. Yeah, thank you again, nice ladies. Mm -hmm. Wow, Tear, you're black as coal. Why did it have to be in a train of all places? Hey, you did great. And we can use you to warm up the store now. Are we burning? <laughs> Are we burning, Tear? Mmm, I love roasted fairies. <laughs> Tina will pickpocket them when they bend down <laughs> with that hairpin. <laughs> All right, let's go to the market and buy one of everything, just because we never know. What day is it? Yeah, we should be fine. <laughs> buy another expensive one. Buy another expensive one. What are these for? These are too expensive. I'm not gonna buy them. Um, oh my god, some books are so expensive. What are the what are the names? Less in fortunes. Le Pensieur. Wings of Elden. Will Wings of Elden Two. Do in do do. <laughs> Is that how you pronounce it? Do in fortunes. Booze of the world. Wow. Polite children? A book on child rearing and behavior. Its advice has single handedly reintroduced torture to, to society? What? Wait, maybe I should be reading the, in the descriptions of these things. What? I love cooking. A popular cookbook. It exhorts the reader to live dangerously. Go on, cook with poison mushrooms? What are, what are these books? Jordan's Lament, a bittersweet love story about Jordan, an ordinary man, modeled after a man who became a king. A tome describing alcohol of the world over, probably due to every copy coming with a sample. Sequel to that already huge book, now everyone has a lover, so the cost has become even larger. Wait, what? An informational magazine about our city of Pen Pensy? Topics range from store openings to politics to lunches. An adventure novel about a boy named Kuto who claims, uh, oh, who tames a dragon. The stone Kuto found in the ruins is... 
Kuto and Elden's second novel, Elden the Dragon has its wings torn off. Can they be restored? What in the world? Oh! <gasps> oh, I didn't I didn't realize I could look at information like this. <laughs> okay, so candy candy costs more, but you can also you can also sell it for more, so I should I should buy a couple of candies, you know. <laughs> and then immediately immediately the price tanks and I'll be like, God damn it. Hmm. Okay, the price is down right now. So, base price is 2,800. So I should buy items when their prices are down. I guess. And then wait for them to get priced up before I sell them again. I she, I she. <laughs> We're 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 trying to make money here, you know? It's a business. <laughs> okay, I have like very little money again. So let me do a save <laughs> in a different slot. Oh, I didn't save before I spent all my money. Well it's it's fine. Save us. It's, it's, it'll be fine. We'll be fine, we'll be fine, we'll be fine, we'll be fine. The price of daggers has increased. The price of candy has- No! You screwed me, game. <laughs> you screwed me. Candy is normal price again. Damn it! <laughs> Can't capitalize key. Ah, oh, shoot. Well, it's okay. I only bought three of them. I only bought four of them or something. <gasps> I can sell this. I can sell this. It's all right. I can sell this. I can sell this. I can sell these. Oh my God! Give me, give me the other dagger. Oh, my daggers. <laughs> it's okay. <sighs> we're, we're, we're not dying yet. <laughs> the candy may have gone down, but I have so many daggers. Look at them. Yes. Oh my god, Louie. I'm so sorry. It's worth double now. So, uh... You can pay for this, right? <laughs> yes! <gasps> oh my god. Yes, Louis, I'll save you. <laughs> I want to buy some food, no worries. I'm not selling you any candy though. I bought too many. <laughs> um, would you like a beef bowl? You know, I hear grandmas love it. This is it, right? Hey, that'll do. All right, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30 34, 33. 33. Aw. Uh, 30. Damn it! <laughs> he doesn't want the beef bowl that much, I guess. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. we'll be fine, we'll be fine. We'll be fine, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Look, look, at, look at all those swords. <laughs> look at all those swords. People want swords, right? <laughs> Derek, you want a sword, right? I'm present shopping and I could really use a weapon. Well... Derek, I don't know if you know. Daggers are really popular right now. <laughs> this is what you're looking for. Yeah, that'll do. How much? Alright, well, you gotta pay too much. And... 235. What do you think about that, huh? Oh, I could have charged him higher! 
Loki, I just posted fan art on Twitter. <gasps> you posted fan art? Oh my god, wait, 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 wait. Wait, did you add me? Or where can I find it? Where can I find said fan art? <gasps> there it is! Oh my gosh! Stop buying things at <laughs> Resident <Rest of tier. laughs> Impulse buyer key. Oh my god, this is so cute. Can I share it on screen right now? This is so cute. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. I'm so happy. Wait, wait, wait I gotta show it on screen. Oops. <laughs> uh, let's see, image. Thank you so much! Oh my goodness. I'm so glad that you're enjoying it so much, the stream. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. I'm, I'm so glad. It's like, it's Reset's design, but you gave me the... the ears. <laughs> you gave her the ears. And the little rat face. <laughs> that's so cute! My wallet with the flies <laughs> flying out of them because I'm so poor right now. This is so cute. You know what? We can we can keep it here. <laughs> we can keep it here for the rest of the stream. I'm so thankful. Thank you so much. I'm gonna I'll 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 uh, comment on the tweet in a bit after the stream is over. But thank you so much. This is so sweet. I was not expecting this. I'm so glad that you're enjoying this game. <laughs> Oh my god, you know what? <sighs> Why this beautiful piece of art? <laughs> Ooh, you want a you want a dagger, huh? I'm only gonna have to pay a pretty penny for that. Yes. <laughs> No, thank you so much! I really love it. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Araki. I'm so happy. Also, um, to Fizzy, who you drew my fan art I did for you for a while. I don't know if you saw it, but it's on YouTube if you want to check it out. Oh, thank you so much! I'll, I'll definitely check it out after the stream. Thank you so much, Fizzy! Hee 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 hee. Why my daggers? <laughs> All right, let's put let's put the artwork back here. So cute. <laughs> All right. What else do I have that's expensive? I guess I'll have to just check if the the dungeon is open the next day. One thousand. Okay, do not sell when priced down. Buy my hat. <laughs> Moral of the story, buy my dagger! <laughs> but Oh my god, hello. I haven't seen the lady in so long. This will be handy. I guess she likes clothes more. Um, would you buy it for 120? Because I haven't seen this lady a lot. Cheaper than that. You're gonna break my 69, lady. Okay, how about 15? Is she okay with 15? This was good shopping. Okay, I think I could sell it for more than 15 to this lady. Maybe that's Derek's wife? <laughs> Maybe, huh? Oh wow, she's, she really came back. Oh yeah, she really likes clothing. This is what I was looking for. Okay, let's try 18. <gasps> okay, she will take 18%. She will take 18%. I will remember this knowledge. <laughs> Louie! Louie, did you finally pay for your coffee? Oh my god, Louie. I'm so sorry. Why do you keep buying things when I have to charge more for them? Is that okay with you? Thank you, Louie. Thank you. <laughs> you 
You don't see her because Derek's always buying stuff for her. Uh... So true, so true. Yippee! Alright, how many days do I have left? Acceptable. Okay, what's the news? The price of accessories has increased. Best-selling book, Sisters Struggle, to have a sequel announced. Announced? Okay, so accessories sell well. Let me do a save real quick. We have four days. Do I have any accessories right now? A... Oh, ooh, oh my god, I have three. But that's not very expensive. Do I have anything else? Oh, I do. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Are, are these accessories? Oh, they are. Okay. <laughs> get, uh, get them off here. We gotta put them in the window. That's where the real money is. Alright, take the sword out. Replace it with these accessories. That's where the real money is right now, baby. <sighs> Which one's more expensive? <laughs> Buy all of my accessories. Why did I have so many? But you know, it's fine. It's fine because now, now everybody wants them. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna save my sword. I don't want to. I don't want to sell something too expensive. Oh wait, I wanted to go to the dungeon. Uh... Hmm. Well, it's fine. We'll sell. We'll sell some accessories then. See if we can go to the dungeon. A scarf. Do I have any? Did I buy a scarf? <gasps> Louie, I have a scarf. Ah, so it's easy. Uh, how about twenty-two? Nope. Sorry, Louie. <laughs> how about nineteen? Yeah! <laughs> Question: Does anyone here play or watch Undertale Yellow yet? I have not. Actually, I've only I've never played Undertale myself, but I did watch a couple of people play through it, so I don't feel like you know um, it would be necessary for me to play it. But I have not seen anyone play Delta Rune, so I'm like completely blind to Delta Rune, and I have also not seen anything about Undertale Yellow. So. Maybe, maybe in the future we can try a uh, Delta Rune because I don't know if anyone would want to watch Undertale when I think everyone already knows what happens in Undertale. <laughs> I want this. Can you afford it, girl? Can you afford it, girl? You never want to pay too much. Can you even afford it, girl? <gasps> you can't afford it, girl. <laughs> You can't afford it. I knew it. I, uh, I never doubted you, girl. <laughs> I never doubted you. <laughs> My grandchild's been pestering me to get a hat. I think I have some hats. I have a cheaper hat. in the forecast beware of sunstroke the price of shields has normalized help conserve water turn that faucet off when brushing your teeth 
Okay, I'm gonna do a save. What we're gonna do is we're gonna check if the dungeon is open right now, because I have no idea why it wasn't open the other day. <gasps> How much does Louie want? Louie, you increased your prices! <laughs> Can we make 30,000 in three days? I think that's a little risky. <laughs> I'm like, can I not pay Louie? <laughs> no, no, no one's ever in the chapel. <gasps> hey, Louie. <laughs> All right, finally to get a, uh, finally to get, wait. Oh, finally get to have a nice big lunch for once. <laughs> I'm so full. Wow, I never had this feeling. <laughs> Time to dig it. No! Louis, no! Oh no, Louis like oh, finally <laughs> finally some good fucking food. <laughs> like that one golden Ramsay meme. And now dog's here and gonna eat his sandwich or whatever. Oh no, Louie! <laughs> Woof! Uh huh? Woof! Woof! Uh, you're hungry too, huh? You look pretty- Oh no, I was completely wrong! Louie's just such a nice guy, he's gonna share his sandwich. Well... Alright, here. I'll give you half of it. Oh no, you know what? I feel bad. You know what? Louis, I'll hire you full price. <laughs> hey! Hey! Don't wolf it all down at once! Enjoy it! Woof, woof, woof. Murph. <laughs> what the what the heck is a murph? <laughs> Tasty, isn't it? I spent a long time picking it out. I hope you like it. Why is the chat talking about Sans Void right now? What did I miss? Louis really kind, isn't he? Oh, wow, I feel really bad for only paying him eight dollars. <laughs> to be honest, I thought he and the dog would end up fighting for the food. Oh no, I'm just like tear. That'd be a little too sad, even for Louis. Oops. <laughs> okay, I think I'm gonna go. Oh, what are you doing here? <laughs> Oh, hi there! Are you out shopping? Oh, hello. Yes, I was looking for some ingredients for lunch. There's a selection, though. Oh, there's such a selection, though. I can't make my mind up. Kind of amazing, isn't it? You can turn one dish into a lot of dishes. Or one of... Uh, or a lot of things into one dish. Uh, did I say that wrong? You can turn one thing into a lot of dishes or... A lot of things into one dish. It's sort of like magic. The way cooking changes stuff. I never thought about it that way. Oh, you're adorable. Tell me, child, are you paying taxes? <laughs> hmm, speaking of culinary magic, have you ever heard of the legendary chef? <gasps> Rami Ratatouille? What, legendary who's it? Apparently, there's a chef who takes the worst ingredients and turns them into food that can delight anyone. You know, things like... Slime liver salad, skeleton bone souffle, volcano crab cakes, things like that. That's, that's amazing, I guess. I have to wonder if it's actually edible, though. Well, I wasn't expecting to run into the lady here. Alright, these are, these are expensive things right now, and I don't want to pay for expensive things, so I'm gonna... I think if I buy this stuff, my shop will seem more... Uh, or less plain. So, I'm gonna buy some stuff to make my shop look nicer. Counter. Ooh, wallpaper. Starry wallpaper. Resort wallpaper. Ooh. Resort. They're gonna look like Jabberwock Island. <laughs> Ooh, brick floor. Sure. Louie's like, um, hey! Hey, uh, res reset, 
Uh, you saw that I just shared my sandwich, right? You're, you're not gonna buy too much stuff, are you? <laughs> I mean, right? <laughs> right? Right, Reset? <laughs> um, Reset, <laughs> you're not gonna... You're not, you're not gonna buy something, are you? <laughs> it's like, oh! Louis, you're so funny. Hmm. <laughs> How many of these do I have? Three. Nah. You know what? It's fine. I won't buy anything else. Let's try go to the... Let's try go to the dungeon. And Louis, I will pay you full price this time. <laughs> Louis, Louis is gonna eat today. <laughs> Back in the back in the dungeon. And Louie got paid well today, you know? So nobody nobody tried to kill me anymore. <laughs> that includes you, Louie. No more discount for you, alright? I paid full price. <laughs> armor too. Okay, are we gonna see a rat? Ooh, nice. <laughs> I love swords. <laughs> Ooh, another accessory. I love accessories. They're they're they cost a lot of money right now. Wazowski. in like three days. We can do it. I think we can do it. We can make 30,000, right? <laughs> oh my god. if you can't pay the debt, I think you just lose. It's just game over. Fish? <laughs> Did you guys see that? It's the fish flying in the screen. Let's go to the next floor. Ooh, what the heck is that? Bin fan. Ooh, what's this? Hot stand. Alright. Nut mix? <laughs> These nuts. <laughs> oh. Funny, funny. Ooh, a 
another pot stand. Is that expensive? Oh, 2,400! Ooh. <laughs> Alright, how much is a nut mix? This combination of nuts and berries is great for cakes or just snacking or eating by the bushel. Handmade pot stand made of checkered cloth and cotton, great for protecting tables from hot pots. Rather old fold, uh, rather odd folding fan. Interesting. All right, <laughs> keep going. <gasps> Louis level fourteen. the shield actually is important for this enemy. That's actually kind of cool. I like that there's a bit of, um, like, the way that they're facing matters. Crystal. That sounds expensive. <laughs> oh, 2,500! Sheesh! Hey, I love going to the dungeon. <laughs> you get all this stuff that you don't have to pay for. Except for Louie. Basically, just press one button. <laughs> well, two buttons, but mostly just one button. There was a way to run faster, though. But I think this is like the top speed. Well, that wasn't really worth <laughs> going down there. Okay. Tear just shoots her set and she can't pay her debt. Oh my god. It's like, well. Maybe. Maybe those organs will be good. <laughs> SP consumption halved. Great. Somebody, somebody thinks at once. Oh my god, Chloe! Lily's gonna be okay. I'm gonna leave the stream temporarily. Oh, no worries! Thank you for coming! We had fun. Because I'm having a great time. <laughs> oh, there's so many enemies back there again. Is it worth going back? Don't you need like 30k in two days? Hey, 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 it's okay. If I could sell all this stuff, you know? If I could sell all this stuff, 
<laughs> we'll be good. We'll be great. Oh my god, I'm doing good stuff on. I think I'll have to feed Louie if I don't level up soon. good to like explore the the rest of the level before you find the the like teleporter thing to the next level oh we already ran out of space um toothpicks that doesn't seem very necessary Like, oh, I wonder if the characters... Oh, well, actually, this is happening in a matter of weeks, right? I was gonna say, like, do you think the characters will grow up? But this seems like it's uh, not gonna go that far. <laughs> it's not like Fire Emblem or something. Um, what can I use? I not want. Powerful anti venom. Oh, that sounds pretty good. I'll throw something away first and then eat the orange. Or, hmm. This will still be here, right? If I come back for it. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, people! It's a bunch of Derricks! <laughs> what? 
Oh my god, Derek, it's time to die. <laughs> what, are, what are a bunch of Derek doing here? Hello, Derek. <laughs> Derek triplets? What is this? Oh my god, what are you doing here? Hi. Oh, we're set. What a coincidence meeting you here. Oh, Alwit, how are you? Ah, you're dungeon crawling as well, I see. And with such a seedy looking adventure, it's. Oh, what? My adventure friend isn't seedy looking. And we already did this joke already. <laughs> well, I suppose a seedy adventurer is appropriate for a seedy merchant. <laughs> yes, girl. Do you always? <laughs> Well, come on, everyone. Don't bother picking up the inexpensive garbage. Only the best for us. Well, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> Slasher! Oh my god, does that mean she hired all these Derricks? <laughs> she paid for so many Derricks. Well, bye, Elwit. <laughs> oh my god, Derek, fight him! Fight him, Derek! <laughs> Wait, Derek doesn't even care. They won't even attack Derek. No, no, fight, fight her! Come on, slimes, get her! <laughs> get her! She doesn't even care. <laughs> they don't even care about the other people. What is wrong with me? Ah. Uh, <laughs> the Derricks and the Alouette could not fight. Well, see ya, Derek. <laughs> oh, sorry. See ya, Derek. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. I was not expecting to see other people in this dungeon. Apart from us. <laughs> wow, there's a lot of stuff. What is that? Back scratcher? Is that valuable? <laughs> oh, 1600. That's pretty good. You know what? I bet the old man would like to backstra- uh, backscratcher. He'll be like, oh my god, this is the best thing ever. <laughs> um... Hmm... Drop something... And then just get the bread... Keep the bread back. Oh my god. Oh, nothing here. <laughs> you have to fight Derek. Well, it would have been nice to have fought, uh, fought him, but it's okay. You know, I can't. I can't attack my loyal customers. My best customer. <laughs> and if he wants to fight me, he better use the the items that he bought from my shop. You know, that's the only way you can do it. Here's the exit. Alright. Let's kill a few more uh, monsters and then we'll go fight the next boss. <laughs> That's so interesting that it wasn't a... Uh, it wasn't a, another rat. Like, we didn't see a rat enemy in this dungeon. Like, where did the giant rat come from?
the giant rat with the crowbar. <laughs> Alright, well... Hopefully we can beat the- Ooh, a yam! Oh, what can I get rid of? You know what, let me eat this. Alright. Mmm, wait. Is there anything I don't want in here? So cheap though. I'm like keeping everything that's like a bit more expensive. <laughs> but I also need enough food in case the fight's really hard. Ooh. Okay, get get rid of this. Oh wait, but <laughs> Get rid of this instead. It's only 300. This one's worth a little bit more right now. I just need to make sure that I have enough food in case um, I fight something really powerful. So... Uh, let's go. What are we fighting? Yeah. So, this is the lowest floor of the dungeon tier. Not precisely. While we cannot currently proceed any further, I strongly suspect that we can go in even deeper next time. Wait, huh? Why is that? The dungeons change shape every time someone enters them. Some theorize that they adapt to the strength of those who enter, and refer to it as the living dungeon phenomenon. The truth of the matter is unclear, however. Uh, okay. I wonder if the dungeon gets bored if it's alone. Oh, hello? Someone speaking. Is it is it you, Alouette? <laughs> so, uh, I'll just talk normally. So, who would make the f uh? So that would make the people who are foolish enough to enter a place like this the playthings of the underworld. <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> I see. I like the way you think, girl. <laughs> Who's there? Oh! Who are you? Ooh! <laughs> Woman! <laughs> and her name's Charm? Oh my god. <laughs> Evening. Name's Charm, the Lady Thief. Look at her! The thief! So, your treasures, valuables, and assorted shiny bits. I'll be taking them if you please. Uh, we won't let you! <sighs> Always the way. Well then. In that case, looks like it's time to cut some fools. We're fighting you! The lady thief! Oh my god! Ah! No, no, no! What the heck is that? Oh god, oh god! Oh god, what? Ah! Oh god, oh god, oh god! I, I have a feeling I do not want to step in those. Oh god, oh god, oh god, eat something. Eat something, Louis. <laughs> Eat an orange. That was pretty good. Die, lady! Oh god! No! Yeah! <laughs> Stealing my heart! <laughs> Freaking fracking ow! <laughs> Freaking fracking? <laughs> Let her say fuck. <laughs> Hell, I'm losing my touch getting beat like that. Um, 
Miss, are, are you okay? Ugh, I'm mortally wounded. I can, I can see the far shore. No, I, uh, um. I'm kidding, girl. Really, if you get this worried about every Burke who tries to slit your throat and take your lucre, 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 <laughs> ow, freaking! Hey, you really are hurt. Here, take this wound ointment. Um, <laughs> what the? Did you have that on you this entire time? <laughs> Sorry, tear. Louis like. Yeah. You didn't even offer it to me? <laughs> you two are a pair of oddballs, you know that? Believe me, she's the only round, strange object currently present. Please do not assume that both of us are nearly so foolish. Really? Seems like... Ah, uh, seems to me like you two make a good pair. I feel like she should get, like, the MILF voice. <laughs> uh. Well then, young ladies, I should scamper, but since I've been, meeted, uh, been beaten like a mutt, enjoy your treasure. You earned it. Wait, I'm Reset, and this is Tear. We have an item shop at the top of the hill in town called Reset Tear. Reset Tear. You should stop by. <laughs> I should, huh? I'll keep that in mind. See you kids later. Goodbye, Chime. Your day. Giving her our shop location. What are you thinking, Reset? A lady thief, huh? <laughs> she was kind of cool. You will forgive me if I do not think the same way. Uh. Hey. Are you jealous? <laughs> Absolutely not. Hehe. <laughs> I think you're jealous. Louis like. Standing here like reset. Why didn't you give me the ointment? Reset. <laughs> Ooh, what the heck is this? Very odd vase. Vase, vase, very odd vase, very odd vase, whatever, whatever you want to call it. Well, that's cool. We met a new character. so good. <laughs> I was expecting to um, die a bit more, actually. But I think it's good that we have so much food. How much is that very on vase worth? The price of armor has decreased. The price of daggers has normalized. If your glasses need adjustment, Talk to us today. Western Glasses Store. Okay, so... Where is the... The vase? Ooh! Ooh! Oh wait, no, they're priced down. I can't sell them. <laughs> um... Is there a way I can... Put this carpet on or whatever? I ask you about that? Tear? Tear, come- <laughs> Tear, come back here! Oh god, we're very plain. Very plain. So, don't put any clothes out. Because they don't sell very well right now. Mm. Okay, let me do a save because we just came out of the dungeon. So we have three days to make thirty thousand dollars. We'll be fine. <laughs> we'll be fine. Oh my god, there's so many little girls. Oh, you want my cheap stuff. So, when it's a low price, I'm gonna assume, like, I have to sell it, like, way lower. Will she take... 
Will she take 50, 55? Will she will you take five, uh, 55? Will you take 53? I see how it is. <laughs> I see how it is, Tina. You want my stuff when the price is low? Buy my stuff when the price is high. Come on, girl. No, don't come back. Why did she keep buying my lowest price items? She's like, hee hee, I'm gonna profit. I'm gonna sell this back to you later on. 55. Don't come here again. <laughs> Alright. Will you pay 30%? No. Will you pay 28%? Damn. That's not good. Oh god. <laughs> That's not... Great. Oh, how much does this cost? Twenty one thousand. <laughs> um, a flower vase with abstract designs on the surface. Did they just get a kid to doodle on it and it's $21,000? Holy moly. Well... Maybe we should wait until this is more expensive. <laughs> Do I have a hat? I do. Why are you buying everything when it's like low price? Girl, get it out of my store. Get out of my store! <laughs> buy something more expensive! <gasps> you wanna buy a treasure? <laughs> Would you like to buy a $21,000 thing? I guess not. Oh, but you know what? He might really like the back scratcher. Ah, oh, that's it. Okay. 37. 37 for the, scra the scratcher. Ooh. 30 for the scratcher. Yes. <laughs> Tina is a savvy business child. She learns from the best. Yes, yes, old man. You you know you want it. Yes. All right, I need two, twenty thousand more dollars. I need so much money. Wait, I should put some food out. Maybe people are, want food. Well, I got a... <laughs> a nut mix. Oh, <gasps> big yam. Buy my big yam. $2,000. Derek, it's been a while. My, <laughs> my wife asked me to get you some food? Alright. Derek, do you want... Uh, a big yam? Oh no, you want- <laughs> did your wife- did your wife want a bag of nuts? <laughs> did your wife want your bag of nuts? <laughs> oh. Or does she want a big yam? Give him the nuts, alright. <laughs> You know, uh, a bag of nuts. Ooh, okay. Um, uh, how about 35? <laughs> you know, you said it was perfect. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> Derek doesn't have his own, so he has to buy some. Oh my god. Fizzy. <laughs> buy my nuts. <laughs> I would like a hat. Do I have any left? Does this count as a hat? Because I don't have any hats left. Does this count as a hat? I don't think so. You can try, though. That's not what I asked for! Oops! Hey, technically a helmet is kind of like a hat. No, why do you want a hat too? I don't have them. I don't have any hats right now. So you don't have any. Buy my other stuff. Look at all the other stuff on display. <laughs> Yes, that's all right. You should buy the expensive stuff. <laughs> oh, he liked that. He had a heart there. Nice. Okay, what what is this? Change wolves? Oh, it's my resort wallpaper. Oh, look at that. Now, now, how, now, how do we feel? Are we playing anymore, Tear? <gasps> Ooh, we're not playing. We're not so plain. <laughs> wow, it's already been five hours. I know, right? Doesn't this game kind of just like fly, fly by? Uh, I'm having a great time. Let's keep going. <laughs> People who aren't in this stream and then check it out later are like, Whoa, why is it such a long stream? And then they'll watch and they'll be like, Oh, no wonder why. It's, it's pretty fun. <laughs> Alright, I need to make more money. <sighs> you... Oh! You came to my shop! Oh, not bad. This is a pretty nice looking place. <laughs> You know, is it really kosher for an employee to give a customer a face like that? A little smile was the basis for customer satisfaction. Oh, for a normal customer, that is completely true. For someone who openly attempted to murder us, however, this is the only face I have to show. Hmm. Well, it looks like she's got a different idea. Charm, welcome! You're not gonna kill me this time, are you? I'm so glad you came! Yeah, well, I kept wondering about this place. Nice store you have here, Reset. Ah, thank you! Make yourself at home, okay? Reset. See? I see all too clearly, thank you. That Reset's a good girl. Nice, trusting. Honest. Don't you agree, Tear? Of course I do. You don't need to tell me that. <laughs> I knew these two would be fun. Yeah, anyway, hey, Louie. <laughs> you want the baked yam? How's this? Thanks, Louie. I think I can start charging him more. <laughs> Ooh. Well, you know, that's gonna cost a pretty penny. Yes! Thanks, Derek. <laughs> Every time Derek's coming in, I'm like, <laughs> you want to buy my most expensive item? Oh, she's buying something! Not bad, not bad at all. How much? Alright, so I don't want to... Like... Can I take you to the dungeon or something? Let's try 12 for now. Oh, I'm lucky. That's less than I thought I'd have to pay. Damn it! <laughs> Alright, charge her more! Charge her more next time! <laughs> I 
A weapon. A weapon. Take my most expensive weapon. <laughs> yeah, that'll do. How much? Let's say 30... 36. Thirty? Yeah. I really like Charm. She's cool. Yeah, she's got a cool design. I wonder how much she costs to take to the dungeon. <laughs> if she's cheaper than Louie, maybe we have to go with her next. <laughs> The price of long swords has decreased. The price of accessories has normalized. Beware of fake items and scams. The Adventures Guild. Can you actually buy fake items? Okay. Give me. Our store is still so plain. How can we make it better? <laughs> oh my god, so many things are not good prices right now. Anyone want a $21,000 pot? Oh, you know what? I should put... I should put food in the window. Hmm... Take my sword back. Okay, I'm gonna do a save. Cause... We're like... A thousand... A thousand dollars away from our goal. Which is great! Wow! Um, so what I'm gonna do... Is I just wanna check... Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna check stuff. And if I don't like the stuff that we see, then I'll reload. <laughs> mm. So right now, I think they said that the swords were... Not as expensive. So I should buy them now so that it's better later. <laughs> oh, I should buy some hats. Because people want hats for some reason. Anyone here? Oh, hello. <sighs> Aya, you okay, miss? You look kind of down. Oh, reset. I'm tired for some reason. I wonder if I'm starting to get old and slow. If you're tired, it can help to eat something sweet. Sugar stimulates your parasympathetic nervous system and energizes you. <laughs> that sounds complicated. Anyway, you should go eat something sweet. Like, for example, candy or canned peaches from our store. I don't have any canned peaches. We have a lot of sweet stuff to choose from. That does sound good. Maybe we'll go have some chocolate cake. Thanks for the advice, you two. Aww. Aww, cake. Now I'm jealous. Nobody's ever here. <laughs> Why even check? Okay, you know what? Maybe I should buy some more candy. I think that's what they were trying to tell me. I should buy some sweets. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna check the... Oh! Oh, never mind. Wait, I can't even... I can't even hire the... The thief... The thief... The th thief... Thief lady. I can only have Louie. 
Brave but poor adventurer, balanced and easy to control. Use the swords, shields, and armor. <sighs> well, since I'm out here, should I buy some more stuff? Oh, uh, wait a second, it's tomorrow. I didn't realize that. I thought I had another day. Maybe I should just go back to my shop and sell stuff. <laughs> no dungeon for me today. Okay, hopefully, hopefully, um, that means if I see the thief again, I don't have to pay her, uh, I don't have to ask for less money, because she can't even help me right now. <laughs> She's not someone I can hire. I thought she was, because she was in the dungeon. You're gonna sell me chocolate? 40. Even he couldn't believe it. Alright, buy my stuff. A weapon. Buy this. Good choice. What did he say? Blasted tr shrew? Has left me without a cent. Is he talking about his wife? <laughs> He's like, my wife took all my money. I can't afford this right now. Uh, I can't quite afford that right now for no particular reason. <laughs> my wife. <laughs> no, what the heck? He didn't want it. God damn it. You need to buy my items. Yes, that's right! Grandpa loves Grandma's beef ball. <laughs> I think you have to see her more first, maybe? Maybe, maybe. She does seem like she has a unique design and, you know, dialogue, so I feel like she's important. <laughs> Buy something. Do I have any books left? Oh, I do! I have one book. Alright. 16. Mm. 13. Damn it! <laughs> Buy my stuff! <laughs> Yes, um, that is worth a lot of money, actually. Let's try it. Let's try 40. Yes, it is. You want my very expensive treasure. You're gonna have to pay for it. go to the dungeon tomorrow. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, old man. You make me very happy. <laughs> if only Derek bought it, you know? If only Derek was the one who wanted it. <laughs> gets rich day before rent is you, not clickbait. <laughs> Make sure you save enough so you don't go under budget when you fire the guy. Oh, hire the guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, you know what? Let's do a save. Right there. Look at that. $52,000. Uh, 
I'm so rich right now. <laughs> Derek, why didn't you buy my very odd base? I'm sure you would have paid for it. Aw. No, Derek, come back! He's like, what am I? Just a wallet to you? <laughs> Oh no, I don't have any more books! Damn it! Nothing's going right. No, no, it's okay. If you don't have any, you don't. Can't sell you something I don't have. Selling me this. 30%. 35%. Thank you for that! Derek is going through a rough time. His wife spent all his money. You know, that's that's true. I, I bet cut him some slack. <laughs> Alright, Derek. 36. 33. Yeah! Oh, I just realized Prime's in here. Oh, Charm's in here too, actually. Wait. You wanted me to buy your bread? 30... I think she... She probably stole this bread and is trying to make some money. <laughs> so, 30... 39%. That won't quite cover the liquid ever budget, I'm afraid. Oh my gosh, she just wants money for alcohol. Alright, how about... You know what? 50% for you. <laughs> you sure? I thought I'd get it for less. Damn it, Charm! <laughs> Alright. Buy her stuff for 40% <laughs> and sell her stuff higher. <laughs> You're selling me your statue? Uh, 36%. Thank you, thank you, Derek. Bracelet. Do I have any? Oh, I do. I'll have to sell it pretty cheap, though. Can you pay... You pay... 56? You pay 53? Yeah! <laughs> this game is so fun! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do a save quickly. Again. Because I wanna go outside and check if I wanna buy anything. Anyone in here? Nope. <laughs> Anyone here? Nope. I feel like because I have so much money right now, I should buy things that cost less while I have so much money. That's my that's my my current thoughts. Hopefully, these prices will increase again later. <sighs> All right, can I fuse anything? <gasps> oh, wait, I can fuse some stuff. What does this do? Necklace? The product of this fusion will be a mystery until you attempt it. 
I think we we just unlock some knowledge. <laughs> All right, so requires more things. I see. Okay, so all the items you get at the dungeon can be used for fusion. Well, why don't we try this? Fusing necklace. Ooh, a necklace with a magical blue stone attached. Who knows what a stone this powerful could- TEN THOUSAND MONEY! <laughs> oh my god, what am I doing? I should have- I should have been doing this like forever ago. <laughs> wait, 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 okay. I got a water crystal. Gilded sword, ooh. Intricately gilded, uh, gl gl gilded? Yeah, to, uh, intimidate foes. The edge might not be as quite as sharp as a pommel, though. Ooh. All right, let's let's do this one as well. Crafter's knife and a fin fan. Ooh, survival knife. Made for surviving in the wilds. Cuts rope, food, crocodiles, and throats of with equal ease. Wow, oh, yeah, that's nice. Ho, ho, ho. Um, I think... I think this has unlocked something in me. Ooh, a really good shield. I'll need another water shroom. <laughs> Survival knife, that's what Nagisuna stabbed himself with. <laughs> you know what? Maybe I should- maybe I should buy some more of these. <laughs> That's good enough for now. <laughs> I have some very expensive things now. <laughs> Buy my expensive things. Oh. Alright, what is it? The price of accessories has decreased. The hat boom has ended. Will the legendary ban on the walnut bread fishing be lifted soon? Walnut bread fishing? All right, get rid of the accessories. They cost. Oh my god, there's so many things that are bad <laughs> right now. Oh no, even the the expensive necklace is bad right now. Okay. Okay, change this out. Statue. <sighs> Expensive. <laughs> Alright, um, let me do a save. Again. <laughs> and should I should I sell stuff or should I go to the dungeon today? Hmm. I guess we can sell stuff. Uh, but it's not very good right now because everything, like so many of the items that I have are priced down. So if I have to sell all this stuff priced down, that won't be very good. You know what, fine. Let's just go to the dungeon. <laughs> Oh, someone's here this time. Here we are in the chapel again. <laughs> why does it? Why does that remind me of some kind of meme? Is it the oh shit? Here we go again. When I was little, I used to come here a lot, actually. Really, I must admit, you do not strike me as the pious pious. <laughs> I guess religious type? When you came to the chapel, you get a little stamp on a card. And with enough stamps, you get a piece of candy. So your primary motivation was the candy, not the faith. 
Yep. Every day, my previous judgment hit the sweet spot, it seems. Wow, she's like, <laughs> God? I don't care. I like candy. All right, let's buy some stuff. Um, but not too much stuff because this is the last day. Yes. <laughs> I'll buy some like cheap items. Ooh. Oh, and I also gotta remember I gotta pay Louie if I wanna go into the dungeon. Mm. Oh, I should buy a, a book at least because I don't have any books left. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I, I don't need to buy it anymore. Anyone here? Nope. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, 1550. <laughs> don't forget that you have to pay Louie again. Yeah, I do have to pay Louie, don't I? Alright. Let's go, Louie. Boss rush? Good thing we saved. <laughs> I have no items. Oh! You know what I should have done? I should have... I should have equipped some, like, um... Food. I should give Louis some food. <laughs> Because if this is a boss rush, we're going to need food. Alright, well... What's a good food? Oh my god, does that mean we have to fight the rat again? Okay, hopefully that's enough food. <laughs> hopefully that's enough food. Let's try it. Boss rush. Hit. Yippee! All right, the rat. Let's fight the rat. Let's fight the rat. Re Reginald Drips Drisby? Is that its name? I didn't realize it. Oh god! Oh god! I didn't realize the rat had a name. So I think the rat has to eat the purple ones. Or does the red ones not matter? Because the purple ones clearly help me. <laughs> yeah! Die, Reginald. <laughs> Drispy? Whatever its name was. <laughs> Does that mean I have to fight Charm again? 
What are you still doing here, Charm? Yeah. Oh wait, I should um have some candy. And more candy. And I should I'll eat when I have less health. Oh god. <laughs> okay, eat something. Oh my god. Girl, stop! What was the point of that? Wait a second, what was the point of that? It didn't even give me anything! That was not worth doing. <laughs> That wasn't worth it. God damn it, <laughs> Louis. Well... Yeah, that wasn't worth doing. Never mind. I had to pay fifteen hundred dollars to just do a boss rush that didn't even give me like any special prize at the end. Nah. No way. <laughs> Probably unlocks going deeper. Uh, if it does, we'll figure it out next time, I guess. <laughs> that wasn't worth it. Mm. Well, does that mean I should just go back to here? Oh, wait, no, here? No. Uh, I don't remember. Did I buy stuff and then save? Or did I not buy stuff and then save? Can't remember. <laughs> I can't remember. Wait, wait, wait. Do I still have my, um... Oh, right. I went outside because I thought, um, everything is, like, cheaper than it should be right now, so I went outside to buy stuff. I guess. Okay. Then let's go back to the other thing. <laughs> Cause I think I, I bought a book or something, right? Well, if we're gonna do that, and we're not going into the dungeon, let's go buy some more cheap stuff. <laughs> Let's just go spend some more money. Willpower ring. Uh, sure. Okay. <laughs> it's hard to like, um, be like, uh, okay, I definitely need to buy something now before it becomes more expensive later. So, let's just do this. Hopefully we can make, uh, $4,000 <laughs> before the end of the day. I think that's very likely. Derek, my man, buy something. <laughs> buy something expensive, my man. Perfect. How much? 
34. <laughs> I like how every time I buy stuff, you guys are like, No! Stop buying! It's the last day! Oh, uh, what did he want? A sword? A weapon. Oh, would you buy this? Or is it better to save it for an adventurer? Probably better to sell it to an adventure. Take this one instead. Perfect, huh? Will you pay 38? Damn. Will you pay 32? <sighs> Why? You said it was perfect. So when people want you to recommend items to them, will are they just not willing to pay as much? For a recommended item? I don't know. <laughs> Teacher's poll? No, Louis, you're selling me something! <laughs> oh god! Um... God, I really hope I can make my money back. <laughs> how about 43%? Um... How about... How about 48 cents? Yeah. Oh god, oh god, oh <laughs> god, $5,000, please give me $5,000! Prime! <gasps> Ooh, she wants a survival knife though. Okay, so I'm not allowed to charge you a lot. But would you buy it for 20? Way too high. Would you buy it? For... 13? Um, what? How cheap are you? Um, How cheap is this fairy? Stop selling me stuff, please. <laughs> please, I need money. I don't need... No, <laughs> Derek, why? I need $5,000! Okay, please buy it. Ooh, please buy it. Please buy it. Yes, buy it! Buy it! I need- I need $2,000! There are signs of a boom in long swords among men who know quality. The price of pieces of armor has normalized. Beware of adventurers without cards. The Adventurers Guild. Okay, but... Aren't they still cheap? I'm not selling my $6,000 sword for like $3,000. That will not happen. Alright, I need to make- I need to make, um, a bit over $2,000. <laughs> I thought you said long swords and long men. Yes! Yes! Love- love your wife. Love that she wants to buy stuff. Hey Derek, we have a good partner relationship here, right? Okay? Don't- 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 Yes, yes, buy my stuff. <laughs> Yes, I have enough money again! Everything's good. Okay, how much how much does she want stuff for? Oh, she really wants that knife. Okay, so 113 wasn't good. How about 11? I don't care what you think or smell. That's too much. What do you mean? You work for someone who's super and mega rich. Seven? What do you mean? How, how how am I supposed to deal with her? What is does she want money? Like does she want me to undersell the product? Can never trust Amazon again. <laughs> Hello. 
I can give you a hand on that score. How much for this? Er, how about... 20. Okay, she likes 20. Damn, how much does the fairy want for stuff? It makes me not want to sell stuff to her because she wants it so cheaply. At least Derek will buy stuff. <laughs> oh my god, what does he want a knife for? I'm gonna, I'm gonna like, scare the children off my lawn. <laughs> Much. Look, I have enough money again, guys. <laughs> the price of metal items has in oh, yes. The price of swords has metal uh, normalized. Prospective adventurers are encouraged to visit the guild's head of office today. Okay. So, what does this mean now? What's expensive? What isn't expensive? Swords? Ooh, the sword price is up. <laughs> Buy my sword. <laughs> Buy my other sword. <gasps> Buy my knife. <laughs> Ooh, buy this knife too, yes. <laughs> you walk past our store, you see a little girl is manning the counter, and the things in the window are just like deadly weapons. And she's like, hehe, <laughs> buy my stuff. Mm. Oh, armor. Oh god, okay, fine. Uh buy my armor. <laughs> and buy my other armor. And buy my shield. <laughs> and Buy my other shield. <laughs> Just buy it all. Buy my common shield. Buy my helmet. <laughs> buy it. Buy it all. <laughs> yes. 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 <laughs> Derek, buy my stuff. <laughs> so it can be 200 plus. Let's try. Let's try 42. Oh, sweet money! <laughs> sweet money! Yes, Derek, come back! Oh, we want that! <laughs> Every time Derek wants something, I'm like, yes! 250, 250! Oh, yeah! Oh, this is why we invested in so many, so many metal things before. Oh, you want this too? <laughs> All right. Uh, how about how about twenty, two twenty eight? Oh, he loved it! Yeah! Look how much money we have! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, this is the best feeling of the world. <laughs> Buy my stuff! <laughs> yes! Oh my god, they keep buying the expensive stuff! Oh my god, okay, how about how about how about two two would you get taken for 260? Yes, Derek! Yes! Ha! Oh my god, so much money! <laughs> hey, yo, I got 69,000! Yippee! Oh my god. That was the most exciting <laughs> round ever. <laughs> so, this is the payment for this leak. Let me see. 
Congratulations, well done! You've officially received your payment for this week. Let's continue to work hard next week as well. Yay, I did it! I got so much money! I'm counting on you next week too, Tear! Yes! Oh, who the heck is that? Alright, gonna work hard today too! Capitalism ho! Oh, hey, what's that girl doing outside the shop? Oh my gosh, is she a robot? <laughs> uh, she's kind of just staring into the shop. Does she maybe want to come inside or are our windows that gripping? Well, smile, Reset. Come on, smile, look friendly. <laughs> I do here. Please do not tell me you. Oh, uh, please tell me you have not reached the point wherein your face is frozen in a vapid smile for all eternity. Yeah. That's my customer service face, tear. Oh, reset. I mean, tear. <laughs> There's a girl at the window who looked curious about the inside of the shop, so I tried to give her my best come in and buy lots of stuff smile. Oh, she's not there anymore. She's right there. <laughs> I wonder why she it must have been. Oh, it must have. Oh, it must have been your sudden terrifying appearance, Tear. Yeah. So this So I'm terrifying, you say? Really terrifying. Uh, no. Um, that smile you have is kind of. Yeah. I, I think terror sounds about. She like chewing on my hair, <laughs> pulling my hair out. <laughs> Set, may I have a moment? Sure, what's up? Given how well you're doing, oh, thanks. I think it's time I explain how to take an order in advance. Take an order in advance? Up until now, customers have been simply purchasing items from us immediately. With the advance order, however, a customer will let us know what they want and return in a set number of days to pick up the items in question. Obviously, not every customer will want to do this, but if a customer tells you that they want something in so many days, it is an advance order, so try to take it. Only do so if you feel like we can fulfill the order, of course. Can I just give them what they want if I have it on hand? No, you cannot. If they simply wanted the item now, they would purchase the items now. The date is based on what is convenient for the customer, not you. So, if they want an item in, say, three days, then you must give it to them then. And remember, we must be open to actually sell an item to someone. Oh... I guess so if I promise that they'll have something, then I can't go to the dungeon that day. So make sure the store is open that day, or we cannot fill the order. Oh, right. Uh, I'll make sure the store is open on those days then. Also, people use advance orders to purchase multiple items at once. It is an excellent chance to sell many items in one go. So try to fill as many orders as you can, yes? Man, this seems really complicated. I will keep track of all our outstanding orders. If you need to check when certain orders are due, simply ask me whenever we are in the shop. Advance chaos! I'll do my best! Alright. So, is this all still expensive? Yes, it is. <laughs> Buy my expensive stuff. Ooh, wait, I should I should swap some stuff. Oh, 
Oh, 19. All right. <laughs> okay. So I think I'll open the shop this morning. And then we'll go outside and see if we can go to the dungeon. See if there's anything new. Yeah. earlier. Stained glass yayness! <laughs> Stained glass yayness! I'm glad you came in. What can I get you? Arma. What? Oh, is that your name? So, is that like Miss Arma? Like a last name or... Miss Arma negative. Armor. Are you a robot? Are you really a robot? <laughs> So, you're saying just call me Armor then? So. Affirmative. Well, I'm Reset. Nice to meet you, Armor. Reset. Yep. State the purpose of this facility. The purpose of? Uh, okay. To start with. So, that's about it. You can buy and sell items here. Wakata. Material Distribution Center. Understood. Material... Uh, yep. So, uh, what are you... I'm taking this object then. Uh, 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 wait, hold on! Is there is a problem? Well, if you want to have something, uh, distributed to you, you need to pay me some money, you know? Money. Term undefined. Elaborate. Um, I need to explain money now? Yikes. I better start all over then. Um, so how do I explain what money is? Well, the money we use is referred to as picks. So that's why different items cost different amounts, see? <laughs> A whole lecture. And that's when the hero yelled, this is the end of my journey! And that's why you need to pay for items in places like this. <laughs> she's like... That was... A lot of unnecessary information, but okay. Understood. I currently lack money, and therefore unable to perform shopping. Well, come back sometime. Well, that was exhausting. I hope she does come back, though. Tears like you wasted too much time. How much for this? <laughs> How much, you say? Let's see if, um... 260 will work. Or if it's too much. Ooh! Ooh! 260 worked. Oh! Hello! This is the first time you're in my shop. And not in a box. <laughs> my, even this racket chap has some nice things sometimes. Okay, how much can I charge her? Would she take, like... Would she take 300? <laughs> would you take her 300? <gasps> I'm gonna charge you more next time. <laughs> oh my god. Well, oh fine. I accept. Not too bad for pro. Yeah, baby! <laughs> oh, sheesh. Buy something more expensive next time. <laughs> if I want a hat with... What would be good? Okay, a hat. Good thing I bought some, right? Get my cheapest hat. I don't like you. <laughs> you never buy stuff for the price that I want it for. Here, 
15 percent there you go <laughs> get out of here buy my cheapest hat welcome well uh welcome to the rest of here two weapons come get them in three days okay thanks please come again well I have an order Okay, so I have to have two weapons ready. I'm sure I have enough. <gasps> well, you're gonna have to pay at least, um, uh, uh... Is 250 good? <gasps> <laughs> nice. <laughs> now I feel like I should be charging them way more if they're like so accepting of the price. The price of sweets has increased. The <gasps> price of accessories has normalized. Beware of fake items and scams. The adventurous guild. <laughs> You're so greedy. What do you mean? <laughs> it's all part of the game. <laughs> yes. Buy my stuff. <laughs> oh my god. Everything is priced up. What's the most expensive? Oh my god. Buy my cherry. <laughs> okay, I, I need I need to replace some of these items. Buy my chocolate bar. Buy my What else is expensive? Buy my sword. <laughs> Buy my... Oops, no, buy my helmet. <laughs> buy my... Um... Eh. Alright, let's go. I think I'm, I'll go to the... Um, I'll go to the dungeon tomorrow. <laughs> the game has changed you. I've always been this way. <laughs> I've always been this way. <laughs> hey, girl. Heaven, are you ever not bright and happy? Nope. A bright and happy welcome is the key to sales. And for that, Reset, I've got a bit of a present for you. <gasps> yes, we can take her to the dungeon! <laughs> Here, take this. This is... You have an adventurer's guild card? Darn straight. If you ever need the help of a professional Burke, such as myself, give me a look, okay? I will, thank you! Wow, we can take her into the dungeon. <laughs> like, abandon Louie. <laughs> um, well... Tear! Yeah. What is it? Oh, you... Tear, look! Charm gave me her card! <laughs> what? Is this a joke? You, a member of... Well, Reset's been good to me. Consider it my way of paying you guys back. For all the trouble earlier. Payback's important, you know. Right, Tear? I suppose it is. Hey, Reset. Mind if I borrow Tear for a moment? <laughs> what? Uh... I'll give her right back. Oh, I'll give her back right away. Don't worry. Oh, well, be sure to give her back the same way you found her. The same way? What am I, property? Well then, a uh, yoink. It stuns me that you gave her your card. What are you really after? Hey, Tear. Let me ask you. Are you really just some random dispassionate loan shark? What are you... Because, you know, I've been wondering... If all you're really after is getting that loan repaid, wouldn't it just be a lot easier to steal the house and cash out? There's nothing stopping you, after all. Except for one thing. That... Is not it at all. As an agent of Terme, I... Take a little bit, uh, take a little bit of friendly advice. The harder you try to spin some elaborate tale, 
the worse it ends up being at the uh wait the worse it ends up being when the web comes apart at the end haha <laughs> i said web because one of my traps is a web right <laughs> not that i have any room to lecture anyone on that front okay what is this is tear hiding something from me is she not actually paying my debt back like what is this <laughs> So, sticking to your guns? Just a loan shark, then. Unbelievable. Did you just give her your card just to ask me that? <laughs> Maybe I did. Guess I've been a bit of a busybody, eh? Everyone who comes through that door is like that. That girl. Something about her inspires people to care. I suppose she does that. Uh, she does at that. What is this hidden, hidden plot? <laughs> hey, are you guys done talking? Sure are, as promised. One intact tear, just as I found her. Well then, let me know if you need my help. I will, thanks again. Nothing. Later. Sweet, now we get to take, um, we get to take Charm into the dungeon. You interested in buying this? You know what, Derek? I am interested in buying your bread. No worries. <laughs> For you, I will buy that bread. <laughs> For 40. <laughs> oh, got a treasure. I do have treasure. Do you want a, a pot thing? Do you want a pot stand? What's this? An old but excellent fishing pole handed down from teacher to student. Nah, I'll get my pot stand instead. This is a nice little thing you're recommending. 29. Okay. He said it was a fair deal. I can charge him way more next time. <laughs> Did his dead grandma make that bread too busy? <laughs> It's like, it's not even his wife or himself that makes the food. It's all, it's all leftovers from the dead grandma. Ooh, okay, um... The high price, so I still have to charge 200, but... Let's charge... Let's see if she will take this. Oh! <gasps> That's right, increase the price at the last second. <laughs> you're sure with that? Uh, you're sure you're okay with that price? Well, no complaints here. I feel like when they compliment me too much, it means that I could have charged them more. <laughs> oh, you want bread? You, you want to sell bread? Here. 38%. Thirty-nine percent. <laughs> Get out of here, little girl. I'll buy I buy Derek's <laughs> stale bread, but I won't buy yours. Oh my god, you keep <laughs> keep trying to sell stuff to me. All right, forty forty percent. Forty-five percent. We we can't trust anything. Derek sells. <laughs> okay, let's try if you take 30, 31. Nope. 30. Yeah! <laughs> I will get every last penny out of you guys. <laughs> Would you buy it for 40? Aw, oh, damn. Did you buy it for 37? Oh. Damn it, Derek. <laughs> the price of armor has increased. Oh. Swords boom has ended. Beware of fire on dry. Oh my god, do I have any. I I'm pretty sure I have some armor. Isn't this all armor? Technically. 
Nobody wanted my sweets at all. Okay, new dungeon. Not just boss rushes anymore. <gasps> Whoa, really? Really, really, super really. Everyone's corner to the Amber Garden. Boy, I hope that kind of Amber. The Amber Garden? weird noises. Ah. Uh, oh, what, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, so if you should get a chance, we should totally go. I mean, who knows what kind of items we could find. Yeah, <laughs> items. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Well, then back to the floor with me. Um, right. Thanks for letting me know, Charm. <laughs> A new dungeon, huh? Wow, she was super drunk. Lily, <laughs> you got some food? Of course I have food. Who do you think I am? You know what? What food I'm gonna give you? I'm gonna give you my most expensive food. <laughs> What's the most expensive? Oh, no, but he loves beef ball. He loves beef ball. I have to give him the beef ball. <laughs> Drunk Charm got her alcohol from Derek's good dead grandma too. <laughs> oh my god. So I got my hands on this recently. Interested? Yeah, sure. Give me for 43. You're trying too hard. Take it down a notch, okay? You worry me. What do you mean? Wait. He was trying to sell it to me, right? <laughs> oh, wait. I get it. Because it was like a... It was a high-priced item right now. I had to sell it. Oh, I had to buy it off him for more. No wonder why. <laughs> he was like, whoa. <laughs> yeah, you're alright. <laughs> Damn, sorry, dude. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, you see, it's like, Grandpa wants the beef bowl again. Oh, wait, he's selling it to me. He's like, actually, <laughs> this beef bowl kind of contaminated, so... <laughs> my wife's been up in my shorts about getting a weapon. <laughs> How many, how many weapons did your wife want? Would you- Ah, uh, you know what? I don't wanna sell this right- Oh, but he could- Hmm... Would you buy my expensive weapon?
Or should I save this for Louie? I feel like I should save this for the adventurers. Okay, high price, so... 200 and... 260, how's that? I can, I can sell it for more next time. <laughs> Something metal? <gasps> hey, Louie, do you want my... <laughs> do you want my really good sword? Ah, oh, would, would Louie want my really good sword? Oh my god, look how much... Look how much the stats increase. No, what do you mean he doesn't want it? No, that's not quite it. What do you mean? What do you mean, Louie? What do you mean? It was a better sword than the one you had. Louie, what do you mean? It's not made of metal? Is the sword not made of metal? No, Louie, come back. I didn't mean it. <laughs> Louie, wait. She needs two weapons. I need them in three days. Do you think I can do it? Yes. It wasn't red, so it isn't metal. Oh, no! Dang it. Well, I'll know for next time. It's okay. Derek will never disappoint me. Derek, you would never disappoint me, right? Buy my 200% expensive hat. <laughs> Would you buy for this much? Would you buy it for... This much? No! <sighs> Damn. Getting too greedy. <laughs> 80,000? Oh wait, I already have 80,000! <laughs> Guys, I already- I, I already have enough money for the- the thing. Yippee! How's it going? Um, I'm learning that I'm getting very greedy. <laughs> but I've always been that way. <laughs> so... I think I need to talk to Tear. It's going good, by the way. The game is really fun. Mm, in three days... They want... I need four weapons. Oh! Oh my god! Whoa, this game can go on for a long time. Debt do I have? Wait a second, how much debt do I have? Oh wait, this is the time thing. Now I know that the gilded sword is not technically metal. <laughs> Check out the dungeon tomorrow. In fact, let me do a save. <laughs> That's right, I don't want to know how much debt I have because I would faint. Oh, a new character! Sorry, I'm eating watermelon right now. <laughs> Welcome to Rissachir! 
Huh? Uh, is this a boy or a girl? I can't tell right now. This place isn't nearly as nice as I thought it'd be. Can these people really get me what I need? Uh, excuse me? Okay, this sounds like a little boy. Well, I've got no choice. Gotta keep striding forward. You there, go fetch the owner of this place. I have business with him. Why are you assuming it's a him, huh? Are you a misogynist? <laughs> the owner? Well, you're looking at her. What can I do for you? <laughs> Surely you're joking. Don't waste my time, girl. Oh, This boy is cancelled. <laughs> huh? No, really. I'm the owner. Can I help you? Uh, sir? You dare make a fool of me? You must think I'm just some idiot kid. What? I, uh, but... You expect me to believe if someone as short as you owns this establishment? Stop playing with me and bring me the owner, now! Oh my god. He do not respect the short kings and queens! <laughs> Double cancelled. <laughs> <gasps> oh, you, you shut up! I am the owner, really! Oh my god, Reset just told him to shut up! Go, girly. Go! <laughs> what in the world is going on here? Why are you shouting at a customer? Tear? Listen, he's being... Good day. Some kind of a problem, I assume? Hmm. A fairy. Interesting. Not what I expected. A pardon? Physically s oh. Physically slight and at a disadvantage against larger creatures. But innately talented in administration and management. Quite possibly the only non-human race to easily adapt to human culture. By utilizing their unique talents. In other words, you must be the proprietor, Madam Fairy. Good day! Damn. This... <laughs> not only <laughs> sexist. <laughs> not only disrespectful of short kings and queens. <laughs> but also being like, hmm, a fairy, huh? Well, I guess for their species. Oh my god, chew, 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 live. <laughs> chew. Chew's a little frozen right now, but that's okay. <laughs> chew, you come back to me, won't you? <laughs> In other words, you must be the proprietor, Madam Fairy. Good day. Oh, anyway, this person is just like, yes. Well, I I judge a book by its cover. <laughs> is that like two zippers down the front of his robes or something? Like, what is this? There's so many layers to this robe. There's like one, two, three, three. Flappy things <laughs> all over the clothes. <laughs> Chew is sleeping again so she won't witness the misogyny. <laughs> so true. Oh my god! The pillow bug, thank you so much for the super chat. Did some. some. Uh, did someone say capitalism? <laughs> so true, so true. <laughs> Thank you so much for the super chat. Um, I hope you enjoy the stream. <laughs> Thank you so much. I apologize for having to raise my voice at your servant. Oh, well... Oh my god, choose back! <laughs> now, hang on just a sec. It's a pleasure to meet you, Madam Fairy. Ka... Kai... Kylo? Kylo? Kai... Kylo? Isn't that the name of that, like, cartoon character? <laughs> or is it Sy Silo? Is it Silo or Kylo? I don't know which one, which way it's supposed to be. 
Do you guys know how to pronounce this name? I would, I would appreciate it. But yes, again, thank you so much, Pillbug, for the super chat. I really appreciate it. I'll say Kylo for now. If it's if it's wrong, let me know. Kylo is my name. I'm a magician by trade, and I need to place an order for some reagents. An item order? Very well. What can we get you? I require three items specifically. A charred lizard, a bat wing, and a slime liver. I only need one of each. There's no dead uh there's no need for a precise deadline, but this obviously the sooner that you can provide them, the better it'll be for everyone. I can assume you will take the order. Naturally, we shall obtain what you need as soon as we can. Marvelous. Well then, if you'll excuse me. Uh you know, I um Silence, bot. <laughs> ah yes, you. Look, don't cause your boss trouble, alright? Pretending to be the only like that will only make you look foolish. What? But I am the owner! <laughs> Ban that customer! <laughs> now, now, there's no need to get so angry about this. <laughs> it's a simple mistake, nothing more. If it's so simple, then why do you look so happy about it? You, uh, clearly misunderstand me, yes, clearly. Kylo came here, caused chaos, and then left. <laughs> Tai was a weirdo. I almost made him as much as Tino. <laughs> Hello, welcome to Resetir. I'm looking for a piece of armor. Would you buy my shield? <laughs> Alright, so... Yeah, one, the two, three, three. How was that? Whee! Oh my god, we're, we're gonna hit... We're gonna hit six digits! Ah! Oh, hi, welcome! Yes, I'm so glad I bought so many swords! <laughs> Our, so uh, our sword investment is all paying off. How about 83? 283. Oh! Yippee! Derek, Derek's always got my back. <laughs> okay, Louis, I promise you I'll do it correctly this time. <laughs> okay, so he wants something... Metal. Tough clothes on metal? Oh no, it's just price up. Mm. Let's try the, the bow. If you recommend it, Reset, then it must be good. Yeah, that's right. Take it from me, buddy. <laughs> I would never, uh, you know, scam you. That's 230. Metal key. Well, the bow apparently is metal. <laughs> apparently, it is a metal. Yippee! <laughs> Which, I mean, bows can be metal. It's only the like, the pulley part, the 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 string part that isn't metal. <laughs> but even that can be like. Can it be wire? Clearly, I don't know enough about archery. <laughs> Can I get this, please? Would you pay two ninety? Oh! <gasps> Can I charge him three <laughs> hundred? I would never capitalize and profit off you. Trust me, Louis. You're my bestie. <laughs> Oh, I'm so glad that I played this game today. <laughs> I'm having so much fun. And I'm glad you guys are like really getting into it too. <laughs> the price of daggers has increased. <gasps> the price of metal things has normalized. 
We are adventurers necessary. Symposium has opened today. Wait. Here, what did they say? Price of armor has increased. Okay. Call it the dungeon today to check out the new dungeon. Uh, let me do a save. Look how much money we have. <laughs> oh my god, look how much money we have! <laughs> um... Okay, so... Do I want to go to the dungeon now? Or do I want to sell first? Yeah, you know what, let's sell first and then we'll go to the dungeon. Wow, lots of old men. <laughs> I've I've yet to sell a statue, girl. Forty. Forty-two. Get out of here. <laughs> give me, give me all your money. Capitalism. Oh my god, Twinkle. I think we were in France. <laughs> I think this game is set in France because there's a lot of French words and I don't know how to pronounce them. <laughs> Welcome to Twinkle. <laughs> Capitalism is going awesome, by the way. Thank you for asking. <laughs> we're like doing so well right now. Bleed him dry, hell yeah. I'm gonna get every every little bit of money out of these people. <laughs> yes, alright. He he accepted 270 just now, so I'm gonna I'm gonna try 280. 285. 2 280. Aw oh, damn it. <laughs> too greedy, too greedy. Too greedy. Dang. Oh no, Louie! And of course, you're selling this when I'm near broke. Sorry, Louie. Sorry, it's 200% right now. But you know what? For you, 208%. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, you know it. <laughs> you know it, Louie. I get you to buy this. 41. 48. Yeah! <laughs> okay, so <laughs> Twinkle. Oh no, choose stuck again. <laughs> Twinkle, if um if any French words come out, could you like help me uh like spell it out phonetically? <laughs> Do your best. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so we have a lot of money right now. She's a bit frozen, but don't worry about her. She'll she'll come back eventually. 
So I think right now is a good time to buy stuff again. Just so we have like some stock. While I have money. <laughs> Oh, you know what? I'm gonna- I'm gonna buy one of these polite children. <laughs> gonna reintroduce, um, torture to society. <laughs> Cause why not? You know, we already have child labor. <laughs> we already have child labor in this society. So why not some torture as well? Picking out your inner Celestia Ludenberg. Yes. <laughs> I'll do my best. Maybe that's the- maybe that's the impression I should have gone for for, um... What's it called? Alouette. <laughs> a character in this game. Oh, you know what? I'll buy a watermelon. Yeah, I'll buy a watermelon. I'm eating watermelon right now. <laughs> and then let's buy some... Weapons. Because... I need to have, like, four weapons for people. <laughs> mm. Oh my god, <laughs> Philbug again! Thank you so much! Speaking of having money... Ooh. <laughs> Thank you so much! Thank you so much for the super chat, I really appreciate it. You don't have to though, but I really appreciate it. <laughs> mm, okay, that's enough. That's enough buying stuff. Anybody here? What the? How peculiar. There's something shining in the fountain basin. Oh yeah! The coins in the fountain. Wow, there's a lot now. Uh -huh. uh, coins? Why are there coins in a public water display? You've never had the urge to toss a, into a, a, toss a coin into a fountain and make a wish? Just looking at that fountain kind of makes me want to. Can I make the natural assumption that you have been so abys abysmally foolish in the past to as to actually throw perfectly valid money into this fountain? <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe once. Or twice. Or thrice. <laughs> Are they gonna steal the money? That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> Is Reset gonna be like, you know what? I'd like I like some money. <laughs> Thank you, Philbug, though. <laughs> it's just like you, throwing the money into the, the wishing well. The wishing well of Super Chats. <laughs> oh, I haven't done it in forever, though, really. I certainly hope not. You don't have money to spare. Looks like nobody's here. Alright, let's do a save. Save us and then, let's go and try the new dungeon. Okay, so... Let's see... So Chime is cheaper right now. Mysterious Pretty Thief. Incredibly fast and deadly. Uses knives exclusively. Hmm... Okay, well, I should give her better weapons right now. And, uh, I guess let's try this out. <laughs> let's- let's try. Okay, you know what? <laughs> Chu, Chu, come back to me. <laughs> Calibrate. Camera off. You know what? Try it again. Camera on. <laughs> the 
the, the like calibration face thing is so funny looking. Come on. Oh, there we go. There we go. She's back. <laughs> oh, I need to move her a bit. There we go. All right. It's dungeon time. Sad we haven't seen a lot of Alouette. Yeah, I want to see her a bit more. Amber Garden. Well... <laughs> okay, Charms are not gonna have a lot of HP, so hopefully we'll be okay. <laughs> 38 HP, okay. Hopefully we'll be fine. We're Charmed now! Hopefully we'll be okay. <laughs> I think she... I think she works faster than Louie. Like, slightly faster. She got the Naruto run. Uh-oh. That's not I think I should have equipped some food. <laughs> that was probably a dumb idea not to give her some food. Especially with the first time using her. <laughs> Okay, if I can if I can level up before uh, I run out of HP, then it will it will be fine. <gasps> food, 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 food! <laughs> pick it up, pick up the bread. Oh my god! I'm gonna have to eat it. <laughs> I have to eat it now. <laughs> Please give me more food. More food or Charm's gonna die! <laughs> oh my god, what the heck? Oh god! Oh god! Oh no 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 no! Oh no 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 no! No 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 no! Ah! Um... I level up soon. <laughs> oh no! Ah! Please level up. Level up. <laughs> oh wait, an item. Come on, charm. You can. You can survive, right? Oh, still not enough. Maybe like one more enemy and then she'll let go. Yes. I still need more food though. <laughs> I feel like she doesn't have a lot of good defense, so every hit is really hard. Okay, I think I need to grind for her a bit. <laughs> and it's not good while, um... Keep getting hit, though. <laughs> Clearly, pro-gamer movements right here. Pro-gamer strategies. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah, why can't I bring Derek into the to the the dungeon? You know, I'm sure he would see me. I'm sure he would feed me well. <laughs> but that's cute. Does this mean we're never using Louie again? We're gonna die. <laughs> I have to hit them so many times. to get off this level as soon as possible. No, 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 no. no. might happen. As I was saying earlier, if an adventurer is injured while exploring for us, we'll bring them into our field and then we'll sh uh, we shall book it back home, as the saying goes. Normally, we would not be able to bring any items with us or loot otherwise, but thanks to the special little box the guild gave us, we can bring it at least one item. Okay, wow, well, that box is tiny. We can't fit much in there. Just so, choose carefully then. We can only pick one item, so make sure it's valuable. We'll do! Um, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna reload. <laughs> because I just gave her all my armor, so... Save Scummer, yeah, um... I'm sure you would too. <laughs> Needs improvement, yeah. Okay, um... <laughs> Wait, 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 was that the correct save file? Oh, yep, it is. <laughs> so, hmm. Yeah, we've been going for a long time. <laughs> okay, you know what I will do? We will... Attempt this dungeon one more time. And then what we might do is end the stream there. Right? <laughs> so... Let's get her some... Some, like, food first. To protect her. You haven't slept at all? <laughs> That's because you were doing an all-nighter, right? I hope- I hope you're gonna be okay. Alright, let's try this one more time. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna give her... What's this? Ring's power enhances the wearer's willpower, allowing him to shrug off physical blows. It can break. 
that in. Let's grab some apples or whatever food. Okay, that, that should be fine. We have like three food items. <laughs> Maybe add a fourth. That should be enough. <laughs> Let's try this again. <laughs> I love the stream. I hope you can join the stream more often. Key. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. And again, for the fan art, I really, I really like it. I'm really glad that you you even like took the time to do that. I hope you get some good rest later. Oh my god. But I definitely want to play this again. We'll continue our shop journey. <laughs> Run. Let's go this way. Better not increase the enemy's defenses again. Because <laughs> that sucks. Oh, what the heck is. Whoa! What, what the heck was that? Did it, did it look like I like ran faster for like one second? <gasps> Wait, can I equip this right now? Ah, oh, no. Can't wear it. So, it seems like Charm can walk faster than other enemies, so she's able to, like, dodge some attacks sometimes. Or, like, attack before they can attack her. Which is good. Oh god. Please, nothing kill me. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, thank god. <laughs> We're fine. We're absolutely fine. Nothing's wrong. <laughs> she looks like a bird from the front. <laughs> you didn't miss much, Twinkle. Key just died, yeah. Oh, uh, we might have failed. We might have failed one time. Our first dungeon failure? <laughs> but this game is really cute. And again, I, I've, I've been having a lot of fun with it. So if I ever, um... If it ever goes on sale again, or if you just feel interested in playing it, I would definitely recommend buying it. Enemy movement speed increased. Oh, great. <laughs> so I guess the effects are randomized too. Oh my god, what the hell was that?
happened? Um. Wow. <laughs> hey, she's already dead. She's already dead. Oh my god, this damn monster. <laughs> she's already dead. What are you doing? Um, anyway, we're gonna be safe scumming again. Can't you take Louie for this? I guess I could try taking Louie, but I feel like, you know, the game wants you to try taking... Um... It wants you to take... <laughs> Charm. This is not gonna go well. <laughs> We'll try this one more time, and if it doesn't work, well then, <laughs> maybe we'll end the stream and try again the next stream. <laughs> Is there an easier dungeon you can level her up in? I, uh... I mean, would you want to watch me go through the entire 15 floors here? Could she fight herself? <laughs> Could she fight herself? You can do a key, okay. Would it be a good idea? Would you want me to go through the entire first dungeon again? <laughs> I don't know. We could, I guess. You know what, whatever. Let's go for it. Let's try it. <laughs> we don't have to fight every enemy. But I guess let's try to get her to a higher level. And then, I guess after after we beat this dungeon, we'll end the stream for today, and we'll continue this game another time because I'm having so much fun. Ouch! I think. I think her knives are like a shorter range than Louis's sword. So I have to get like way closer to an enemy to fight them. I think that's what's happening. Damn wasp. <laughs> Come back here. Enemy attack power doubled. Chant to tweet the Kinayo. good. Oh, my God. Go 
go through the entire dungeon, yeah. Does that mean I have, like, I have to fight her at the end? do this off stream. There's no need for like grinding to be on stream I guess. But it's okay. <laughs> this will be the last thing we do today. And then we'll continue the story next time. Although I'm realizing now if I go through the entire dungeon there's no way I'm bringing like a lot of items with me, so I'll just like continue through this fairly quickly. I think what I'll do is I'll just like fight the less annoying things. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Every time the buddy Oh my god, Bill Mug again. And this is my last super chat for the night. Thank you so much. With all those super chats, you could have probably purchased the game as well! <laughs> I don't think it's a very expensive game. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! <laughs> but thank you so much, Pilfun. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm happy, thank you so much. <laughs> the rocks falling on me to be the reason why I die one of these times. Is there anything I want to get rid of? Hmm, let's get rid of this. to like maybe level, I don't know, 14, level 15. What the heck was that? Why did she run so fast sometimes? Is that like a special thing? I have no idea. Maybe I have to look up a guide, but I don't want to, like at the same time. I feel like it's more fun to play this without, like, going into it being like, how am I able to absolutely maximize my efficiency in this game? <laughs> because I feel like that's not really po the point of the game. It's just 
it's more fun when it's more tense and you're not sure if you can make it or not. Alright, let's go to the, the boss battle. That's the thing that the the kid, the kid, uh, the magician dude wanted. Okay, let's keep going. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna like. Yeah, there's no need for this piece of stuff. <laughs> ah, damn it. <laughs> It's like, what do you keep and what do you just throw away? Mm. I think it's important to keep the slime liver, because that's what the person wanted. Uh, Kylo. That's what Kylo wanted. Let's get rid of the slime fluid, though. If I want more HP, I can just go up there and get an apple. Okay. <laughs> do is I'll look up if there's any way to increase that inventory space because I would like to be able to <laughs> but maybe that's something that comes in like later in the game I don't really know A higher merchant level for more space. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought so. So I know Louie had a shield so he could block some attacks. If they like came right at him, but. Charm block in the attack. Ooh, nice sword. Knight's blade? That sounds really important. <laughs> How expensive is that? Eight thousand. <laughs> Alright, do not die. Do not die, Charm. We have an eight thousand dollar sword on us. Yes. Wash up. Ooh, 
Ooh, more food. Thank you very much. My sister got me some grapes. I'm gonna have to go help make dinner. This stream has been super enjoyable and had a good time cooking around with y'all. Thank you so much, Dizzy. Dizzy? <laughs> Fizzy. <laughs> I hope you had a great time. I mean, I know you said you just did. Oh, what am I even saying anymore? Anyway, <laughs> thanks for coming to the stream. <laughs> I'm glad you really enjoyed it. Um, I guess Twinkle. Her name is like Charm, like spelt Charm with an E at the end. Would you still pronounce that Charm, like in French? <laughs> again. The ch, the ch part should sound more like sh phonetically instead of ch, -ch. and the a is not a more like ah uh, charm like charm then charm charmy charme oh great <laughs> Charm. Charm. I'm gonna assume it's charm. The E in French sounds like like uh, not e. Shama. 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 I'm sorry, I'm probably butchering it. <laughs> Thank you. If there's any more French words. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, what, what the hell? I'm using so much food. Wait, can't recover any further? What do you mean? Oh wait, maybe the chocolate is for um, SP, not HP. Um... <gasps> wait a second, can't I equip her with the... Um... Oh, she can't use this one. No wonder why. Okay. Let me get rid of something. Oh. 
Oh my god. No, 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 no. <laughs> I don't think I have it. Um. Oh, I could eat the honey you put it. It's so much money. <laughs> no, it's okay. I'm about to level up. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Alright, where the heck is the exit? Oh, it's right at the beginning, that's why. <laughs> okay, we're at level 11 now. This will be so... It'll make me so angry if I lose. <laughs> if I lose part way into these dungeons. Glass, a romantic hourglass filled with a sand, a uh, star like sand. The shape of the sand make it inaccurate though. $30,000! Ah. <laughs> oh, thank you, Pillbug. Yes, go get a nice shower. <laughs> $30,000! I'll give you that for sure. Oh, she sounds she sounds like a like the Nadishko character, like the very prim proper lady. Oh yes. Can I help you? I uh think that uh I think I think uh that might be my line. Are you looking for something? <laughs> I'd be happy to help if you are. Uh no, that's not it. I seem to be lost somehow. Can you perhaps tell me where I am? Where you are? Uh, in here? That could be a problem. These dungeons alter their shape when a person enters. I'm afraid that giving you your precise current location is impossible. Oh, I entered a dungeon then. How surprising. <laughs> what? How can you... Oh no. Oh, oh, she's an Ara. She's an Ara Ara. <laughs> I was just on my way home from... Hmm? Wow, in some ways I'm kind of an old. How in the name of heaven do you get so lost as to end up in a dungeon? How indeed. I too am at a loss. Given how lost you seem to be, I don't think the trees... Uh, I, I hope the trees don't start shaking. What should I do now, though? Hmm. To begin with, I would recommend searching for a floor of the dungeon with a large red door. That will allow you to go... Uh, exit the dungeon. Really? Why, thank you, Miss Fairy. You are very kind. Uh, not at all. Be careful, though. Very well, then. Hmm. Well, that was unexpected. I hope she gets home okay. <gasps> where, where did she go? <laughs> she just disappeared into the wall. Where did she go? I bet that's supposed to be another character we can take into the dungeon later on. Damn it. You know what? Get rid of the clothes. Uh, 
Oh, that's not that much better. Did we even get her name? I don't think so. But that's cool, you can just like encounter random people in these dungeons. It makes it feel more lived in, eh? <laughs> enemy or the next big boss is the rat again. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I keep just eating it immediately because I don't have enough um, space in my inventory. <laughs> like a, a rat enemy though in the, in the normal dungeon area This is an SP item. Oh. Please don't die, please don't die. No. So you can only leave a dungeon every five levels. Otherwise, if you die, um, basically you you have to leave. <laughs> you have to leave and you can only take one of your items with you. Okay, let's go fight the rat now. Mouse with a grudge. Oh god, oh god, what, what? So, the mushroom spawned right in front of me, and I couldn't see. Oh god. If it eats a red one, its HP comes back. That's... that's not great. Oh. Why did that happen? Oh god! Please! Please no! Please! Please no! Please no! If only Louie were here, he would take it down. Oh god, what, what is this? I didn't know 
she could do that. Oh god, I'm gonna I'm gonna die. Do I have <laughs> do I have anything? Oh no, I only have the honey. I only have the honey. I don't wanna use the honey though. <laughs> Oh, I think I have to use the honey, though. Wait, that was SP! No! Oh, no. Oh, no. I... I don't have any food. Um... <laughs> Isn't that funny? <laughs> oh god, I... Oh god, oh god! No, 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 Please kill the rat, kill the rat, kill it, kill it, kill it now! her levels though she can't go like down a level right okay well I just have to take the most valuable item <laughs> which is probably this thing oh that sucks oh but there's the blade oh no oh that sucks Okay. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do a save. I'll save... I'll save here. I am gonna go back into the dungeon off stream <laughs> and do it myself. <laughs> and then by the time we come back next time, I will have um, leveled up... <laughs> I will have leveled up Charm. Shama, Shamer, Shamer. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it. But, um, hey. <laughs> That's what happens sometimes in this game, right? <laughs> anyway, I want to say thank you, everyone, for coming to the stream. I know it's been, like, a really long stream. But I had a lot of fun playing this game. Oh my gosh. Time just flew by. Um, so thank you so much for coming to the stream. <laughs> we'll continue next time. Hopefully um, after I've beaten the dungeon and gotten Charmer uh, to a higher level so that we can attempt the new dungeon next time. <laughs> but this was so fun. Oh my god. I'm so funny. Like, uh, no, I, I don't mean I'm so funny. I mean you guys are so funny for naming the NPC characters. <laughs> And all of that. We, we need to remember their names for next time. We got Derek, Tina, her mom Dina, <laughs> Dave. Mm. For the uh for Charm, Sham, Shama, Shama, Percy, that's right, Percy, our grandpa dude, <laughs> but spelled with like a purse. <sighs> Alright, thank you guys for coming to the stream. I'm glad that I could introduce Reseteer to you guys. <laughs> if you've never heard of it before, we'll definitely come and play this again. I I, ha I have to. <laughs> it's so fun. And we did pretty good, for the most part. Um, that lost dungeon is kicking my ass though, because she's not very high level right now, but <laughs> we'll do it again sometime and hopefully she'll be more powerful next time. Alright, I will see you guys next time. Next time we will we will sell items for even higher. I will have even more profits. <laughs> we will be even more part of the uh, capitalism cog. <laughs> Who knows if my dad will ever come back to me. <laughs> but yeah, thank you. Um, if you want to give the stream a like and leave a comment on it afterwards, I would appreciate it. I don't know. I feel like it doesn't really help too much in the algorithm, but you know, it doesn't hurt. It doesn't hurt. 
All right, I'll see you guys next time. And if I'm not back next weekend, it's because of Easter break. So if I'm not there, uh, take care of yourselves for Easter break. Hope you guys have a good public holiday or whatever. <laughs> All right, bye. See you guys next time. Hey. <laughs>